All right, let's go. Okay, let's see here. Uh, kill first frog at Spiritorial. Oh yeah, first frog it dies because it, uh, because Papyrus finally Papyrus finally dies. Hey potato, thanks for the good luck. I think somebody had an issue where changing their computer clock uh, made OBS crash. That didn't happen to me, but it's just a precaution I can take. Damn, a lot of things are happening in this ending. First frog, it finally died. Now that actually does count as a general monster kill, so... Let's see here. Uh, betray kill doggo, kill greater dog. How many times do you destroy Tomophobia? Um, not too many more, I don't think. She's alive for this entire branch. We kill her next branch. Uh, and then she's alive for the entirety of next branch. And then she's alive for the entirety of next branch. So we only kill her one more time next branch. Then we kill her twice in Genocide. And once in Hard Mode. So only four more times. Yo, what's up, Lega? It's going well. I'm a little tired, but we'll we'll push through. Hopefully. <laughs> I mean, I did accidentally almost injure myself this morning. Sort of. Ready for ending 61? That I am. Also, thanks for the 61 gay bits. I, uh, so... Now, my family and all of their infinite fucking wisdom decide... My, my brother decided to bring over the baby. And so she's over in the room next to mine and the door isn't shut, so she's crying and I wanted to shut the door. Because I'm trying to get some fucking sleep. And, uh... I, instead of getting out of bed to go shut the door, I went to lean. I leaned over in my bed to shut the door, and my hand slipped off the doorknob, so I fell forward, <laughs> and my like ear scraped against the other side of the doorknob because the door opened. Um, so that was kind of like a owl moment. I like scraped myself a little bit. I was a little worried at first because it was uh, bleeding for a bit, but then that totally stopped, so we're good. Just like a, a little scrape, that's all. Nothing crazy. Yo, we have IC encounter. Yeah, but I'm fine now. No major worries. A little bit bitter that they decided to do that today, but that's okay. I love ending 61. We're not there yet. We're almost there. Only three more branches. These are all pretty short branches. Uh, this one, this is a papyrus dead branch, which means that there are no uh, variants. We don't have to worry about consumables or the apron or any of that in this branch. Because, again, in endings where Papyrus is dead, there are no, uh, like, variations.
Oh, I have 24 health. Jeez. That's weird. Hey, Rival. Thanks for the good luck. Pulling out of my parking lot to go get Chick-fil-A. Yo. Have fun getting your Chick-fil-A charm. You look exquisite. Thank you, Captain Blade. I did just shower. Try to wake myself up a bit. Try to wake me up. Wake me up inside. I have to leave soon. Don't worry, Euphoria. You'll come back and you'll, I'll still be alive. Unless I pass out. I already got it. Ah, okay. Well, hope it's good. <sighs> I know you were so far ahead. Yeah, we're about 25 minutes ahead ish. Died a snow drake. Betray kill doggo, kill greater dog, kill papyrus. I I can do that. Wait, doggo has a betray kill? Huh. Oh, you have to pet specifically, not with a stick. I guess that's why I didn't know about that. I wasn't aware that there was a doggo betray kill. <laughs> it doesn't work with a stick, only works with the pet, apparently. How much money would it take for you to run this for the rest of your life? Uh, five million up front, and then I'm never streaming again. What's world record? My PB. So 27.14. Oh, excuse me. You have to check. Yes, because uh, petting on turn one doesn't do anything. Yeah, the only turn one action that does anything is stick, so. You're going to be all right. Why? That's how I feel right now. Why? Why did I do this? Hey, Fixie, thanks for the good luck. All right, I'm curious. So this kills? Wow! I did not know that. I don't need to get the snowman piece, no variations. Uh, what was the other thing I needed to do? Uh, kill greater dog, right? Yeah.
Did you wear the cat ears? I, I slept. Do you sleep with your headphones on? Doggy stay alive. I guess they take too long to kill. I think the uh, I think the kill route is min maxed on getting as much XP as possible while still uh, not breaking the the kill quota. I think that's what the like the goal of this is, because you need to sit at like a particular amount since. Uh, we're getting Exiled Queen and Exiled Queen and Exiled Queen with 10 kill endings in the same branch, so like... We have a Trill Kill Doggo, Kill Greater Dog, Kill Papyrus. Neck. Uh, so you guys are good to go. Ten total Tazgors, yep. Hey Ocean, thanks for the good luck. Fell asleep to ten Tazgors. Yeah, I didn't get uh, in the last three. I didn't get any more. I was one off for two of them. Ocean Bagel, I love Ocean Bagel. He's awesome. Try that one again. <laughs> hey Ocean, are you gonna fix the Afi's typo or are you gonna keep it? Because I think it's really funny. Afi's. Afi's! <laughs> I already fixed it, okay. Do we have done- have we done Timmy armor yet? <laughs> no, we haven't done Timmy armor yet. That's in like 20 endings. Oh! One more! Let's go! <laughs> so based! Alright, Papyrus. Your time has come. There will be no more... No more... Living for you. You've lived for too long, Papyrus. Your luck's just run out, kid. Oh, I'm about to act up. I finally got to kill his bastard, let's go. Square up, oh. So you're serious? Well, let's see if you can handle my fabled blue attack! You're blue now, that's my attack! <laughs> Dude, we actually get to fucking fight Papyrus. Unbelievable. Extremely rare crypt footage. Da, 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 
That was my friend. Oh. <laughs> Don't worry about it, you're good. Papyrus is a fight? Yeah, I know, right? Wait, you're telling me this guy has attacks other than just the two bone one? Warning, viewing of this tape is prohibited. Discard it immediately. Yokai, I think you're the six months. Enjoy your new badge and enjoy your frogs for another month. Yo, it matches your name too. The tray killing papyrus isn't faster? No, no, that's like significantly slower. Because papyrus will always activate his really cool regular attack um, at a certain percent of a uh, certain amount of his HP. But uh, sparing him, he goes through his entire fight. See, we skip like, I just skip like half the fight by getting him down. What the fuck? That's my special attack! <laughs> hey, shit ass! Wanna see my special attack? <gasps> Stupid dog! You made me look bad! Oh god. No, 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 wait, 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 no, 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 wait, 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 wait. Alas, poor Papyrus. Well, at least I still have my head. Meanwhile, Sans is just like, oh, he's gonna die. <laughs> All right, let's see. Get EBS, kill two Mold Smalls. Kill Temmie. Skip Mad Dummy. All right, cool. So I hear this branch has this thing called late early burn. If you're interested. Is that this branch? Ugh. Oh right, Papyrus is dead. Forgot about that. Hey Geodasher, good to see you. Good luck on finishing. I'll try my best. My dog is borking, by the way. He do be borking. Hello, Catboy. Hi, Minus. How are you doing? Oh, right. Yeah, duck. I keep forgetting he's dead, dude. <laughs> I just keep forgetting Papyrus is fucking dead. What's the dog's name? My fit my dog's name is Fitz. Okay, just double checking here. Uh kill greater dog, kill papyrus, get early ballet shoes, kill two mold smalls, kill Temmy, save at Undyne Arena. Okay.
rainbow colors. Hi, Tyre. How you doing? What branch are we in? Exiled Queen 1. We have the punch card? Not yet. Gaster. Where's Sands? Where'd he go? You get the punch card, you do the wrong warp, and bam, there's a soft lock. Thanks for watching. Alright, these two molds moles get to fucking die now. Go. Oh, oh yes. It's beautiful. Yes! Get to take out my fucking rage! Alright, next is MDS. Uh, I changed it, Captain Blood. Shay. What are you shaying me, Seagrass? Gotcha. What did I do? Yeah, what's up, Ghost was here. You killed the funny skeleton, true. Jeez. You know, that theme reminds me of Last Breath. Oh, no. Hello, Indian. Welcome back. Hello, Petey. Hope you're doing well. Did you sleep? <laughs> I slept, yeah. Nah, not the greatest sleep in the world. I did sleep, though. I, I did get an amount of sleep. Hey, it's gonna get better as time goes on as I wake up a little bit more. It'll just take me a bit to wake up, that's all. Me when Undertale Last Breath literally has an attack that's unavoidable.
Did you have any nightmares about waking up to me sending you a new skip? I will let you know that when I did wake up, I picked, pulled up my phone and checked my DMs just to make sure. I just had to be sure. <laughs> just had to be sure. Four for four? I'm not sure. That might have been late. We'll see. I'm not 100% on that one. Fucking, what is that pattern? Ah! I take an extra turn. Try not to make Jenna punch guard RTA viable. No! Four for four! No fucking way, dude. <laughs> That's impossible! What is that? Susan number fucking five in this run so far? I think it's my fifth one. What the hell, dude? <laughs> Alright, kill Temmy. That is... I feel like finding tasks on the GPC is finding RTA to be delayed. What makes you say that? By the way, you can tell how I, I saved less time via M, from MDS in that split because of how much HP I had. <laughs> I think that's really funny. Uh, oh, kill Demi, save it, Undone Arena. Okay, we have to actually, I whiff one dine here. Literally never before seen where I fucking whiff one dine on purpose. Let's go. I'm sure it's probably more optimal to just save at Enterlab instead, but I'm just gonna follow what the route says for now. It's the the optimal thing to do is probably to do one dine here, do a phase, and then save at Enterlab, and maybe even do LEDP, but who knows? All right, save. Okay, and then we kill. I kill and done skip Metaton. I'm still not sure about that almost killing her thing. Cause like... The Burnt Pan does so much more damage that, like, would it not be worth it to just, like, just max challenge through her as fast as possible? And then come back with the Burnt Pan? Like, 
It just does so much more damage. It's like over twice as much. Also, yo, PDFG of thing with it's seven months, you kind of lovely soul. Enjoy your frogs, and thank you for staying subscribed. Like, I, I sort of thought that to myself while playing AME, because, like... Uh, max challenge getting through or getting to where you can flee is, like, three times as fast, roughly. It's so much faster. Because it takes forever to get to Red Soul without the max challenge. Yeah, it might be worth it with two kills. If it's tested with one kill, then yeah, that's understandable. I'm just wondering if two kills would make it faster. Guys, I think we kill Undyne twice, right? Don't we kill? Don't we save here and then kill her twice to get the with with Alfie's without Alfie's? Yeah, that's probably faster. Like to do one dine, do one round of her, save. Go get Burt Pan, come back. That's what I was thinking, yeah. Like, not even fighter before, just like, max challenge through and then go get the pan and come back. I'd have to test that myself, but it felt- it just felt like it would be faster. I don't know, I had a, a feeling when I was playing it and trying it out. It just feels fast. This, really, this skip really makes you feel like Batman. Nah, you were stronger than I thought. Hey, thanks for the good luck, Wonk. Wait, those do two damage? Huh? Oh, they only did one damage. Is it dependent on how much HP you have? Oh, there's damage. They have damage scaling on them? Really? I think everything except Sans has damage scaling. Yeah, that sounds right, actually. I mean, it makes sense. Otherwise, Pacifist would have been really way harder than it should have been. So, having damage scaling makes sense for this game. Pacifist either would have been way harder than it should have been, or neutral would have been very fucking brain dead easy. Pacifist is already pretty challenging. Uh. Uh. Alright, no phone call. Neutral the rest. I don't know what my love is. I'm curious if killing Vulcan would get me a love up though. I uh, forgot I have the ballet shoes on, whoops. Uh, that's not the tough glove. Nope. Okay. Wait, will that affect the ending I get? No, it won't, right? Yeah, no, because it's under 10. Yeah. I 
I'm like curious if you can, you can scrunch out an extra level for Asgore. What ending is this? This is uh, Exiled Queen Without Undyne, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I know that monster kill shouldn't matter because we already we already had monster kills. I guess Undyne also counts as a kill, so it's actually a, it's, it's actually an eight now. I gotta be careful not to go over ten because that might actually affect the ending I get. <laughs> Yeah, to be fair, Chair, you can just save at lab. <laughs> like, if you happen to soft lock on any of the wrong warps, it wouldn't really it would be like a like a ten second time loss. Nothing major. Uh. Yo, Eddie, that's awesome. Congratulations. What would you say been the highlight of the run so far? Blizzard diversity scale. <laughs> the wordle yep gotta be one of my favorite genres of music <laughs> yeah undone moving to the right that was good that was good <laughs> that was what i was thinking of i was like there was one joke i made that was really good that i liked um undyne what what is what is Torianon? <laughs> <laughs> I don't care what they send, Alfies. I'm not paying my taxes. Yeah, Bacon, I just needed to make sure I wasn't offending any real p people, right? Like, you know. Wanted to make sure, like, you know, I, I don't like 
name dropping companies and stuff to give them like a bad reputation and whatnot. Like when I, you know, when I talk about airplanes, I like to make sure that, you know, I don't blame any specific like airline uh, for anything because I don't want to get sued or anything. So let's just make one up. You know, all, you know, the, the people that cause all my problems at the airline. Let's just call them Delta Airlines. You know, something made up like that. That's got to be all one of my all-time favorite comedy skits. <laughs> John Mulaney, Delta Airlines is one of the best comedy bits I've ever listened to. We delayed your flight for nine hours because we hate you! Now dance, you're a little fat girl, aren't you? What? Now say you're a little... <laughs> I'm a little fat girl. <laughs> Fuck you! We took off while you were in the bathroom <laughs> because we hate you. <sighs> God, so fucking funny. You know, if, the funny thing is, if you accidentally miss that skip, it's actually not the end of the world. Uh, because you could just do the two endings out of order. The next ending we do kills Metaton. It's literally the exact same thing, but Metaton dies. So if you accidentally miss that skip, it's not the end of the world. You just invert the order of the endings. Grabs a 40, smashes on the ground, and yelled, SCATTER! <laughs> so now, now there's a, you know, a building full of drunk teenagers all saying, FUCK THE POLICE! FUCK THE POLICE! <laughs> I'm so good. No, don't get frame perfect, Megal or Skip. You're so sexy. Haha. <laughs> Love you guys. Bye, Euphoria. See you later. Take care of yourself. Fucking salt and pepper diner is such a good one too. So we found out there's a jukebox. We could play any song we wanted. Seven plays for a dollar. So we punched in 21 straight plays of Tom Jones's What's New Pussycat. <laughs> You know, Butts New Pussycaps, one of those songs that is a dip in the middle. Kind of like Guns N' Roses, November Rain. You're like, oh, November Rain's over. No, it's not. So we're up there punching in the What's New Pussycats. My friend turns to me and says, wait, before we punch in the next What's New Pussycat, let's put in one. It's not unusual. <laughs> And what's new pussycat closes out and suddenly da 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 it's not unusual people went the the sigh of relief swept through the bar <laughs> That's weird what's new pussycat is a lot longer than i remembered <laughs> But then what's new pussycat closes out 
It's dead quiet. Not a sound. What's new, pussy cat? What, what? It's a song by Tom Jones, Nat Nat. What's new, Pussycat? Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's incredibly repetitive. Fucking, fucking, uh, wait, I'm level 9, it's okay, I can miss one, I think. I don't think I can miss one at level 9, actually, I think that's a lie, that's a lie, I'm a liar. I'm a liar. <laughs> no, actually, I think I can, I think I totally can miss one at level 9. Oh, let's go! Ha! <laughs> Eleven! <laughs> oh, yo! Purple Fox Zephyr, thank you for the tier one. Appreciate it. <laughs> oh, real suit. Alright. Oh, this one's with- okay. Kill Undyne, kill Vulcan Pyro, skip Metaton. All right, this should be Exile Queen without Papyrus or Undyne. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, fuck it. Yep, that's what I, that's how I meant exactly for that to happen. When you're green, you can't escape. Two dine? Well, it'll still be one dine because we, we're killing her. Bing, 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 bong, bong. Slap a fish! Woo! Wait, how is this 10 kills? Oh, because of Papyrus! Jesus Christ! Oh, I'm such an idiot. Dude, I was at 9 kills. If I had killed one more, I would have gotten the wrong ending. Holy shit, I'm glad I caught that. <laughs> Remember how I killed uh, Vulcan to see if I could get a level up last ending? I literally would have fucking... <laughs> I would have fucking got the wrong ending. I totally forgot Papyrus counts as a kill. Spear of Justice kind of goes. But honestly, I actually prefer Beta Spear of Justice over the final one. I get why they changed it. I, th I definitely think the new one fits the character, but in terms of the music, I prefer the original. This definitely, I think, fits Undyne a little bit better, though. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba.
I just like how the original beta theme starts off with her established theme, right? Because the Beta Spear of Justice kicks off with the like the the little flare that pops up in her theme when she when you meet her first in Waterfall with the virus. That... I like that it kicks off with that. Alfie's. No, it's not just a loot better. Toby talked about recomposing it because it didn't feel like it felt the fit the character as much. It didn't feel like you were getting punched in the face heroically. Toby Fox composing the greatest music you've ever heard. Only only plays when you fight the secret boss Fart Master. <laughs> yes, Silent, you can just spare her and it progresses. Stops where the battle box starts. You need to point that out, issue. BM. <laughs> <laughs> Darker, you're just mad I've ruined your favorite game for you. Oh, I just skipped the fuck out of Casper. <laughs> Bro, I just skipped the hell out of Casper. Let me tell you, if that cutscene was there, I would have skipped it. <laughs> I mean, it might have been gone. I might have killed Undyne so it wasn't there, but uh, if that cutscene was there, I would have skipped the hell out of it. Alright. That's... Undyne is eight, so I need two more. Uh, now I just need pie rope. You know, I'm just randomly getting a memory in my mind. I remember one time I raided Blue Sir after my stream ended, only to find out that he had literally fallen asleep. Like, he didn't even realize he was streaming, and he was just asleep. <laughs> and I fucking raided him during that.
How'd you save almost 30 minutes? I'm simply more talented than I used to be. Skill improvement. True. To be fair, the SGS has almost got entirely nullified by the fact that I missed Opera Skip in the first ending. And that I also had to make the greatest improvisation of all time and kill Muffet. Hey, I killed Pyrope, right? I didn't, did I? I didn't kill Pyrope. I, I fled from him, didn't I? Okay, I'll do Astigmatism instead. It can be any monster. It doesn't have to be Pyrope. It just has to be a monster. Kill the magic? Hey, yeah, fuck it, why not? Nice two minute times. Wait, what? How did I do that? I didn't even notice. I was like, oh, a nice seven second time save. I didn't notice the, the part where I saved two minutes. So what has you with your Discord bio? Really? What's up, coffee, coffee beans? Hey, King Aphrodite, how you doing? Yo, night days with the three gift subs. Thank you so much. Hey, bestie. Hey. Hi. Hope you're doing well. Gotta say, I dig the, uh, I dig the eyeliner and the makeup. Looking fucking good as shit. I am so tired. Your team won football? I went to right floor too. The incident! The right. <laughs> We do not speak of the right floor two incident. I had to think about whether or not I equip the pan. Cool, there's our monster kill. I hit a kuwad. From what it from the name of it, it sounds like you were on the right floor. Ha 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 ha! Thank you, Kenan. I appreciate it. <laughs> Hope you're doing well. Mr. Yeah, the Mr. Link 2K 3048 right floor 2 incident. <laughs> that was left floor 2, I think.
Damn, seems like you could skip Metaton. That has to be the dumbest thing in this entire speedrun. I'm so glad that's a thing. That was one of the cores. Yeah, certainly. That was that was a core of all time right there. That was definitely one of the cores. Out of all of the cores, that was definitely one of them. To be fair, KJ, I think I said that under the guise that people wouldn't start doing strats they won't do in runs. I'm still not doing pan launch. If that means I won't be competitive in the uh, the left floor three market anymore, I just I, I'm not going for that in a run. I could probably get like I think my 354 is my PB, so not terribly shabby. It could be a bit better. Is it too risky? Well, it's a down buffer, and if you miss it, you lose 10 seconds, so... I think I'm more likely to do e fast east-west than a run than I am to go for pan launch. Down buffers in this game are bad because if you down buffer, your cursor moves to stat. So you basically have to frame perfect it every single time because otherwise you have to deal with that and you lose a bunch of time to that. And if you miss it, then you'll go the wrong way on the vent. I haven't missed sand skip yet. Ah, you thought I was gonna miss it. Be honest. You thought I cursed myself. I am beyond such primeval jinxes. How do I keep saving so much time in new home, dude? This is Exiled Queen without Papyrus or Undyne and with 10 kills. <laughs> 10 kills on the board right now, just wiped out the underground. My friend just got down. I revived him and I'm heading southbound. Also nice. <laughs> Alright, 
All right, back to back to Asgore is not too bad. We're up in that ratio a little bit. All right, this will be this will be a long one. So it'll be yeah, exiled queen without Papyrus, without Undyne, with ten kills. Yep, that's right. Okay, uh, spare Undyne here. Let me just check. Uh, spare Undyne, kill Vulcan. Skip Metaton, do Alfie's Elevator, skip Staven, Judgment Hall. Um, that's a weird... That isn't phrased well. That's what... Okay, I'll point that out when we get to that ending. The, I think the route needs to be... Uh, grammatically corrected a little bit there. I think Typhoon did mention that someone was using their phone. Some of the cat ears? Hey Arlen, thank you. Frisk doesn't have an age, Fyfum. But yeah, Alphys is kind of being a stalker. <laughs> Why save in Judgment Hall? To be closer to Asgore. And also, it uh, gets rid of Monster Tail. Saving a Judgment Hall will get rid of Monster Tail in the next three endings, so... Skip Metaton. Do Alfie's elevator skip. Save and judgment. Oh, okay. Cool. So nothing special. Now. 
I got the sauce, baby. <laughs> I've got it in my brain. Frisk is meant to be whatever. It, it's whatever age. They're j for like ninety nine percent of this game. They are literally just a, pl a player standing. Bro, their sprite is so simple too. Very easy to imprint yourself on. None of the characters have a stated age, other than the fact that uh, Toriel and Asgore are really old. Eight. Papyrus is a frat boy? True. That's me. That's ballad and based. Hi love, how are you? I'm... you're... Y yeah Uh... Mm-hmm. Hey! Oh, for, from the rain. I mean... I wouldn't have a problem with the other thing. It's raining. Make sure you don't get too uh, soaked. <laughs> yeah, if I'm making dinner, say a Ew, Shay flirting with your girlfriend? Gross. I know, right? <laughs> Ew, cooties. How's your day going, Star? I hope it's better than previous week. I know this week has been stressful. Hope it's going good for you today. Gonna see Doctor Strange? Yo, nice. I need to see that. I'll probably see it this week. Goodbye, magic. Magic, more like mad dick. Future room looks like during the day. I this is normally when I stream, so. Alright, in case any any catastrophes occur, I'm gonna save there. Actually, I should save it before uh, I do Alf Alfie's elevator. The phone. The phone. Never mind. Uh, hello. There we go. Hmm, seems like you could skip Metaton. <sighs> no fucking way you could skip Metaton! No way. Ah! Everything's fine. Ah! 
The phone is actually relatively intact. It has like six screen protectors on it. Never mind, the phone is in shambles. It's utterly shredded, destroyed. Particles on the ground, bro. Well, so sorry has to- so sorry literally enables an entire ending. Also, we have to fight them at least once anyway. So, we had to fight them at least once anyway, and also so sorry a literally created an ending by accident, so. Alright, good night, fandom. Take care. So sorry, enables an ending. Uh, betrayed Undyne with date with challenge only exists because of so sorry. It'd be impossible to get otherwise. Uh, betrayed Undyne with date would requires you to kill a monster after you date Undyne, which can only be done after Left Lord one. Uh, there isn't a monster in the game that you can kill at that point that doesn't bring you above love one, which would get rid of challenge. Uh, because the challenge ending, you have to be ch uh, level one. Um, because So Sorry can be killed and doesn't give you experience, or an amount of experience, you can kill them. There are endings that are in the game that would be possible to not get. Yes. Technically. I mean, the, the code exists. Every ending could potentially, well, all the, every ending where Papyrus is alive could potentially have the challenge variation too, but it's just not possible to kill, like, Undyne or Toriel and still be loved one. Because in order for you to get the text where Sans is like, you really like a challenge, don't you? You need to not use any consumables, equip any armor, or and still be loved one. Which is, means that's not possible to get for any ending other than the family endings and the two betrayed undying endings. Because you can't, you can't kill Toriel, Papyrus, Undyne, or Metaton. But if you could kill them without gaining love, then you could get those endings. That could happen. But it just can't because of how the game is. Okay, this is, uh... I don't even remember what, which one this is. What ending is this? <laughs> this is Exiled Queen without Papyrus. Cool. Yeah, I feel like, like, we could access those endings if we had, like, Ace. But if we had Ace, this category would probably also be about 25 hours shorter, so <laughs> that'd be kind of neat. <laughs> One's ending 61 soon. We got another branch after, or we got two more branches after this before that ending. But they're pretty short branches. Oh man, my Asgore went down the toilet. Asgore did nothing wrong. True. So this was Exiled Queen without Papyrus. Next ending will be Exiled Queen without Papyrus and 10 kills. So what we're going to do is we're going to reload, uh, go to core end, save, kill 2, skip Metaton.
This is the, the, the this is very very similar to what we do in AME. Yep. Like this is very very similar to what we do for AME. Leave the room. Do the backwards wrong works. Save. Kill two. Oh, I see why it wanted... Wait. Hmm. Huh. I'm gonna disagree with the route again there. It shouldn't have you... It shouldn't have high rope in the route. It should have astigmatism so that when you have to... When you come to kill these two later. Uh... You don't have to, like, awkwardly flee one of them. Why does the punch card do what it does? So the punch card is a combination of three things that enable it to be possible. Number one is that if you move and press the menu at the same time, you will move that one tile in that direction or one step in that direction, not a tile, a step. Um, and you will also open the menu. And that can be done on top of cutscene triggers. Um, so that's the first thing. The second thing is that cutscenes, well, it kind of goes with the first thing. Cutscenes will not start until the menu is closed. Okay, thing number two, the punch card opens on the opens on the screen, and when you close it, it is hard coded to always set global dot interact, which is the variable that controls your ability to move to zero. So the punch card will always give you movement back when you close it, regardless of the circumstance. It does not matter what the circumstance is; it will always do that. Um, and number three is that when you use the punch card from the menu, there is a frame in between the menu closing and then the punch card appearing on the screen. So, with com combining all three of those things, you menu buffer onto a cutscene, you use the punch card, the one frame happens, the cutscene starts, the punch card appears on the screen, you close the punch card and you get movement back. It allows you to move during cutscenes. Uh, other things can also be done on that one frame. Uh, you can interact with an object during that one frame in, a, in order to store the text, which you might see me do a bit. It's useful for various things. Now watch this drive, true. So yeah, that's basically how it works. And uh, we're basically moving when we're not supposed to be able to move, and it causes all sorts of conundrums. And for a game as simply coded as Undertale, a small, like, insertion like that completely breaks it open. Jesus, I could've killed him there. George W. Bush meme. I... Yeah. Now watch this drive. I can't believe that was actually real. It's honestly kind of a Chad move, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, so this will be Exile Queen without Papyrus with 10. Reload. Do not do. Wait. Kill Metaton. Don't do Alfie's elevator skip. What? 
Okay. Well, we're not doing it anyway. <laughs> it's a good thing I didn't need to do it, because we ain't doing it anyway. <laughs> Also, yeah, I'm pretty sure you should still be able to do the elevator skip. I don't know why that's written there. It doesn't affect your ability. I mean, it's easier. You don't have to worry about, like, you know, you don't have to worry about Metaton's fucking phantom being in the way when you go back to kill a monster. Also, wait, what? Oh, wait, let me read that again. Don't do Alfie's elevator skip save in core end? Uh, no. That... That's supposed to say castle elevator. That's supposed to say castle elevator. You can't... How, do you, how are you gonna go back and save in core end? <laughs> do the skip and then fucking run back. Run it back. That's funny. Let the Wait, if you let the Metaton cutscene complete, it disables encounters. Wait, which Metaton cutscene? No, this one doesn't. What? No. I'm pretty sure this one doesn't. That's Metaton Neo, I think. I know Neo does. Neo shuts off encounters. I don't think encounters get shut off until, like, monster. Uh. No, because we kill Metaton, and, like, we used to do this in the uh, dog ending back in the day. Yeah, I don't think they sh get shut off until True Pacifist. Because that was what caused that whole problem in the first place, where you could, uh... Um... Yeah, that's what caused the whole issue in the first place, where you, uh... Could grind in True Pacifist. Okay, I'm just gonna follow the guide, even though I know this isn't correct. We should save here. Yeah, okay. <laughs> That's nine, by the way. <laughs> yeah, that's a little, that, that little ending should be rewritten. Man, they had time to rewrite the guy to uh, save one frame by changing the ending order, but didn't change an actual mistake in it. Nice. There's a long elevator skip. The way we do it is new. Also, you can't do it in True Pacifist, because uh, that cutscene is what sets the plot of that flag high enough to be able to date Alfie's. I think the guide is... No, this guide was updated recently. It was updated for MDS, but also it's Somebody decided to change one of the ending, uh, swap one of the no saves around to save one frame. Silent, did you walk into any of the Asgore cutscene triggers? Because those also update the plot flag. Yeah, I used to think it was something specific to that cutscene, but no, it is literally just the plot flag, nothing else. Understanding of that cutscene has increased significantly for me. I used to think it was what enabled you to date 
or whatever, or that it like, like Metaton, it used to be thought that Metaton wouldn't be counted as dead if you skipped Long Elevator, but that's not the case. That was a while, a long time ago in AME, we used to watch that uh, cutscene during uh, Dog Ending to uh, confirm the death, so to speak. But that's not actually a thing. <laughs> That's not how that works. Just how we thought it worked. Because we were big stupid. Thirteen. Oh, I'm smart. Yeah, I forgot I got another one. Okay. Uh, this should be without Papyrus or without Alfie's. There's a fucking fly sitting over there, and I want to kill it so badly, but it won't stand still. Uh, okay. Now we go back. Uh. I mean, we still kill astigmatism here. It, it it won't be the astigmatism we're thinking of, but it will be an astigmatism. What? Never mind. I'm still right. Yeah, that was before we saved. I'm very intelligent. <laughs> I'm very smart. <laughs> I forgot. I was like, oh yeah, we didn't save that. Right. I forgot those two kills we got earlier weren't saved. Alright, so this should be without Papyrus, without Alphys, with 10, Exile Queen, and this will be the last one for the branch. Yeah, this will be without Papyrus or Alphys and with 10 kills. Next up is uh, all major endings. <sighs> oh, fucking hell. Betting on Shay doing Tazgors is masochistic. You, you know what, whose chat you're talking to, right? this drive. Damn it. <laughs> Wolf, was he just running around in rooms you can't get an encounter in? Because neutral ending should never disable encounters. I remember specifically doing the, the blindfolded playthrough and I went back 
to grind, uh... I went back to grind encounters. Because I don't believe neutral uh, disables encounters at any point. Yep, that's right. Alright, I believe this is a reset moment. Alright, time for the neutral branch, baby! So, who? how many of you have watched me do all major endings before? You guys like that speedrun? I hope you like it, because we're doing it again. <laughs> This is literally, this is, this is the neutral run from AMA. Like, this is the, the exact same, by the way. We kill Toriel, kill Papyrus, touch nothing else because we need to preserve dog ending. Also, 16 hours. Which branches have been done? We're currently on the neutral ending branch, uh, where we get five endings uh, that don't have papyrus in them. So in this branch, we're going to be getting Undyne ending without Papyrus, Metaton ending without Papyrus, Dog ending, No King ending, and No King ending with 20 kills. So that's this branch. We're pretty far, we're pretty far in. After this branch, we've only got two more neutral branches. And then it's on to, uh, just, the. Uh, Chat, I've just been gifted something. I was made aware that my dad bought something at Publix for me to, uh, that I talked, that I had mentioned wanting to try on stream. Give me a second. <laughs> Make no, I. <laughs> if you think my dad bought me a dress, are you joking? <laughs> That's hilarious. Is it the Mountain Dew? It's time. It's time to see if Mountain Dew Flamin' Hot is good. I don't think it's going to be good.
One fucking fly, dude. Go away. Dude. Flamin' Hot Mountain Dew is the most Florida thing ever. That is, a, it is, it is a global brand. Share. This is in literally all the states. Mountain Dusty, true. Oh God, yes. She knows she's going to die. She's getting it out of the way. She's just embracing stone cold death. Nice seven hands. No, we are killing her, don't worry. Uh, you always do betray kill on Toriel, it's faster than normal killing her. You, at my most vulnerable moment. To think I was worried. You wouldn't fit in out there. All right, chat. One of my mods, I want you to start a prediction. Am I going to like it or not? Start the prediction. Am I going to like it or not? Oh, boy. Here we go. Need context? Am I going to enjoy this drink? Am I going to think it's good or not? Oh boy, here we go. Get your bets in, boys. I don't know. Uh, I Let me try this again. No. Nope. It's... Okay, it's not awful or anything like that. It's not bad. It's just... It's got this weird aftertaste that feels like I've just fucking injected a lemon into my bloodstream. Like that it literally tastes like lemon juice. I'm, I'm at a loss for words. It doesn't even taste anything like you think. Like it doesn't taste like flaming Hot, it tastes like lemons.
Yeah, I've got to say, I'm not, not the biggest fan. I'm not the biggest fan of this. Definitely one of the weaker Mountain Dew flavors, for sure. It's... I'm going to be real with you. It is... It tastes better than I thought it would. I was prepared for it to taste like ground-up fucking Flaming Hot Cheetos in a Mountain Dew bath, which would probably taste like my small intestine wants to rocket itself out to space. Ears look cute on you. Oh. Thank you. Same, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Got you covered. It's sponsored by the mouse. What do you fucking think? Do you just do anything chat asks? No, chat does anything I ask, though. The more I drink it, the more I dislike it! Ah! Oh, the more I have of it, the worse it gets! Dude, it tastes like lemon juice! Ugh! <laughs> Unfortunately, I never listened to Shay either. That's a lie. split. Tell me one time I did what you asked. Uh, you, uh, added me on Snapchat when I asked you to. Yeah, that's, mm hmm Why are you drinking it if you dislike it? Content! And I gotta, I gotta be real with you. Kind of waking me up a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. It's it's, it's definitely it definitely got some kick to it. That doesn't count. Um, you uh messaged me on Discord, I guess. I know. I don't really ask you to do things. How do I join your Discord? Well, maybe if you type exclamation point Discord in the chat, you can get a link. Or you can click the giant panel below the stream that says uh, Discord. In big, beautiful Undertale colors. Normal virus fight? Yep. We gotta kill him. He must die! Now hold on, let me think for a moment. I'm pretty sure... I think this might be the last time we fight Papyrus normally. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is the last time. Because I don't think we do... I think he lives next branch. He lives through the entire true pacifist branch. And all the rest of the times we kill him, it's genocide. 
This is either the last or there's one more. Does finishing the Undyne fight disable random encounters in Waterfall? Uh, it shouldn't. How's your concentration? It's been kickstarted by Lemon Juice Mountain Dew. Oh, finishing the Undyne water cutscene disables encounters in Waterfall. Is that really the case? but only if you have zero kills. Wow. I did not know that. What the fuck? That's my special attack. Hey, you stupid dog. Stop munching on that bone. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Ah, he is a really cool regular attack. <laughs> I like how the C is a separate object from the rest. No, 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 wait, 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 no, no, Okay, we did it. Now's your chance to accept my mercy. No! Yes! Yes! Oh, by the way, I should be marking kills. It'll be four for dog ending. And Toriel was the first. Yes! Yes! Gonna cut it out early tonight. Good night and good luck. I'll probably be streaming still when you wake up. Good night. Done. Cutie patootie. You have a good night. Sleep well. Yes, Zinc, that's exactly what it was. All right, Papyrus is dead. Ah, stupid bastard. <laughs> Got back from seeing Doctor Strange. Hope you enjoyed it. I need to go see it myself. I haven't seen it yet. Guys, I hear Morbius shows up. I'm kidding. <laughs> gonna sell one more billion tickets one more billion more bucks <laughs> it's morbin time god all the fucking stupid jokes with morbius are so good try to watch the northman but left because i got bored that movie looked like i watched the trailer and i was like this movie looks like it's gonna be really really fucking boring Okay, let's see here. Gildoriel, trigger the cutscene in the next room. Add a snow drake. Kill Papyrus. Get EBS. Skip Mad Dummy. Save at Undyne Arena. Spare Undyne. Skip Metaton. Yep. Reload. Kill Undyne. Skip Metaton. Do Alfie's Elevator. Skip. Save in Judgment Hall. Get this ending. Reload. Kill Metaton. Save in Core End. Get this ending. Core End? Who wrote that? No! Castle Elevator! Oh my gosh! It's two instances of that that's gotta be fixed now. Yeah, boys, I'm gonna go... I'm gonna skip Metaton, then go backwards to save. Yeah, that's, whoo, really worth it.
At least this part is fixed, so it doesn't say you have to do Alfie's elevator. Skip. No, I have not gotten gassed your hallway. Amoribus. <laughs> True. Amoribus. Who's ready for Gester? No, not three. Holy shit, that was scary. I was I was close to actually using the punch card for its intended fucking function there for a moment. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> that's that's scary. <laughs> I almost just used the punch card for its intended purpose. Yeah, you get 31 chances uh, for a 1%, so whatever the calculation on that. It should be pretty simple. Uh, you can just run the calculation for the hallway itself. You don't need to run the calculation for the door. Everybody knows the punch card's true function is to, you know, rip while you're holding the tough glove to gain plus six attack, then hot swap back to the burnt pan in order to deal 60 more billion damage. Twenty six percent. Damn, that's pretty good odds. <laughs> That checks out. Very nice ears you got there. Thank you. My chat paid good money to see these, so. That is, yeah, unfortunately, no. That The attack boost does not stay. Unfortunately. Uh, stats get recalculated when you switch your weapons. In order to account for the fact that weapon attack exists as a variable. Now, if there was a way to swap weapons without, uh, you know, without recalculating your stats, oh boy, that'd probably be be used in the speed runs right now because a plus six attack burnt pan does like two hundred and fifty more damage than than a regular one. Wait, issue, if you switch your weapons, does it give you 99 attack? I didn't even consider that. Please tell me that's how that works. <laughs> that's not where I split in this category. <laughs> he uses love 20 in the attack oh so you get 48 like you're supposed to instead of 30 is what you're saying cool so you don't get the 99 unfortunate god imagine if you could get the 99 yeah i want to see 99 attack burnt pan this would be putridly disgustingly good me rolling up and hitting Asgore for 800 a quad. This thing is driving me insane, you have no idea.
I could have died there if I got hit, but whatever. No big deal. Ah. Come on. Five for five. Five for five. Five for five. Let's go! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> so based! Also, yeah, should I do LEBP in this? Should I just do one dine and then, uh... You just go for it. I think the literal only thing that could go wrong if I decide to do that strat is if I accidentally miss the, uh, the water skip. <laughs> that would be a calamity. <laughs> also, I forgot I could spare a Temi there. That literally has not come up in this run until now. So I should do one dine, fight her until her HP is low, or fight fight her for the until I can run away, save at enter lab. And just leave her alive. Save at magma chamber. Mm. Well, I should save at enter lab. Either way, I should save there for safety. Like in case I mess something up or walk into a trigger. Well, no, to save it on Dine Arena, I need to, I need to watch the cutscenes, so that's a time loss. Alright, later, five years. Do you love MDS? Morbius doesn't suck. How many of MDSs are left? One, I think. I think there's only one left. Because you don't do it in TPE branch, because you got to get the uh, credit, yellow credit. Ah, oh, you do it in Solus too. Right. Alright, so what we're going to do here is we're going to get out of this fight. So fun fact, uh, Undyne stores her HP. Uh, if you leave, if you leave the fight, then come back, her HP is restored, or isn't restored, it stays. And the reason it does that is because it, uh, because there's the, the cutscene that can happen before that lowers her HP. Okay, so now we just don't miss this. Cool. Walk into this room. Save here for safety. Leave, which, how in the world did I still save time? <laughs> Crazy. I don't think I need to kill Vulcan at any point because this is a dog ending, so. Go up here. Flee from Vulcan because, again, this is dog ending, so this guy never dies, so this isn't a problem. Yes, Pleb. Well, actually, we're going to reload here at Magma Chamber. Well, here's what we're going to do. We're going to go grab the pan. Going to run away from plane because, again, dog ending. Uh, get the pan. Equip the pan now. And now go back and save right here. 
Oh, I wanted to do the Yayi. It would have been funny. Okay. Save. Here. Alright, wonderful. We're good to go now. So now we will come back here later. So yeah, saving right there, uh, Undyne was still active. Undyne doesn't become unactive until this phone call, I think, is what unactivates her. I, I, I'm not sure if that phone call uh, does plot value. I know this one does. That one does right there. So that, that phone call absolutely did. I'm not sure if the previous one did or not. And this absolutely does it. Morbin time. Alright, so this is the one. So now the plot is updated, but that's not going to matter when we reload. I think I got it. I think I got that little bastard. What's up, Trubby? By the way, this is the least destructive instance of missing royal guards to get because you can just fucking murder them and it doesn't matter. Hey, Freezer. How you doing, bestie? Why do you have cat ears? Uh, my chat paid good money for them. Also, why not? You telling me you don't love them? Yeah, there's a there's a Florida area code that's 727, and I know that because they called me before. Let me tell you, that was a funny little thing. Uh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Why does this human keep ignoring, ignoring me? Oh, that human. Yeah, what about them?
You know what the M in my name stands for? You don't have an M in your name. Does it stand for Morbius? You know what the M in my name stands for? Mitchell. Undertale incident. Ah! The incident. Let us don't talk about the Alfie's elevator skip incident. Run is dead. Oh no, he's only 29 minutes ahead instead of 30 minutes ahead. The run is dead. Oh, it's a female Unix. That's some wild time safety. I'm a little bit better at this game than I used to be. Why is E banned? What? Alright, watch this new home. Watch this shit. One. I missed it. One. Two. Three. Four. <clears throat> Four. <laughs> Five, four. Five, four. Do you need to save somewhere? Oh, you said you can't read the text, can you? No, we saved uh, Undyne. <laughs> I was about to say, it saves, it says they're right in my splits. <laughs> Human, it was nice to meet you. Goodbye.
Wait. Actually, no, I don't think you can miss one. Because I think it's Love 6 that can miss one. I think Love 7 is a new Tazgor. We're at 13, Wolfle. Ow. Only two more to go to beat last time. Holy shit, Tazgore is in my chat? Bro, THE Tazgore? What? Yo, Wuffle with the gifts of the Tazgore. All right, this should be a... Uh, Undyne ending without Papyrus. That sounds correct. And the next ending will be Metaton ending, so... Yep! Alright, reload. Ah, uh, backtrack time! Yahoo! No! One! One, two, three. Two, two. What the fuck? That's not how wrong warps work. Here we go. A three! And we just overflow this doohickey. Uh, bada bing, bada boom, bada bam. Hello, Undyne. Fight me! Oh, yeah! Look at the damage numbers, baby! Remember when I was doing 60 with the fucking ballet shoes? Yeah, good times. This much power should be illegal. Ah, oh, damn it, I almost had the Tass the Tass Dine. <laughs> Call that shit Tass Dine. New, not never before seen. Later, Bozo, 200 to the dome. Oh! Oh, it gets worse every time, dude! It gets worse every time, chat! How the fuck does it get worse every time I sip it? Yo, V. Later. Have fun eating. What's going on? I'm sipping on some flaming hot Mountain Dew. You're still drinking it? I, listen, somebody paid money for this shit. I ain't gonna let it go to waste. What are you gonna do to celebrate once you're done? Sleep! I'm gonna go to bed. We sell the spicy, but I did. Flamin' hot Mountain Dew. And it, it tastes like fucking lemon juice. Did you do today's Wordle? That I did, cutie pie. I did, uh, I got, I got it in five. Haha, <laughs> Undyne's dead. Moron. Ah, rip bozo. 
Rip bozo, rip bozo, rip bozo, rip bozo, rip bozo, rip bozo, rip bozo. Ooh, ooh, I love a minute and a half of time save. Them, them burnt pan be, uh, be real shit. We're gonna run into... Pl uh, high rope, right? Heat rope! LEBP is sex too. Alright, let's go ahead and save. Watch this shit. Yeah! Yeet! Send it! I just fucking sent that shit. No regrets. This is a, uh, this is a, uh, do Alfie's elevator skip ending, I'm pretty sure. I was lied to, the food isn't ready? Damn. I hate getting baited. Yeah, this is a Alfie's elevator skip, right? Yeah, okay. Save and halt. My dad soldered on a new battery. Yo, shoutouts to your dad, that's fucking dope. Ugh, man, that's something none of us in my family know how to do. I don't think any of us know how to solder. Solder. My dad's pretty good at practical stuff, but I don't think any of us learned ever learned how to do that. If anybody in this family is going to learn how to solder shit, it's probably going to be me. And my brother might know how, actually. Sands! Sands, where are you? Come back, please. I miss you. Oh, right, I forgot about the encounter removal thing. Whoops. Uh, I haven't gotten a chance to look at it issue. It's hard to get time to look away from the game. I wouldn't fit in the card anymore. Ha! <laughs> One more. This one. For sure. Yep. That was a little bit further behind than I thought. Streamer, why is UR timer so higgy? Hold on, wait, wait, wait. Look at the clock. 17 hours! Woo! Yeah, baby! That's what we've been waiting for! That's what it's all about! Woo! Less than 10 hours to go. We're in sight. <laughs> the end is near. It's not near. Still got nine hours to go. Fuck. Shit is Thanos. Dread it, run from it. Destiny arrives all the same. Uh, I bought ice cream and it was freezer burnt. <laughs> yeah, well, I know a person with that name. They're really awesome and lovely and wonderful.
I only know freezer burning underscore. Where's freezer burns? Bring it back. Excuse me. Ah! Oh, it gets worse every time. It's so bad. Holy shit. Shit, this Mountain Dew sucks! <laughs> Why did they sell this? Oh! God, it tastes like acid reflux! Good lord, it tastes like when you get indigestion and your fucking Mexican food that you ate three hours ago comes up in your throat for like a second and it burns. That's what it feels, that's what it tastes like. <laughs> Bro! I, w I, will, I will say it is waking me up though, for sure. <laughs> I definitely feel more awake than before. Goodness lord. I, I can't deny, it's doing a good job getting me up. I just... Oh. Tastes like I'm fucking drinking Satan's fucking piss, bro. Just in case. Always worth the safety save. Hey, Frisk, thank you. <laughs> one of the, you'll do it one of these days, right? <laughs> I want to try this. I was dead curious. Everybody I knew either said it was okay or that they didn't like it. And I was like, I need to try this for myself. I absolutely need to try this. And, uh, I'm glad I tried it. <laughs> it's not like I know never to buy it again. How is it that Mountain Dew, their back-to-back -back flavor releases, are Flamin' Hot, which sucks, and Major Melon, which is like the second best flavored Mountain Dew? How do they do it? How do you go from that good to that bad, all in one turnover? Major Melon is fucking incredible! It's actually the second best Mountain Dew flavor. They're not gonna top the Green Apple Mountain Dew, that shit is incredible good. It's like, so good. But like, damn, Major Melon is so good. And then... Then they come out with this! I'm sweating! <laughs> Baja Blast? Honestly, Baja Blast is a bit overrated. It's okay. It's just fine. I have it when I go to Taco Bell. It's just fine. I think it's the, uh, the, the scarcity of Baja Blast that makes people, uh... Uh, wary about it, but let me tell you guys an interesting story about Mountain Dew Baja Blast that you might not know about me When I was 16 years old in high school, I needed to get volunteer hours So I worked during the summer at a food bank near me to help out homeless people That food bank operates on food donations from larger companies and various individuals in order to provide The homeless or struggling people with food. Very good cause. I like it You know, that's that that's that good shit that's where I, uh, so one day, you know, we get all sorts of weird stuff. Like one time, 
They uh, one time a guy uh, donated about ten tubs of vacuum sealed beans and like other things. Like this guy was going to fucking Mars or some shit. Like he was gonna be on the goddamn expedition. Like I don't know everything. He it was like tons of vacuum sealed stuff in a sealed like container. Like this guy's prepping for the the apocalypse or something. But then the next thing that we get sent is that somebody drops off. I'm not, I shit you not, about 200, no, it wasn't 200, about 150 pallets of Mountain Dew Baja Blast. Stacked pallets and pallets of Mountain Dew Baja Blast fucking stacked. We had so much that we were putting one in every single cart we were sending out, and they still had way too many that wasn't even going to beat the expiration date. So they said, hey, Peter, you like Mountain Dew, right? They let me take home three pallets of it. So I had so much Mountain Dew. That was like a hundred fucking bottles of Baja Blast to get me through that summer. I remember walking up to my mom's car because I couldn't drive yet. She was picking me up and taking me there. And she's like, what the fuck? And I'm like, they just let me have this. They couldn't get rid of it. <laughs> Did you drink it all? Yep. Over the course of that summer, I drank all of it. But I don't know, somebody donated like 150 pallets of Mountain Dew Baja Blast. I don't know who this legend was who did that, but they did it. So I am very familiar with ba what Baja Blast tastes like. I didn't have to go out of my house to go to Taco Bell to get it or whatever. It was, and it's perfectly fine. <laughs> I think it's a good alternative to the regular flavor. Hey, Willie. Hey, hey, Willie. Hey, Willie. Hey, Willie. Guess what? Willie. Willie J. Willie J. 14. Cause I'm the best around. Nothing's ever gonna get me down. Cause I'm the best. Okay, uh, next is dog ending. Uh, reload, no, that's Metaton, I just read. This is Metaton ending without Papyrus. Uh, we're gonna reload, kill Metaton, save and core end. So this should be Metaton without Papyrus, yep. Okay, go back. Yeah, same thing, Capsule Elevator. Yeah, I already pointed that out, Chair. There's two instances of that that need to be changed. Where, for some reason, it says kill Metaton two times. Like, this ending and the previous branch had that first issue, too, where it's like, kill Metaton and then save in Korine. It's like, no, that's not how that works. <laughs> you can't go back after you kill Metaton. I'm not sure if the person who wrote the, go the guide knows that. You have to literally, like, wrong warp out. You would, you would lose time doing that. I mean, granted, it's like 15 seconds, but you'd still lose time doing it. Come on, I'm up a quad. I can, I can do it. <laughs> oh, is that a kill? Oh, so close. Ah, I only whiffed once that fight. 
Well, Willie, you're willing to... You're willing to double it, because I haven't done any of mine yet. So I'd have to double all of them, but you've already done some of them. How in the world is he keeping his balance? Now, alternatively, I could just miss this skip if I really wanted to. Like, if I wanted to miss this skip, I could. It wouldn't matter. But like, you know, that's slow. But I could miss Alfie's elevator. It wouldn't affect anything. It would just make Metaton's ghost go away. What? How? I call hacks. How did I save 32 seconds? It's not even the length of the fucking split. It's like a 15 second split and I saved double the time. God, I'm so good at this game. Watch chat, I can make my ears go back and forth. <laughs> Woo! Oh, I'm so good, dude. <laughs> Holy shit. I haven't dropped a quad on Asgore in three endings. Woo! All right, this is going to be dog ending. I like how I have that marked in parentheses. <laughs> That's interesting that I have that marked. On the splits. I wonder why I did that. Maybe it's because, like, dog ending is one of my favorites. Or that I wanted to, like, specifically point out that it's dog ending. Oh, by the way, we're at four kills. Because that's the four monsters. This is dog ending. Yep. I didn't split. Okay. Uh, kill 15. All right. Well, hold on a second, guys. We got to walk past the fucking ghost of Metaton past. First. <laughs> All right. Kill 15. So the reason, uh, so I could go get no king right now, like if I wanted to with just that one kill, but doing up to 19 here is more optimal because it'll mean we're a higher love. It's really just a matter of getting the most love you can before the next Asgore fight. I'm sure there's Warrior's Path. Yes, we'll be doing Warrior's Path last. Uh, it's 7 in Warriors, right? So we'll go at uh, 12.
Yeah, we'll kill one coming back. That's smart. Dude, I'm a fucking machine. What has happened to me? I'm a... Dude, I'm a quad machine. Alright, we'll get the one back on the bridge since it's a longer room than this one. Oh, and we get to do this. Yeah. Oh, uh, wait. Yeah. Uh, one more. Ah, I missed it. Fuck. Frogan. I have no idea if I can kill Night Knight in one. Let's see. Oh! Power. Dude, I'm a fucking animal! What has happened? I haven't dropped a single quad since, like, the Metaton fight. He's back. He's back! Holy shit. Alright, yeah, casual, you know, just a casual 14 quads and plus the 7 on Asgore. Okay, so seven quads on Asgore. 21 quads in a row. Not too shabby. All right, I never thought I was ever going to say this. I keep forgetting I have the punch card, by the way. I could totally be wrong warping right now. Uh, give me a single. Actually, give me a single magic. <laughs> Would be optimal here. <laughs> Wait, actually, no. Fucking just go now and then come back and get the double. Yeah, no, that's better. I didn't even think about that, yeah. <laughs> That'd be faster. Hey, Bailey, we're doing well. Yeah, I was like, okay, well, we need to hit... We don't need to hit 19 exactly. We just need to be at... Uh, five or more in less than 20 is all that matters. <sighs> don't do that. I mean, that actually wouldn't matter, but, like, it would lose, like, 30 seconds. <laughs> It wouldn't be the end of the world or anything, but it did lose like a little bit of time. All right, this is going to be no king ending. All right, let's see if I can do it again. Let's see if I can keep the, the streak going. We're on 21 at the moment. Actually, I think it's 24 because of the three in the Metaton fight. So 24 quads in a row. Let's see if we can keep it going. No! <laughs> 24 is fucking sick, though. That's a sick streak. I literally did not drop a single quad in that core, dude. That was wild. That was like, that was like better than peak genocide grind me. So I'm only getting better. Still window for perfect. Uno frame. Yeah, 33 MS per bar. Does this kill? Nah, not quite. This should kill, though. Oh, almost got 767. This shit got double white. 
And I smashed on the block. Made a right. Booty looking right. It's on site. <laughs> All right. So this should be no king ending. No king ending. Yep. And then kill two. And we'll get no king with 20. Because that is a thing, if you don't know that. Don't give me a single. I'm about to get griefed. I'm about to get griefed in fucking Undertale. Here we go. Here he comes. Here he comes. Here he comes. Here comes the single magic. Well, I mean... <laughs> Yeah, that works, I guess. Bitch! <laughs> oh, I didn't. I'm just not even gonna split there. It doesn't matter. Again, ignore the fucking ghost of... <laughs> The Metaton's ghost. <laughs> the fucking ghost of Christmas past, bro. Uh, we can save here in case I miss Sanskrit. Alright. No King 20, and the next is Exiled Queen Branch 2. The sequel, Electric Boogaloo. Chat, it's almost here. The ending you've been waiting for is, a, is going to arrive very, very soon, chat. If Exile Branch is so good, why isn't there Exile Branch 2? <laughs> Me eating cereal. There will never be Exile Branch 2. Exile Branch 2. It's no 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 baked. We're almost there. That's that's the, the branch after next branch. We're almost there. Ending 61 is is approaching at rapid speed. We're almost there. Love 13, what a weird number. <laughs> 16. We did it. It landed. It landed. All right, this should be no king ending with 20 kills. And now it's time for the final exiled queen ending. That's a lie. We've got more exiled queen later, but. <laughs> yep, all right. Here we go. Exiled queen branch two. Reset. Kill Whimson. Spare Toriel. Do not use any consumables or equip any armor. I wasn't planning on it.
Because you might have played out the go to hell. I remember doing that. Okay, so I wasn't imagining that. Cool. Alright, kill Whimson Spiritorial. I do remember doing that, Marks. Thanks for solidifying that I did that. Oh, I'll reset the kill count, too. We're getting there, chat. Ending 61 is after this branch. Family ending without Alfie's with challenge is approaching at rapid velocity. <laughs> Honestly, shoutouts to 61 family ending without Alfie's and without challenge. Do not reset. Do not use consumables or equip any armor. Do not get all yellow credits except all am 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 amalgamates. I mean, that, that, that all just got to be one of my favorite genders. Whimson. No, I've got to grind. This doesn't take very long, thankfully. Whimson. Yay. I like how it says that if you, uh... If, if if none of the first three encounters are whims and kill a frog it instead, as if it doesn't take like two, like a second to grind an encounter out there. Just grind until you get a whims in. Honestly. Oh, I killed that bastard. <sighs> yes! Finally. Uh, bathroom break is coming up, by the way. Um, I think I'll do it at Spears 2, since there's a big cutscene there. I think it's a good spot to do it. All right, bye, V-Spectre. Have a great dinner. <laughs> nice fucking... <laughs> yo, 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 if we were in New Home, I would have gotten the sickest ocean warp you've ever seen. Me and the boys when we have to fight Flowey again later. <laughs> yes. 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 <laughs> That's what we like to see right there, baby. Let's go. She had nine now as an eight hand.
Oh my god! <laughs> okay. Nice time save, bro. Why did it just save him four minutes? Oh, it's still terrible. It's worse. How does it get worse every time? To stop drinking it? I fucking listen. If somebody paid money for this, okay? There are like, you know, I don't know. <laughs> there are people that you can't afford food or whatever, okay? I'm not gonna let it go to waste. I'm not wasteful. You're letting it get warm? Actually, yeah, that might have something to do with it. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Endogony? 2K. Good to see you. Oh, sorry, I was checking out, uh, what issue sent me. I'll take a look at that when I can issue. Or that'll probably be after the stream. Time loss. Oh no, I'm only 34 minutes ahead. Oh no, not the time loss. What's up, Zvul? Only nine hours left, chat. Listen, I may have just lost six seconds to looking at my Discord DMs, but you know where I didn't lose time? I didn't lose one frame to doing an ending in a certain order. <laughs> you know who else didn't lose one frame? <laughs> Oh, do it in a youth pastor voice. <laughs> like it's fucking Jesus. We're talking about Jesus. Oh, wait, fuck. I should be looking at who I need to kill. Hold on. Uh, Spiritorial, die to snow drake, get snowman piece, spare papyrus. Okay, nothing else. Cool. I guess we get our kills lit. Oh, right, because we need to spare papyrus, right? And get our EBS. Listen, I know Tazgors will be harder, but it's okay. I have 16. That is one more than I already had last run, so. I'm vibing. And we haven't even gotten to Alfie's ending yet. Where I can literally fucking lobotomize myself, myself and still get a Tazgor. Yo, nice look, Romeo. How many Alfie's endings are there? One. Alfie's ending is an individual ending. It's like no king or dog ending. There's no variations. Well, no king has variations is a bad example. It's like dog ending. There's no variations. Let's go with that. <laughs> Yeah, there's only, uh, just the one. Yo, Stina, how are the runs? Well, the run is going just fine. One run, singular. Fuck. But... 
Juffie. God almighty. Don't let me know when he's at Asgore. It's gonna be a bit. We gotta go through Undyne. We gotta go through a whole ass Undyne in this run. And we get our second to last mad dummy skip of the run. Let's go. If I go seven for seven on these fucking things, I'm gonna shit myself. Yeah, there's only two more. This ending and then Solus are the only two that have it left because we don't do it next branch. Uh, because we need to get the yellow credit. Oh, jeez. What was the thing you betted again, Willie? You made a bet on it, I'm pretty sure. Or did we make a bet? I can't remember. I don't think we did. Why don't you get the yellow credit during no save? They don't... They don't transfer over. <laughs> no, all yellow credits has to be done all at once. I think. It'd be, it would be like, I don't actually know what the logistics behind that would be, if that would be allowed, like, if you got a yellow credit, but it wasn't on the ending where you need, where you check it, because it wouldn't be verifiable, I don't think. Uh, I didn't forget anything, right? Just snowman piece, spare papyrus. Yep. I get EBS. That's all. I'll give 10 subs. All right, let's go. Ooh, you feel your wallet loosening from your pants as you give all of your money to me. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, how could you think about 100 bits? Hey, Casper. Should I cook dinner or should I order dinner? Honestly, whichever you want. How high can... Well, you may have cleverly escaped from jail before, but this time I've upgraded the facilities. Not only will you be trapped, but the cameras will conveniently cut out when someone attacks you. Mm -hmm. I'm not wearing pants. Six months. I'm really glad to be here. Thanks for making this possible less than three. Yo, Casper, thank you for the six months, cutie. Appreciate you, lovely. And uh enjoy your frogs for another month. And thank you for the continued support. Enjoy your green heart. Looks cute.
if I get live split to work? I don't know the exact issues you're having. Again, there's probably people who can better answer your questions in the speedrun Discord server, like I said. Ah, uh, okay, cool. It says that, Indy. Nice. What if the papyrus could beat bugs? Hey, yo, man, check this shit out. <laughs> Holy shit, I'm out of breath. <laughs> yeah, see, I'm thinking that sucks. Alright, human, listen to these fucking bars. Let's get this shit. Let's get this shit. Let's get this shit. Let's get this shit. Top of the morning, top of the morning, top of the morning. <laughs> it's easy. I got sniped. I go. <laughs> Almost got sniped again. Start begging, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Pretty good, you. I am big vibing. I also kind of have to use the bathroom soon. What if he did MDS but one instead of dying? Then it would be slower because you'd be at the bottom of the room. The room would be persistent. You re you close the game like 16 times in that branch. You wouldn't even be able to do the date thing. EEBP in pacifist? Gaster. Damn it. Give me the fucking ice cream, bitch. Thank you. Don't use it by accident. All right, again, we are quarantining uh, all of my consumables so that I don't accidentally use them. So, bop, 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 bop. Uh, sticks, no man piece, nice grin. All right, cool. Beneath my two punch cards, just in case one wasn't enough. Yeah, I'm not sure if EEBP is worth it in, uh, in Pacifist, where you wouldn't even get to do the thing with Undyne. Well, I guess you could. It'd also be love one, so you'd be rolling the RNG. So, like... Sheesh! Absolute psycho streamer harasses helpless ice cream stand employee, then teleports out of the room. Number six, psycho streamer harasses helpless ice cream stand employee, then teleports out of the room. <laughs> <laughs> mm. 
Number seven, man urinates on fellow passenger for not being allowed to smoke. Number 12, monkey. Okay, chat, my ears are coming off because I'm going to dash to the bathroom once I get to the, uh, the cutscene here. Because I gotta go. Oh, watch me do Willy Warp without a sound cue, by the way. Never needed it in my entire life. Watch this. Literally so easy. I'm sorry, chat. The, the cat ears have to come off for just a moment. I gotta go to the fucking bathroom so badly. Oh, baby. Oh, I feel it. Ah, damn. No wrong order. I know I'm gonna lose like 30 seconds here, but that's okay. I can take the time loss. Just part of the run. All right, be right back. Oh. oh, what are all these hearts? What? Oh. Thanks, guys. Oh. Oh, boy. Did you have fun? I mean, it was relieving. So, yeah. Six for six. <laughs> Bestie, we went over this. 550 sub points. Oh yeah, six for six. Only one more to go. You are shitting me. Is that seven? Is that seven clam girls in this run, dude? What? Stop this. Okay, who do I kill? Uh, let's see, spare papyrus, get EBS, kill Timmy, kill Undyne, kill Vulcan. Alright. 
kill Temi, kill Undyne, kill... Okay, so Temi dies here. Cool. Yo, Scout with the gift sub to Indy. Thank you so much, Scout. Also, what's, oh, what's up, Alimra? Hope you're doing well. Yo, and doggity 2 k with the Prime as well. Thank you so much. Enjoy your emotes. Appreciate the support. Thanks for choosing me to subscribe to. Have we had any G followers? No, but we've had Clam Girl seven times. It's actually the only fun event I've gotten, by the way. That's the only one I've gotten, and I've gotten it seven times. Insane. Yeah, what's up, Supremo? Oh, no, yeah, I got phone call twice, actually, because I had to, I ran into it twice because I got mega punished. That's right. Wasn't it six? Yeah, you're right, it is six. I was confusing it with one of the times I got phone call. As long as you're green, you can't escape. Got it. Um, hmm. This is the last time we fight normal Undyne. This is it. No more, no more Undyne. undyne. The next time we fight Undyne, she will be Undyne the Undyne. Well, okay, we do, uh, next ending, we do, we spare her, but we don't, like, fight her again until she's Undying. Yo, issue with the 727 gay bits. Appreciate it. Call it the Undiner. <laughs> Undiner, yeah, she starts a restaurant. It's a... I don't know, what would Undine cook? I, I, wanna, I almost want to say sushi, but like that, isn't that like... A little on the nose. She be she could be a uh, she could be a a, a part time cook along with Papyrus at Papyrus's Italian restaurant. She could be the one who chops the fish in half violently. She could be a butcher, yeah. By the way, chat, if you hear a baby crying, uh, that is because there is a baby uh, a room away from me. Dude, some of these patterns are fucking weird. <laughs> it's weird seeing these like this because I'm so used to seeing these in kindergarten mode. Yo, issue with the gift sub to Imbian, and also we've got a hype train on the, the perimeter chat. Now, n we haven't let a single hype train fail during the, uh, the length of this stream. And if just one more person contributes, it'll already be level 2, so it won't fail. Just saying, chat.
Yeah, the man, thank you for the 13 bits. Ow. Yo, Enzo, thank you for the 28 gay bits. Issue, thank you for the three gay bits. Oh, it's 98%. It's not quite there. Yo, Luke Romeo, thanks for the 100. Sushi yummy, I agree. I guess I'm... Well, okay, I guess I'm doing Beowulf. I mean, I can get away with it in this branch. I don't have to kill anything weird, I don't think. I don't think Pyrope dies in this branch. Let me double check the kills. I think it's just Vulcan. Oh no, Pyrope does die. I guess we can do Beowulf and then heal after. Alright, so Vulcan, get the apron, kill Pyrope. And then kill the, the guys up top and the stigmatism. Oh, right. This ending has one of my favorite little notes in the whole entire uh, route guide. So, because Metaton is, like, completely ignored for these uh, for these endings, <laughs> you get one of my favorite things on uh, ending 57. <laughs> Skip Metaton if he's still there. <laughs> like, if, if you never, like, delete him with a, a flag update. <laughs> if he happens to still be there. Let's skip Metaton's ghost. <laughs> and now Papyrus is gonna call us. Hey, you should hang out with Undyne later. Oh, and she's dead, unfortunate. I don't know, it seems like a small uh, skill uh, skill issue. Undyne the very dead. I took a break, Miguel. You're allowed to take a 12-hour break in this category. Welcome back, Willie. How long is this category? Uh, my PB's 27 hours, but we're probably on pace for a, a mid to low 26 at the moment. I need to equip burnt pan now, by the way. Hi, Tyre. Welcome back. I hope you're doing well. Why should the 12-hour break be mandatory? If someone doesn't want to, they don't have to. Alright, we're gonna heal here. Yeah, if someone doesn't want to use it, they shouldn't be forced to. I mean, I'd recommend using the break. I don't think it's healthy to do this category in one sitting, but if someone wants to do that, that is their prerogative. Second half is going to be under 12. Yeah, it's on pace to be sub-12. With how much time I'm saving. By the way, I'm 6 for 6 on MDS. Yo, funky zonky, thank you for the 100 bits, appreciate it.
Which one am I on? This is Exiled Queen Branch 2. So in this branch, we're gonna get, uh... We're gonna get... Eight endings total. We're gonna get the four Exiled Queen without Undyne endings, and we're gonna get the four Exiled Queen without Undyne and with ten kill endings. And then after that is the True Pacifist branch, which is the longest branch, and also the most involved. Well, not the longest, that's no save. Uh, but it's the longest not no save one. Can you show the NI? Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I did that last time. I can't show it. I can't look at the file. But I will, uh, I will copy it so that I can look at it later. That's what I did last time. We decided that it was okay to do. That's good. That's like six, seven, yeah. Yeah, I'm not allowed to actually look at the I and I during the run because that would technically be viewing game memory or whatever. But, uh... I'll take a copy of it before, uh... I'll take a copy of it during Flowey getting slashed during Genocide. And, like, store it in a random folder in my... So we can look at it, because that, that will be... The final file that we have at the end will be pretty sizable, but the I and I that we get before it gets erased in Genocide is ridiculously massive and has, like, literally every flag possible. Like, almost every single flag that's possible to be set in the game gets set in that file. Because it's the course of the entire run. I gotta go up and kill the two bozos. Yeet! Hmm, damn. Oh, it still kills. Never mind. We're good. I don't know who else to kill. Oops. Astigmatism only. Okay. I didn't count Undyne, did I? Hold on, let me go up through the numbers. Uh, Whimsin... Hold on, let me think. Whimsin... Temi. Whims and Temi. Yeah, I didn't count on that. There we go. We're actually at seven. Now it makes sense. All right, all we got to do is kill uh, astigmatism before going all the way up. Uh, what the fuck? I wasn't tapped into. Oh, oh, I'm holding. I'm holing up. <laughs> I was like, why can't I move? <laughs> Good luck with the rest. Thank you, Wojo. Astigmatism dies brutally. Now you might ask yourself, wait, streamer, why not kill magic instead of astigmatism? Well, we need to be able to get a double encounter in core for next. It's routed around that, so. We kill astigmatism instead of magic there, even though killing magic would be slightly faster in a vacuum. Not very much faster, but just a little bit. Because you wouldn't have to walk over to that other room.
Seems like you could skip Metaton. I'm going to explain what the punch card does. Basically, it gives you movement during cutscenes if you use it on cutscene triggers. In a very simple term. And allows you to walk through pretty much every cutscene in the game. There's also sort of advanced, all sorts of advanced stuff you can do with it. You trade three of them for a punch card. Yeah, you can trade three punch cards for a punch card. <laughs> but mine's a super rare, and yours are three commons. Three common punch cards for a, for a super rare punch card. And you can upgrade that super rare to an ultra rare, or maybe even a secret rare, or an ultimate rare if you're playing in a good format. Uh, I'm so sad they stopped doing ultimate rares for Yu-Gi-Oh. Now, I'm glad that the, you know, the rares are less rare now, but, like, I really miss the ultimate, the ulti rares. They were so good. It's just so pretty and, like, perfect versions of them. Like, I like to play Cyber Dragons from time to time, and the versions of that I would like to have would be the original... Cybernetic Revolution Ulti Rares, but those are really expensive, but they look so good. I want my Venti Punch Guard. Yo, Venti? Isn't that that twink from Genshin Impact? Save before Asgore. Man, this branch is easy as shit. <laughs> Save before Asgore. Yep. I should probably run into a... Uh... I should run into an Asgore cutscene trigger to just remove Metaton from existence. That'd probably be smart, so I don't have to worry about skipping him. I wonder why the guy doesn't tell me to do that. It should. That should be in the guide. That definitely should be in the guide. Just specify to walk into Asgore's trigger here and would it would it would be faster. And it would be easier too. Because it gets rid of all of the cutscenes and shit. Seventeen.
<sighs> the goat. Uh, so this is going to be Exiled Queen. Oh, fuck. Wrong tap. There we go. Uh, without Undyne. Or Consumables. Yep, that's correct. Okay. Uh, now reload. Use a Consumable. Go again. You're so good at Undertale. I know I am. But thank you. You could always... Stat chat, you could always stand to compliment me more. I mean, I... <laughs> My fan just died? Yeah, I killed your fan. I was so smoking hot that the fan just gave up trying to cool the room down. Your hair looks nice, thank you. You look really cute today, Oh. If you Tazgore this, I will buy eggs at the store and make an egg sandwich. I... You sure it's hot? Thank you. I love your eyes. Aww. You're so sweet. I can still Tazgor. It's okay. We're still at love nine. Now I can't. Oh, sorry, Freezer. No egg sandwich. Yeah, I don't know why the skip Metaton if he's still there. Just say to run into Asgore's trigger. Like, like what? <gasps> It'll just get rid of Metaton. You don't even have to worry about him. Guide. It's just small alterations, nothing crazy. Ooh, almost just won the lottery. Split that. Okay, cool. So this will be Exile Queen without Undyne with Bandage. Uh, Did, did was I seeing it? I didn't even notice. Jesus, I'm so fucking far ahead. What in the world, dude? I if I kill this Asgore fast, I might I'd be close to 40 minutes ahead. That is insane.
18. Typhoon, welcome back. What do you mean there's more Asgore fights? Oh, you have five more left in this branch. <laughs> Including this one. We're literally, we're gonna finish this Asgore, walk back in the core, kill two, walk back, kill Asgore four more times. Don't get ready for me to do 20... No, 19 Asgores with the Temi armor, though. Because that's next branch. <laughs> I see, welcome back. Still do it. Just need to not miss anymore. Runs going well? Yes, ma'am. Nineteen. <laughs> we do be making Willie swole, though. <laughs> Alright, this should just be, uh... This should just be Exile the Queen without Undyne. into a monster. I don't know why this isn't in the guide. You should definitely run into that guy. <laughs> the guide doesn't tell you to run into it when you really should. Because you can, uh... Forgot you can... I forgot this sign was interactable, honestly. What? Cool. Because now Metaton's ghost is gone. Yay! That wrong warp is time lost. The one I did out of throne room, yeah, I figured that out. I sort of thought to myself, I was like, yeah, that is time loss, isn't it? I'm just like used to overflowing that going down to skip the cutscene. And now Metaton's ghost is gone. Yay! Yeah, that definitely should be in the guide, not that fucking, if Metaton is still there, skip him nonsense. Just say, run into an Asgore trigger. Run into that particular trigger to update plot so you don't have to worry about skipping him anymore.
<laughs> right. Yeah, it also removes sands too. That's also important. <laughs> All it does is that this will happen. The only consequence of doing it is that uh, this happens. Okay, I can fucking wrong warp. That'd be great. There we go. You get his text there. Right. I don't think you can drop one at love 10. It's like super close to rolling over. If I remember correctly. After the four in this branch, there will be 20 more exactly. 19 of which will be in the true pacifist branch and one will the other one uh, uh sorry 18 of which will be in the true pacifist branch the other one will be uh the other one will be in uh alfie's ending and one in um solace neutral Hey, Silent. Hi, kitties. Fuck. Damn. Oh! Oh, oh. That was dangerously close to the funny number. Man. Alright, so this should be... Oop, I didn't mean to click Alt there. This should be Exiled Queen without Undyne. With 10 kills without consumables. That might be the longest fucking name in the entire run. What the hell? Damn, this might be the longest branch name in the whole run. Exiled Queen without Undyne, without consumables, with 10 kills is what this should be. Goodness. Uh, use a consumable save. About the storm, stay safe, future. Clearing out my fucking, <laughs> clearing out my Discord things. Fuck. If you had to watch the ending phone calls, well, you'd mash through them all. Oh yeah, I forgot about Betrayed Undyne without Alfie's with Dayton with Snowman Peace. Yeah, that is long. Jesus Christ.
I remember correctly, that is, uh... That is, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's one of the Exiled Queen endings. I want to say that's Exiled Queen without Papyrus. With 10 kills. I want to say, if that's a thing that exists. I, it's one of the ones without Papyrus, because I think Sans lives with, with Toriel in that ending. 474. Oh, the misery. All right, this is gonna be one of the, this should be. Exiled Queen without Undyne, with 10 kills, with Bandage. Apron. Save. This will be the snowman piece version. Man, I'm so glad these endings are, like, swaps of each other, because imagine if you could get all of them at once, and you had to get every combination, like, of all the different Sans intros. Like, imagine if all of them stacked, and you could get all of them, and you had to get, like... <laughs> God. <laughs> Fucking imagine, that would be miserable. Imagine if they stacked with no save. Yeah, if that happened, this plot category would be unplayable. Like, it would be like hundreds of hours long. Guess what? 20. God, look at all the flushed emojis when I got really close to my mic. Hey guys. What's up? You having a good time? Y'all enjoying yourselves? Hope you all have a wonderful stream so far. I'm having a good time. minutes. Yep, we're minus 40. Hey, Eve. Hope you're doing well. Zam! The final Asgore before the boy. The big boy ending. <sighs> Alright, we've got 21 more Asgores after this one. So 19 of those are, uh, 19 of those are in the next branch. And one of the uh, one of them's in genocide. One of them's in solace. Yeah, I have 39 at the moment. That's correct. I 
Hey, Chad, I got a question for you. Never mind. Damn, I won't be able to make this joke for another hour. We'll come back to it next, Asgore. Angelon, you're not allowed to change your date. I mean, if you wanted to to somehow predict the uh, the exact time you'd summon So Sorry and be right on the dot, I mean, you could do that. There's nothing uh, against doing that. There'd be nothing against you know doing that at the start of the run, right? Like if you could somehow predict that if you're fucking you know fortune teller. All right, this should just be Exiled Queen without Undyne and with ten. Here we go. Here we go, chat. Ending 61. Family ending. <laughs> Without Alfie's. Oh my god, guys, it's time for ending 61. Family ending without Alfie's. Get all yellow credits except amalgamates and Mad Mew Mew in 101%. Get two monster candies. Get the coded ribbon. Get the box scotch by. Bear foil. Do not heal at the box road. Get the tough love in your inventory and dump everything else in the box. Get the tough love. Trigger the tough scene in the next room. Die the snow dress in the same room. Alright, what do I gotta do in Ruins? So I gotta get all yellow credits. Also, yo. Wolfful thanks for the 500 bits. Alright, I gotta get, let's see. Get yellow credits, so I gotta get Frog at Whimson, Mold Small, I can do Mold Small whenever. Uh, and then the fuckers at the end. So other than that, what do I need to do? Two Monster Candies, Favorited Ribbon, Pie, Sparatorial. Alright, we're gonna break this up as much as we can here. <laughs> So, we get two candies, faded ribbon pie. And also all yellow credits. So, I need to get Froggit, Whimson, uh, Molt Small if it shows up. I can get it in Waterfall guaranteed, but might as well do it if it shows up here. Okay, two monster candies. Two. Okay, got those. Let's save. Wait, hold on. Yeah, don't use any consumables or equip any armor. That's what it is. Okay, uh, Whimson is console. Okay, I got Whimson. Need to get Frog it. Yo, see ya, Bane Ticker. Okay, I need to get Frog it. Okay, Frog it compliments. Done. Okay. Got those two. I need to get Molt Small now. If Molt Small shows up here. That is. If Molt Small doesn't show up, it's fine. We just get uh, Molt Small during Waterfall instead. All right, and flirts. Okay. I'm gonna take a so many fucking safety saves in case I like forget about a yellow credit or something. Oh, thank you, Chair. I appreciate it. Oh god, this one has glide in it. That's right, this is the one where we do glide. Oh fuck. Ah, fear. Alright. Okay, we need to get Mike Wazowski. Okay. 
Okay. Right on time as always. Need to get the ribbon. Uh, need to get Vegetoid, which I'll just go in the hole to get. Oh yeah, that's right. I remember the AYC strat. You do a grind in this room uh, before you fall into this hole. And check if you get Vegetoid, which I didn't. But we got Migosp, so Spare, Mold Small, Act, Talk on Migosp. Done, get Vegetoid. And that's it. That's all the Ruins enemies. Uh, dinner. Get the green thing. Spare. Alright, that's all the Ruins enemies. I didn't even flip the fucking switch. Whoops. Alright, that should be all of the Ruins enemies, I think. I don't think I forgot any. Naps of is there. Yeah, you can talk to him. It's cute. No, you don't equip any consumables or armor. You have them in your inventory, though. You can't equip them. You can pick them up. Also, funny fact, the pie doesn't actually count. Uh, I don't get toy knife. No, we get that in hard mode. Right, right, yeah. Right, yeah, it's actually useful in hard mode. I forgot about that. Yeah, my bad for naps to blue. Sorry about that, I forgot. Okay, there's the pie. By the way, the pie has a super cool tech that we can literally use it as a healing item on Glide, but it would also fuck up our money route. So like, better than dying, but it's not exactly great. Okay, spare tutorial. Fuck it, jeez. What does Pi do? It heals you. So we can't use any consumables in this ending in order to get the challenge versions. Uh, the thing is, is that the Pi, because it's not, uh, because it's programmed differently than other healing items, actually doesn't count as a consumable healing item. <laughs> um, because it sets your HP to the maximum. It doesn't add HP and the flag only checks for things that add HP. It's a little oversight, but it gives it a super awesome tech in this run if you need to use it for that. It also lets you, uh, it, it makes it so that you can use it as a healing item in any of the previous endings if you're in, like non-confident with uh, bosses, which is really cool. Now, granted, I'm very confident with bosses, so I didn't, I didn't need it, but like for runners who do, it's there. Don't you need it for Azrael time save? Actually, we sell it in this route. We'll do that in Solus. But we need it for money more than anything else here. Is there any reason at all the pie doesn't heal 100 HP? Um, I don't know. Just the way it was programmed. The pie was in the demo, so it was probably made at a time where Toby may have not, like, known what the final amount of HP was going to go, was going to be. Like, the, the actual stats of the final game might not have been known at that time. Points of you, cat boy. Yeah? Yo, Natalie, thank you for the five months. I appreciate it. Hope you're doing well. Thank you for the continued support. Hope you're doing well. Okay, ruin segment done. Need a ribbon, get better scratch pie suit. Okay, get tough glove in your inventory, dump everything else in the box, equip tough glove. Okay, so we dump literally everything in the box except for the tough glove. That makes sense. Get snowman piece. And go fight fucking glide. Ugh.
Breathing like an astronaut in the ocean. Hey. I'm good. Just got back from a short trip to Ohio. I took. Yo, nice. When was the last time you fought Glide? <laughs> the last time I played True Honda? <laughs> no, I did it one time since then. I don't remember for what, but I did. I fought him for some reason. Okay. Give me the tough glove. Banish you all to the, the shadow realm. It's like you're going to the shadow realm, Jimbo. Alright. Equip tough glove. Trigger cutscene. Die to snow drake. Get snowman piece. Spare glide. Okay. Pretty straightforward. Hey, what's up, Fixie? Uh. Oh, by the way, kill count can be turned off. Oh, by the way, this is the last time we're dying to Snowdrake. <laughs> That's the last Snowdrake death. And actually the last, well, okay, MDS, but yeah. Nice pizza call. No, wait, I need the... Fuck. Wait, I need- I need that. I need him. I need- I need to get him- I need to get his yellow credit. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, here, actually. Uh, watch this. We'll respawn him. I'll die to Ice Cap, trigger the auto checkpoint, and respawn Snowdrake, so that we don't have to worry about that. Holy shit, that attack gives like 7 billion iframes. Right, I forgot this was AYC. <laughs> Let's try that one again. <laughs> and pizza respawn too. All right, here we go. Uh, check. This is the only time ever that you need to check an enemy in Undertale. Fun fact. Uh, and then joke or laugh. And we he finally got somebody to laugh at his jokes and feels accomplished. Snow man, man, I feel that. Uh, we have to do... Yeah. Can't use the stick. I just wanted to make sure I was good to go. Uh, potato. Can't use the stick on these guys either. You don't get yellow credit. Okay, I get snowman piece. Dude, I honestly... I, I feel that with, with Snowdrake. Like... I need to get Ice Cap, by the way. I think I was supposed to walk under the ice in that room. I guess we'll get, we'll get Ice Cap on the bridge then. That's fine. That works. Nice ears. Thank you. Take another safety save here. I'm gonna do that a lot, by the way. All right, so we'll just get the guy on the bridge. This should be great. Uh, lesser dog, which we use the stick on and then pet once. I know how to play AYC, I think. Yeah, I only I only hold world record in it. I probably should remember how to play the fucking category. There we go. Now we go get ice cap on the bridge here. Hey Crystal, how you doing, lovely? 
I should reset the room. Oh, too late now. I'm in the I'm in for the long haul on this one. I thought I must be confusing it with genocide. Yeah, this is gonna be a bit. Any day now. Come on. Whenever you feel like it. Dude. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking yoink. Wait, Ice Cap has a double attack while in the cube form? Okay, you learned something new about this game every single time, man. Okay, uh... Eh, I'll just spare this. Why not? I, I can run away. Or I'm not sure if I can run away. We'll just, uh... We'll just spare him. We'll take the time loss. It's whatever. It's totally fine. Hey, what's up, Finding Feline? Hope you're doing well. And then we can just spare Jerry. Goodbye. Okay. Cool. We're good. Definitely not the optimal way to have gone about that, but... <laughs> uh... Dog me roll around. Yeah, Jerry does not have a yellow credit. Uh, re sniff. Pets. Pets. Cool. All right. Oh, we are hearing parts of this song I haven't heard in forever. Hearing the C section of Snowy. Genuinely one of the most beautiful pieces of music in this game. It's so good. Okay. Cool. Everything's good here. Alright, it's time for him. I took a save there for a very specific reason. Gift trot on the way back. All right. It's probably a good time to get my lunch open. Since we're here for about two minutes, is it? Three minutes? Something like that. Something silly and ridiculous like that. Come on up. 
Jesus, I'm having trouble with my Capri Sun chat. I'm gonna encounter him any moment now. God damn. Jeez, they really make this hard to get open. Yeah, good enough. <laughs> the airheads out of there. See if I can get the sauce open before Vlad shows up. There he is! Who's my favorite white boy? Okay, what is it? It's applaud three times, ignore twice, right? Or, no. Applaud twice, nothing three times. Alright, Glide is the hardest enemy in the game, by the way, fun fact. Fucking Supreme Calamitous out here. Easy money. Oh, why is the glide thing after... Uh, I see why I skipped that split. Alright, now we got a gift trot here. What's the minimum no hit length? <laughs> oh, no. Uh, sorry, um, actually, that uh, that no hit was invalid. Um, um, you didn't spend enough time dodging him. That's a, That's an invalid no hit right there. Gift trot, and now we get. Ugh. There we go. All right, cool. I feel like an astronaut in the ocean. Eh? Spare papyrus. All right, gotta do this guy the normal way. So back in. A beck and pet play. Pet pet. Yeah. No dog skips. Wow. Ha! I just lost five fifty fifties in a row. You do really truly hate to see it. Uh huh. <laughs> Dreams nemesis, yeah. Mm, God. Dude, these pizza lunchables are the bomb, bro. Yeah, it makes sense. I lost a bunch of time there because of the, the, the ice cap incident. I don't think we uh, buy anything in this route, right? We just take everything from the shop in Geno. Yep, spare papyrus. All right, nothing special. Date Sands at Grillby's date Papyrus. Interact with a couch in his house for the money. Get the old suit to get abandoned quiche. Right. Go on the endings. Thank you. Ever try the nacho lunchable? I remember trying it. It's okay. The pizza lunchable is really sweet, though. I like them. These pizza lunchables are so tasty. They make me want to fucking merge without looking. When are we doing Sands Day? Uh, uh, um, after we do Papyrus here. 
We do it that way because Sands takes us back to Snowden. So it's actually shorter walking. So this is one of the funniest little... Like, whoever routed this had a big brain because you, uh... You walk to, you're closer to the right side of this screen than the left side of the screen. <laughs> so you walk to the right to date Sans first, and he brings you back to Snowden so you can date Papyrus. 19 hours. Actually incredible. Couldn't you just reload a save after dating Sans? That would, uh... Make it so that Sans was never dated. Also, reload a save where? Yo, yeah, what's up, Ash? How's Hundo? It is driving. Ending 61 as a, as a misc category. Uh, I feel like this is so similar to all items though, right? Like it's pretty, they're pretty similar. But yeah, ending 61 is kind of funny. It's like super all yellow credits. So yeah, you're closer to the right side of this screen. So check out, check out this tech. Check out this absolutely goofy fucking tech. This is just, this is, this is goofy gaffy. So I'm close to the right side of the screen. So we walk to the right first. <laughs> just mosey on over this way. And now we're going to date Sans and that's going to bring us back. Hey. Yeet. Have you ever heard of a talking flower? Yeah, I killed that bastard like like 18 hours ago, Sans. Where have you been? <laughs> All right, now we walk over and uh, date Papyrus, who is a simple jog over. Hello. Uh, let's see. Date Sans. Date Papyrus. Interact with a couch in his house. Ah. Ah, right. I forgot you can do that. Reel it in! Alright, well, this is true 100%. We had to eat the spaghetti at some point. <laughs> we had to eat the spaghetti at some point. It's, it's, it's now a requirement for the category. All other runs are invalidated. Okay, next up is Waterfall. Let's break this down. Get the old tutu, get the abandoned quiche, dump everything in the box, buy two nice creams, drop both nice creams. Get EBS, equip them, drop the... 
I'm gonna keep this open to read this when I get there. Fuck. <laughs> Holy shit. New remote epic underscore. Yo, Ash, thank you for the 706 bits. I appreciate it. Give me this. Two two. No, the fun events are not part of True Hundo. That would be impossible. That'd make the category completely unrunnable. And stupid and not fun at all. Alright. Oh, we get to listen to this song while we do the puzzle here. Uh, okay, wait, no. I fled from Aaron because of muscle memory, but we actually do flee from Aaron there. We don't get his credit. Because we get it later. He has a special yellow credit. I keep- I gotta yell at myself that this is AYC. Hey, Piper. You want anything from McDonald's? Nah, no thank you. I have Lunchables. Alright, there's the abandoned quiche. I run into Washua here, maybe? All right, uh, clean. And then we touch a green thing. Clean just like me. Okay. I really hope if Undyne falls into the Dark World in uh, Deltarune, she gets her fucking armor back. I love Undyne's armor. Like, the sprite. It's so, so cool. Okay. Let me highlight this so I don't lose it. Dump everything in the box. Okay. Dump everything in the box. Buy two nice creams, drop both nice creams. Get EBS, equip them, drop the second punch card. Okay. <laughs> this is one of the most miserable parts of the speedrun. I save. Okay, here we go. Also, yeah, we got a phone call earlier, no gaster. Uh, let's see. So get two nice creams. Oh wait, I'm a fool. I'm a fool. I need to dump the shit in the box first. I need room in my inventory to do this. <gasps> okay, dump everything in the box. Okay. I, I gotta be careful not to use anything here either. Okay, nice cream one, nice cream two. Drop both. Don't use them by accident. Cool. Punch card one. Punch card two. Ballet shoes. Equip ballet shoes. Drop the second punch card. Alright, get two bars of astronaut food. Do not do mad dummy skip. Also, I've already gotten Mold Small's yellow credit. Okay, good night, Enzo. Get some rest.
Don't forget what category I'm playing now. <laughs> that would be an instant run kill if I fled, because you can't ever encounter this Shiren again, so... Even if you reload. Oh, no, if you reload, you can counter her again. Did you get Shire? Uh, they need to all be done at the at once. They need to all be together. So you couldn't get their credit in Solus. That is a nice idea, though, but no, you couldn't do that. Bye, Monster Kid. So one time. Lilo and Stitch never watched. Okay. Uh, we don't want to do anything until Mad Dummy here, I don't think. Yeah, we get two, uh, we get two Astro food. Let me highlight this part now. Kind of surprised the cat ears have stayed for this long. I mean, I got 550 sub points. I said I'd do it for the rest of the run. How do you think about, how do you feel about Avatar? I love Avatar. Good, I like them. Good, I'm glad you like them. Oh, I'm not tabbed into the game, am I? <laughs> there we go. No MDS, no, we need to get yellow credit. Would you wear other ears? I don't know another ears, I just have these. Oh, that almost didn't work. Don't rip the punch card. Huh. I could always go back and get one, but it's not a very fun process. Oh, exactly enough.
Okay. All right, chat, I'm going to have the guide open for a while, so I'm not going to be able to read chat super well. I hope you understand. I need to look and be careful about all this. Okay. I got the yellow credit. Next to Gerson's shop, get the Butterscotch Pioneer inventory. Dump the tough glove and a bar of astronaut food in the box. Okay. Get the, the pie. Dump Astro Food, Tough Glove, in the box, buy five cloudy glasses. Okay. Head to Temmie Village. Get Temmie's credit on the way. Alright, this is gonna be a, uh, Fun little endeavor. Oh wow, they didn't show up. Temmy really didn't fucking. I, I guess we can do it on the way back. I'm surprised Temmy didn't show up though. No big deal. Alright, save. Okay. Go to Tem Shop. Sell the butterscotch pie first. No, then yes. Okay, so I'm better scotch pie first. Sell everything else but the punch card. Get the last non snowman piece. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Get everything except for the snowman piece. Okay. Sell any item but the sticker punch card first. Sell stick second. No. Then yes. Sell everything else. Okay. Get the tough glove. Sell the tough glove. Okay. Go back to Gerson's shop. Keep buying cloudy glasses. Dumping them in the box until you fill your inventory and the box. Repeat the backtrack until you at least have 2001 or 1751. yellow credit okay we'll still need to get temmy so we'll run into temmy here and then the next time out we'll get mold bigs uh temmy is tough If Tim wants to give you extra money, press no, then yes. No. Glasses. Okay. 
I'm just gonna save again. Everything's going well so far. All right, we do it one more time. We should have enough money. And then we need to get Temi Flakes, Collagen Armor. Timmy Flakes, College of Timmy Armor. Drop the Timmy Flakes in the box and get the snow NPC in your inventory. Okay. I can do that. Yeah, sorry, chat. I'm, I'm big time reading the guide right now. I'm very focused on this. I don't want to mess anything up. Get mold big here. Snowy Y101 enemy. It's the Snowy Y101 enemy. Flirt. Or unhog. Oh, we got plenty of money. Let me get rid of these two cloud glasses. Oh, we got plenty of money. We're good. Okay, 2016. All right, then buy 1G Temi Flakes, College, and Temi Armor. Okay. Cool. Get the flakes out of the arm and just get put the snowman piece in. Oh god, this is spooky. I hate this. Alright. Cool. <sighs> Alright. I think we're good, chat. Spare Undyne. Let me just highlight the rest of this so I know which part of this I'm reading. Alright, let's see here. Spare Undyne. Get Aaron's credit and date Undyne after getting your menu back after jetpack skip. Date Sands in the hotel. Okay. Alright, cool. I can look at chat again. Hi, chat. Whew. Jeez. I'm fucking spooked out of my mind because of Temi Armor being in slot 2. I really don't want to accidentally equip it because that means I'm going to have to reload a save. Oh, I didn't get it. It's fine. Holy shit, chat. <laughs> that was a very involved process, but I saved fucking five minutes over my PB, so I think I did it a little bit more optimally. I also have way more money than I need, but that's fine. Uh, money, having extra money is not a problem. Because we do buy a couple of more things. Hey, Crook. How many Asgore's do you get to fight? Not this one. This one won't be fought with Temi armor because we need to get the challenge flag. Uh, but we will use the Temi armor on all the non-challenge ending ones. Or actually, not all of them. There's a couple of them that we don't because, like, we need to, uh, we need to get the bandage endings as well, so...
the best encounter? Any of them that aren't a single? Over triple. Well, triple goes turn neutral. You want to double. Yeah. Ideally, it's like... Uh, what? Why did I not wrong warp there? Okay, whatever. Okay. Take it easy, son. You're almost done. It's like if, there was an inven if there's an item I can put in my inventory in the slot, too, I'm going to do it. Oh, 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 here's something I can do. Okay, I've just thought of something I can do. When I, uh... Wait, what was the point of equipping ballet shoes? What was even the point of that? I don't kill anything in this ending, do I? Uh, Vulcan strolls in. Uh, yellow credit. Uh, encourage? I guess to get the tough glove off. Yeah, that's right. Oh, so sorry. Right. Yeah, yeah, that's correct. Okay, so here's what I'll do. Once I uh, once I get burnt pan here, when I go back, uh, when I go back to uh, date Undyne and I'm near a box. What I'll do is I'll go, uh... I don't get the apron here, I don't think, right? I don't think I need it, do I? Yeah. Okay. So here's what I'll do when I go back to, uh, Undyne. To, uh... To Dater. I'll go into a box and I'll, uh, rearrange my inventory so that the ballet shoes are in slot two. That's smart. Just a little bit of safety so I don't actually fuck myself by <laughs> equipping Temi armor while I'm trying to down warp or something. Uh, how many more credits do I need? I need pi I need a heat ropes credit. I think that's it for Hotland. Oh man, there's so much to do in this category, you just gotta make sure you get it all right. I'm just taking extra precautions to make sure I get everything correct, because I don't want to make a mistake. This is the- this is the probably the most difficult ending. Like, in terms of just things you have to think about. Right, I'm gonna save here. Alright, let's go date on Diana. We do this now so we can get the without Alfie's endings. Okay, so we get this now. All right, I'll go equip pan. Put, uh, switch my inventory out real quick so that ballet shoes is perfect. There we go. Now we're talking. Now this is gaming.
Oh, man. The knob rotates incorrectly. Yeah, not only that, uh, something I noticed a long time ago is that the four blue pixels in the corner are attached to the knob itself. And they rotate with the knob instead of the knob itself rotating freely. Don't do the wrong warp here. Okay. Cool. Sand? Yeah, bye, Casper. Take care of yourself. All right, let's see here. Uh, yep. It's gonna become Florida up in here, baby. Should be all the Hotland credits. So sorry, next ending. Aaron's credit and date on Don after getting your menu back after jetpack skip. Date Sands in the hotel after getting your menu back after musical skip. Oh, we're gonna do the funny tech. Hold on, I practiced this. Wait. <laughs> we gotta we gotta do the funny fucking text corruption tech. I don't have any items to drop, so we'll do it with the phone instead. No, yeah, so sorry it isn't a uh, yellow credit enemy, so it's done in ending 62 instead. Uh, it facilitates... Actually, you can kill... Uh... Funny enough, you can kill so sorry, and it uh, does not invalidate true pacifist ending because you get no experience. It doesn't count as a kill. Truly the greatest ending of all. Oh, wait, I'm pretty sure anyway. Never mind, it does count as a kill. That's right, yeah, that's right. This is for Betrayed Undone. I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. Yes, you're right, you're right. No, I, I was mistaken. It does allow us, however, to get Betrayed Undyne with Challenge, which is not normally a thing that can happen. 
I want this fucking airhead so badly. I can't get it out of the packaging. Did you name the file Bergy? I did indeed. Ah, fuck. There's a wall there. Hold on, I gotta play left-handed while I get this in my mouth. Mm. 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 Okay, chat. I have practiced this. We're gonna do the funny fucking tech. Three months fog, good luck. Yo, Finn and Finn, thank you for the three months. I am gonna say it first, though. Alright, are, are you guys ready? We're gonna do the funny tech. Got it. <laughs> Later, Sands. Look how much time that saved. <laughs> all right. Cool. Uh, all the other credits now for core. I need to go magic here. No, I do. I do magic and night night up top. That's right. It ends up being faster because of the the thing. Yo, ACP, thank you for the 25 months. Appreciate you. Thank you for the continued support. One more. One more. There we go. Dude, it's so hard to dodge when I'm getting fucking bombarded by fly. Uh, okay. Put you to sleep first. Don't get hit either. They do a fuck ton of damage. Uh, okay, she's asleep. She is asleep. Now just talk on magic. Wait, does singing on Night Night make magic's attack move slower? What? Wow, I would have never have known that. That's wild. Okay, uh... Ah, never lucky. Don't get hit. <laughs> cool. Alright, that's all of them. That should be all the other credits. So if I miss one, well, that'd suck. Save here. Okay, let me just make sure I'm not missing anything here. 
Do Valfi's elevator skip, save in Judgment Hall. Ugh, wait. One fucking fly will not go away. I can't kill the bastard either. <laughs> I can't get him. Okay, save Judgment Hall. So we save in Hall, don't save after getting the key, because that would fuck over our plot flag. Yo, Finn Infinite with a gift sub to RJD, thank you so much. Yeah, this ending is crazy long because it sets up the rest of this passive as a branch. Which are all way shorter. This is like the setup for everything. And also we had to get Temi armor in one of the endings, so... How many Taz scores so far? 20. Alright, save in Judgment Hall. And then it's time for everybody's favorite part of the run. It's time to become the legendary fart master. No, I didn't mean to open that. Fuck this one. Alright, this is the last one, I'm pretty sure. I don't think I need to preload another one. I think this is the last one, if I remember correctly. Did you just say I'm the legendary fart master? <laughs> All right. By the way, the cool thing about Santa's key is that it's a file flag. It's an Undertale.ini flag, so even when we reload it before when we got it, we'll always have it. And we can get away with that not affecting our plot flag anymore, which is cool. Which is why we saved before. We didn't save after getting it again, so. Alright. 
So this should be family ending without Alfie's with challenge. Also, this is a fucking raw Tazgore. This is a 10 turn, like, level one with no, no assist. How many Tazgors? 20. This is 61. Yeah, one out of three task a task score ratio is pretty fucking nut nuts. I don't even think I quad kills here. <laughs> Such little damage, jeez. Uh, we're gonna do 503, no, 502 here. 509, I was close. <sighs> okay. <laughs> There we go. Ending 61 is done. <laughs> Family ending without Alfie's with challenge. Show me it. Show me it, mod. There it is. <laughs> We're done. Okay. 62. Reload. Save in core end. Oh, it's time. All right. Here we go. Oh, I, uh, this is fine. I just got to go back in. Go to right floor two. The time has come, Twitch chat. Uh, put on ballet shoes. Here we go. All right. Go to the art club. Set the date on your computer to October. 10th and time to 8 p.m. All right, do, 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 date and time settings. Set time automatically, no. Okay, let's see here. Date, time, manually change. I want it to be October 10th at 8, 20 p.m. That works. Okay, and then immediately fix that. All right, cool. All right, square up. <laughs> I can't believe Undertale lets us beat up furries. This is the best game ever made. <laughs> Thank you. 
More importantly, I can't believe that Undertale lets us kill inflation fetish art drawers. Because <laughs> that's what this guy is. Shit, no, that, that, Enzo, that is literally what this character is. I'm not making that up. That is, that is actually the, the thing. What's the fucking pleading face? Get out of here. Kill so sorry. After you're done, equip the burnt pan. Skip Metaton. I should wrong work here. Let's forget that ever happened, chat. <laughs> nice split. And I still golden, that's the funny thing. I just split like six years late. Missing the Undyne skip sucks because you have to take the intentional death. So if you remember, Undertale's Kickstarter mentioned something about your own fan troll getting into Undertale. Well, somebody donated and got theirs in, and uh, the person uh, is draws uh, furry inflation art. Yeah, I know, right, Bob? Yeah, Muffet was the donation to get your own character in. And then the So Sorry was your own fan troll. Muffet was a fan design character. That was the like the $500 back incentive. And then the So Sorry was the $1,000 one. And I think Glide and, Glide and Muffet were the two uh, characters, like the fan characters that got in. Don't worry, Temi Armor, my beloved, is coming soon. Do I have a consumable in my inventory? I just realized. Oh, I can use the bandage. Right, yeah. I think that's what the route does, actually. I'm pretty sure it uses the bandage as its consumable. Or wait, no, you wouldn't be able to... Okay, I'll just read what the guide says. If it says use a consumable, I'll go buy a fucking star fade or something. Yeah, the Temi Flakes are in the box, though. I, I can't get that.
No, you never get the dimensional, uh, the dimensional boxes. Because you never play that cutscene that gives it to you. Oh no, chair. Yep, betrayed undone with date with challenge. Okay. All right, reload. So 63 reload. Me uh, equip semi armor, kill metaton. Wait, <laughs> kill metaton. Nobody saw that. No! Ah, oh, fucking what? That nine. Mm. Yeah. Eh, it doesn't matter. Shay had a quad challenge, literally impossible. Can't hit a quad. Uh, let me see here. Okay, reload. Equip Timmy armor. Kill Metaton. Get the same thing. Damn, some of these are fucking wacky. These are just some funky endings. Alright, so this should be without consumables, I believe. Did you Geno yet? No. That's after this branch. So this is Betrayed Undone without Alfies or Consumables with Date. 
What is that ending name? What the fuck? <laughs> That's so long. Alright. Love 9 Temi Armor. Are you ready for big numbers? Big numbers give me serotonin. Watch this 450 damage quad here. Oh, it's more than I thought! Big number go brrrr! Hey chat, question for you. What's nine plus what's nine plus ten? Twenty-one <laughs> You stupid. <laughs> okay, let me just double check. So that was sixty-three, so sixty-four. Reload, kill two, kill Metaton, use Snowman piece. Okay, got it. Oh my god, it clips out of the box. Snowman piece, kill two. Damn, we don't get to use Timmy armor on this one. Shame. Because this is the bandage ending, so we don't get to use uh, Timmy armor. Don't worry, we get to use it again next ending. Shame. Yeah. By the way, we fight Metaton a lot of times in this branch. Oh, I didn't. They split. We fight Metaton a lot of times in this split. Almost had the meta task. So sad. One quad away. That's still really good though.
killing the monsters might have been for love. Yeah, I'm curious about that. I don't know what the exact point of that is. Oh, it's to make it betrayed Undyne. I didn't do the thing. It's going to be betrayed Undyne without kills, right? Wait, I guess fucking... Wait, wouldn't... But killing Metaton would count. Um... Maybe it is just for love. It might well be. No, I mean it might be for uh, it might be for the Metaton fight, Bane, not for I used a snowman piece, right? Yeah, I used it at the beginning. Alright, this should be, uh... Betrayed Undyne with date. Without Alfie's... With a bandage? <laughs> I think that's this ending? Good lord, these endings are getting ridiculous. Uh, I love the endings in this branch, just have the fucking stupidest names. Dude, Temi armor boosts your attack by 60. Sixty damage from armor, dude. That's ridiculous. Also 20 hours. I must have missed that earlier. No, wait, it didn't matter. I still kill here if I get a quad. Task order, return to kill me, let's go! Yeah, this is gonna be betrayed. <laughs> it's gonna be betrayed, undone without Alfie's with date with bandage. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Alright, so this is 64. This is the Alfie's date bandage. Alfie's date bandage. Alright, cool. Alright, uh, 65. Equip Timmy armor, kill Metaton. Use the bandage. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cute. It has using the consumable after Metaton, so it heals you after the love up. That's cute, but I don't need the health. <laughs> ah, fucker. Don't worry, we don't have too many more Metatons. Oh, we're almost done with the Betrayed Undines. And after that, there's no more Metaton fights, it's just Asgore. Where we get to fucking slice and dice Asgore various times with the, uh, the Temi armor. Please clap. Big shot. Oh, 
Big shot. Chance to be a big shot. Be a big, be a big, be a big shot. Now's your chance to be a big shot. He wouldn't have killed anyway. Ah, that would have killed. <laughs> What's your favorite boss fight? Sans. But we only get to fight him twice in this run. Now's your chance to be a big shot. Be a big, be a big, bad big shot. Now's your chance to be a big shot. Be a big, be a big. Brr, brr. Now's your chance to be a big shot. Be a big, be a big, bad big shot. Now's your Dude, the amount of times people have misheard that lyric are hilarious. Like, it's kind of crazy. How, like, people mishear it constantly. I used... Okay, cool. I used the bandage already. Come on. There we go. I believe this is my snowman piece ending. How do you know you aren't mishearing it? Because I'm not mishearing it. It's big, it's... Be a big, be a big, bad, big shot. Is what it is. <laughs> Anybody who thinks otherwise is mishearing it. It's very clearly that. Some people think it's like a bandage shot, and I'm like, what are you talking about? <laughs> what sense does that make? Uh, use the bandage, right? Yeah, okay. Sure. Oh, duh. There we go. How do you know you're not mis- hey, I'm not mishearing it. I mean, no. <laughs> I'm really not. Like, you can listen to it. It is very clearly be a big, be a big, bad, big shot. Like, you know, big, bad wolf type thing. It's very clearly what he's saying. It's not fucking bandage shot like some people think. Well, what? What? No. <laughs> Why would it be that? Because it's a figure of speech. Am I trolling? No, I'm not trolling. You guys are just... You don't have the ear. What's your so? I don't need to have a source. <laughs> my source is my fucking eardrum. I've listened to it enough to know what it is. Holy shit, y'all sound like fucking Ben Shapiro. Uh, do you have a source on that? Good lord. Twenty-three. Chat, I, okay. Not to sound like I'm full of myself, but as a musician of 20 years of, you know, 20 years of practice, person with perfect pitch, and a person with really good ears, I trust my own ears significantly more than any of you do. Or any, any, anybody else's. I literally... Uh, what is this fucking snowman piece? Yeah. That's right. Alright. Uh, Timmy armor. Use the snowman piece, but we'll do that after minutes on. But sure, keep arguing with a guy who, you know, is 
plays Deltarune, has more hours than anybody in the chat on Deltarune. You know, argue with that guy. He definitely doesn't know what he's talking about. He hasn't heard the song a million fucking times before or anything like that. Surely he's wrong and I'm right. <laughs> Surely. Look at the lyrics. There are no official lyrics. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. How many hours you got in Delta Rune? Well, if we're talking in total, I have more than you because of Chapter 1. But, uh, <laughs> you probably have a little bit more on Chapter 2 than I do, Ash, at this point. I think I have like 300 something. Bane, there isn't a compromise. I, I just disagree with you. I think you're wrong. <laughs> I, I, there isn't a compromise here. <laughs> I'm not changing my opinion. Ah, oh, man. Anyway. Well, it's not an opinion. It's not an opinion. It's fact. It's factual. That's like fucking going... That's like listening to a fucking album song. And, you know, being like, no, this lyric is different. And then, this, then it very clearly is what it is. It's like fucking Butch Hartman trying to tell me that it's that he's saying young Denny Fenton and not yo Denny Fenton. Like, no, he's saying yo. <laughs> you can hear it with your ears. Good lord. This is Yanni and Laurel? Yeah, and one of them was objectively correct. If you bring up Yanni and Laurel or the fucking dress, one of them was objectively correct and everybody else was wrong! It's not an opinion! It is what it is! Like, oh my gosh. <laughs> did I eat the snowman piece? Yes, I did. Cool. Oh, jeez. Did this turn into an argument? Yeah, I got people telling me I'm wrong when I'm not fucking wrong. It's so frustrating. Ridiculous. <sighs> Surely they started selling a white and gold version. Did the brand even get popular as a result as a result of that? What color is ruins? Now that one That one depends on a lot of factors, like the fucking saturation of your monitor. Also, I'm not super confident with that. I'm not an expert in color theory. <laughs> Hell, I barely- I didn't even know what Periwinkle looked like.
Is water wet? Is the sky blue? Yay. Yo, Gaster ending. Fog. Oh. Uh, is that right? Betrayed Undyne without Alfie's with date. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Whoa, 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 don't go to a different website there. Okay, uh, what do I do now? Reload. Equip Temi Armor will kill one monster. Okay. Skip Metaton. What did I just do? Must have spared by accident. Oh, right, I don't have a... Forgot about that. <laughs> no 100% flea rate because of Temi Armor. Does Temi Armor enable a kill there? That Because if it doesn't, that should be reversed. You should be equipping it after. So you get the flea chance. Sending 67, right? Okay. Uh, let's get Metaton and get this ending. Cool. Complicated. I think they died to King twice. Damn. Chat, move on. I don't want to talk about this anymore. Ugh. This has soured my mood immensely. Trying to shed some light on something. Here's thanks. Yo, seven ninety nine. Sheesh. All right. Uh, this should be what? The trade undine with date without consumables. Oh boy, we have to do a no fucking temi armor next. Yay.
trade on dying without day without consumables. Yep. Okay. Kill one. Use the snowman piece. That's not gonna kill. Yeah, Temi Armor doesn't enable a kill. That needs to be changed in the guide to say, uh, equip Temi Armor after you get your kill, so you get the guaranteed flee from the frog here. Use a snowman piece. Punch guard. Wait, that's not enter Asgore. Whoa, 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 hey, hey, hey. <laughs> whoa, 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 hey, 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 whoa. <laughs> Don't get ahead of myself there. I use my consumable, yeah. So this should be with bandage. Oh, the end is almost in sight. Fucking hell. The end is near. It's almost over! Yeah, we still got two whole genocides to do. They saved the most boring part of Drew Hunter for the end. After this, we've got to... we got to do genocide, then charred mode, then genocide again, and then another one final uh, pass of this run. Oh, man. Sorry about that, chat. I just... Uh, I let that get to me way more than I should have. Take out my frustration on this fucking bitch ass. I don't like being told that I'm wrong about something. That's that I know I'm not. It's like it, that frustrates me, but it also kind of frustrates me more than it should. But in order to describe why it frustrates me, I'd have to go into a uh, quite a bit of personal depth. <laughs> All right. Uh... With bandage, right. Okay, kill monster, Temi armor second. How many endings are there? 93. It all started when I was born. I, uh, Temi armor and use the bandage. 
damage. Nice fucking split, dumbass. Seems like you could skip Metaton. Where the fuck am I? There we go. <laughs> I was, where where in the world? I am in Narnia right now, dude. <laughs> I'm just, yeah, I'm just gonna play that one safe. Okay, uh, enter Asgore. I think this is the... By the way, nice ending. I use the bandage, okay. 69 is Betrayed Undyne with Date and with the Snowman piece. That's what- Ryan, we use the bandage as the consumable. That's some smart fucking routing. Honestly, some genuinely heads up routing here to get all of this. The fact that you could get all of these endings this close to each other is just preposterous. I love it. But we're almost finished. This is our, uh... Ending 70 will be our final Betrayed- Wow. I shouldn't say that because there is technically one more Betrayed Undyne in the run, but that's our final neutral run. So this will be Betrayed Undyne with Date and with Snowman Peace. You're very good at this, thank you. Hey, what's up, Taz? Hope you're doing well. What's the Geno name gonna be? Uh, I'll get to name Solus Geno. I won't get to name, Gen Geno will be named uh, Y still. I get to name the Solus file though, so. And that'll be, uh. I kinda like fuck, honestly. I think fuck is a good name for, for the final, for the last name. <laughs> Almost won the lottery again. All right, this should be uh, killing one monster and using the snowman piece and equipping Temi armor. Fuck. Oh, I wonder if equipping Temi armor gives you so much like power that a whiff kills Whimsum here. Interesting. Maybe that should be better described. Equip Timmy armor, use the snowman piece. All right, this is it, this is it. This is Betrayed Undyne with Date. One more, there we go. Trade Undyne with Date. Okay.
You doing all right? Yeah, I'm just thinking about something. By the way, just on the discussion earlier, um, just making sure we're all talking about the same track, right? I'm talking about now's your chance to be a not, not big shot. I just want to make sure you guys are aware of that. <laughs> because the other one's a little glitchy. Yeah, I think some people may have been very confused as to what piece of music we were talking about. Now, I'm like, I'm thinking it back in my head. I'm like, how can people not hear? Oh, they're probably listening to the wrong track. <laughs> I should have clarified that better. That's my bad. I, I should have clarified that better. That's that's on me. But yeah, no, I'm, I'm talking about that track. The train on number three! Okay, uh, now, is family ending without Alfie's? Reload, skip Metaton, do not do Alfie's elevator skip. Chat, seems like you can skip Metaton. <laughs> oh, my double, I, tri I triple buffered. Never before seen. All right, we don't even need to do the skip anyway, so it doesn't matter. Okay, do not do Alfie's elevator skip, save before Asgore. I, okay, how did I think I was going to be able to read that split? To save the Temi armor is what it says, but I, I wouldn't have been able to read that. Alright, this is going to be family ending without Alfie's with challenge. The third of our challenge endings. And the, and the second to last. Uh, Temi armor. Wait, save here. Now Temi armor. Now go. Okay, <laughs> cool. Had to get that right. Yo, thank you, uh, Fruitcake. I appreciate that. Sorry if I was... No, you're fine, Kuchar. I hear that, yeah. Well, it's clearer in Now's Your Chance to Be Out, which is why I was talking about that track. That's what I think of, even though Big Shot has, like, the crunchy samples. I... I'm actually not sure if it's the same sample, though. Because I don't hear that in Big Shot. In Big Shot, I just hear Be A Big, Be A Big, Be A Big Shot. I... But I hear it much more clearly in the other one, which is... I, I'm... I'm curious if they're the same sample. They might not be the same sample. Wait a minute. Wait. Wait, which ending is this again? Oh no, I, this isn't the challenge ending. This is the non consumable Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute, what the fuck? <laughs> I thought, <laughs> I was like, wait, why do we equip Temi armor if we're getting the challenge ending? No, challenge ending is the, the fifth one. We actually have five Asgores here to fight instead of the usual four. We'll do consumables, bandage, snowman piece, the normal ending, and then the challenge last because we need to keep the challenge intact for, uh... We need to keep challenge intact for the next, uh, the next couple of endings. Because we need to... These are the family ending without Alfie's. And then we're gonna go, after this, we're gonna go date Alfie's. Then we're gonna come back and get those endings. And that has a challenge variation as well, so. We need to keep the challenge intact. So it makes sense that we're doing these first. Also, we already did family ending without Alfie's with challenge. That was fucking 61. I'm stupid. <laughs> 61 is fucking... is that one. That We did it first. That's right. I forgot. I, I got confused because there's such a big space in between them, right? Alright, 71. So this should be family ending without Alfie's, without consumables. 
get a jump on the next ending. The next ending, 72, is Snowman Piece only. Alright, this is the final difficult Asgore of the run. Actually, the last ones. No, we have pie on the last one, actually. If I'm correct, this should be the last... No, wait, we did. there's one more. There is one more. We have to do the, uh, the family ending with Alfie's with Bandage. That will be the hardest. So this is the second to last of the loved one, no assist Asgore's. There's one more after this. Aw, oh, Ash. Glad. You're not stupid. You're in a giant marathon run? That is true. I am currently fucking... Almost 21 hours in. Damn, at this rate, we're gonna have a fucking sub-day Geno, dude. Holy shit. Wait, that's crazy. Because if I remember correctly, we hit 24 hours in, like, in the soulless selling your soul break. We're almost an hour ahead of that. I beat Radiant Pure Vessel, yo, congratulations! Sad. I'm just thinking to myself, I did get every yellow credit, right? I'm just going through it in my head before I fucking, like, forget to do something. Let's see. I got it in, uh... Got Froggin, Whimson, Mold Small, uh, Luke's, Vegetoid, Migosp, Ice Caps, Snow Drake, Gift Trot, that's all the Snowden enemies. Uh, all of the dogs didn't use the stick on them. Got Aaron, Washua, Mold Big, Temi, Vulcan, Thunderplane, uh, High Rope, and all five core enemies. Okay, I think that's everybody. Yeah, it should be all of them. Did I get Mold Small? Yes, I got Mold Small and Ruins. Alright, this should be... Family Ending... Without Alfie's... With Bandage! Yeah! I know how to do it. Alright. Use Temi Armor. Use the Bandage. Alright, this will be the Snowman Piece Ending. And then we get fan we get just regular fucking Family Ending next. We're coming up on the single most common neutral ending, I, I'd, I'd bargain. I think 74, which is just family ending without Alphys, I'm pretty certain is probably the most done neutral ending. Thoughts? Because that is just, don't kill anybody, but you don't date. Like, this is the ending you get if you play pacifist neutral. And you date Undyne before, uh, before going to, uh, Asgore. But most casual players are gonna do that. No, not on first playthrough, but I just mean in general, right? Like, I think most people who come back to play this game, this is the ending they'll do. Because this is, this is the most you can do on a pacifist route before fighting Flowey. For the first time.
You either get this ending or you get a... Uh... What's the ending you get if you don't date Undyne? It is betrayed Undyne, right? Yeah? Tell me more, baby. 23! That's 24? Wait, what? Oh, shit. Okay, I was doing better than I thought. That's 24. Alright. Damn. <laughs> hey, Patrick. 24. <laughs> Alright, this should be, uh... Snowman Peace family ending without Alphys, yeah. Okay. Alright, and now we just... Snowman Peace, Temi Armor. And this will just be family ending without Alphys. I have lyrical debate, yeah. And then I realized, you know, I'm sitting there like annoyed, like for like 10 minutes before I'm like, wait a minute, we're all talking about the same thing, right? Because <laughs> I'm just like sitting there playing it in my head, like trying to think of what it, to think of it. And I'm like, wait. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> The real big shot was the friends we made on the way. True! Hey Patrick. Hey SpongeBob. You wanna know it's not you wanna know it's funnier than 24? No! <laughs> Fuck! No! Damn it, my hubris. I think I can still miss one in Tazgore, though, with Temi armor. Now, 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 now I definitely can't. <laughs> it's okay, we still got like four, five more of these assholes. Yeah, because the next, the next branch, which is family ending with Alphys, has five Asgore fights because of challenge. So funny. Pretend I didn't read that. No, 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 that's a Shay quote. That is, Kuchar is directly quoting his favorite e-boy there. That is a, a, a direct Shay quote. It's even, I'm pretty sure it's in the guide. It means like, to make sure not to get hit by Spamton's fucking balls. <laughs> he throws giant fucking balls at you. I mean, that's what he, that's the attack. <laughs> the consequences. All right. All right, Und uh, family ending without Alphys. All right, uh, uh, reload. Ride the boat to Snowden. I can run into this. Ride the boat to do the do what? No, no, it can't be. It's impossible. It's improbable. It would never happen in a speed run. I have to boat to Snowden. What kind of place is this? All right, here we go. 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 Here we go, chat. The moment you've been waiting for.
Bathroom break's coming up, but I'm gonna try to make sure it happens during the credits so I don't lose any time. Boat to Snowden! Woo! Let's go! Yeah, baby! That's what I've been waiting for! That's what it's all about! <laughs> Mandatory boat to Snowden! Alright, hold on. Get Undyne's letter. Go to Papyrus' house, drop Undyne's letter. 101% only. Wow, I forgot she- wait, she calls you right there? Huh. I- Okay, uh, go to Papyrus' house. Drop Undyne's letter. Goodbye, Undyne's letter. Go to Sans's room. Yeah, you do Mad Mew Mew right now, if you're playing on Switch. What? Where's the... What? Why don't I have the... Um... What? Why don't I have the key? I got the key. I got the key. We even watched me get the key. Why don't I have the key? Uh, well, I can get this. I definitely got the key. Where am I saved? Did I save in Judgment Hall? Oh, I think I did too. Fuck, and I think that disables this. Did you save after getting the key? It says not to. Get it in Solus? I guess I can do that. Yeah, that works. Uh, okay. Okay, yeah, the guide's wrong. Please update that. Uh, okay. You know, there's a sunlock soon. Do not date. Okay. We'll go to date Alfie's now. Okay, we'll just get it in Solus. That's not a big deal. We can get it in Solus. That's fine. Solus is a challenge ending, so. That's not that big of a deal. Yeah, it says, it doesn't say save. It doesn't say save after getting the key. In fact, that doesn't make sense because that would, that would update the plot value and you wouldn't be able to go back and do Metaton. That's not routed correctly. No, I got the Undyne Letter EX, Tara. It's, an, uh, it's a second item you have to get. So wait, you have to save after getting the key? No, 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 Fixie, this is using the route in the document. Wait, is that gonna fuck me over later? Cause don't I have to kill a monster? I can't... How am I gonna do that? Hold on, wait. What's the final ending? Betrayed Undyne. Good champ. Oh, it's just not- Okay, no, 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 we can totally get it. We can totally get it in the last ending. Okay, that's fine. We can- we can get it there. No worries. Which document? The- type exclamation point hundo. That is the one I'm using. Okay. Cool, that's fine, that, that's okay, that's okay, that's okay, that's okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Yeah, you don't need to kill a monster, so, we're good. We're good there. We can get it, we can get it in the last ending. Alright, let's go back to Asgore now. Jesus, that was a fucking stress hit I did not fucking need. Yeah, that needs to be rewritten. Uh, Holland. Okay, so, scroll back up, where are we here? 
Talk to Undyne. Unlock scenes work well. Not doing that in this ending. Date Alphys, but do not complete True Lab save before Asgore. Yeah, because I ran into that Asgore trigger, I can't do the Sands cutscene again, too. It's a this, it should just be done in this ending. I don't know why it's not just done in this ending. They should update it so all of that is put into ending 75 instead. And then just tell you to miss the like the punch card, the Asgore trigger on the way back, right? So that way you can still interact with Sands and get the key, and it doesn't fuck up any of your flags at all. Because where it's at right now doesn't make sense, because if you do the Sands cutscene and then save, you won't be able to respawn Metaton. Because it will, it'll get rid of Metaton. Metaton won't be there anymore. Oh, right, died. Skip the fuck out of Casper. Not the same dock that's on SRC? What? There's two different ones? What? This is the same one I used, or this is, I, I didn't update the command at all. Imagine Sans is here the whole time. Like, no, I know he's not because we've updated the plot flag. Where'd you find that dock? This is what I used last time. I don't remember who sent it to me, but this was the official one at the time. Oh, hey. Uh, okay. Save. Go. So this should be challenge. But I don't remember running into this last time. I don't remember having this issue. That's weird. Because let's see here. It says, save in Judgment Hall, then get to the get to the key to Sans room by reloading and talking to Sans multiple times. It says not to save. Because it says save, and then do the key thing, then get the ending, then reload. What the fuck? So wait, there's two... I, I didn't even like all I, I didn't even go to SRC. I just typed exclamation point hundo because I thought that was only one dock. Uh okay, yeah. I didn't realize there was multiple ones. Oh, that's interesting. But the one on, yeah, like this one, I thought this was the updated one because it mentions MDS, so I thought this was the right one. That's bizarre. Well, again, it's no big deal. It's really not a big deal. It's like at the most, it's like three minutes of time loss. We'll just do it in. Uh, we'll do it in the final ending. Just remind me to do it then. But we'll get it then, and we'll just uh, you know boat to Snowden. Like we'll go out of our way. It's not a big deal. We got plenty of time to burn. It's at most three minutes, right? Like, it takes, like, three minutes. The the amount of times we've talked to Stan stays. So he'll give us the key immediately, right? Uh, this should be challenge. This should be family ending with Alfie's with challenge. Yeah, I think both guides have the same mistake, too. Huh. That's... That count's deleted. Oh, okay. Well, that's not a big deal. Yeah, you're right. That is deleted post-Jenna. Okay, cool. Family ending with Alfie's with challenge. Cool. All right. Uh, I think we... Hold on a second. Do we use a consumable, then save here? Okay. Reload. Use the snowman piece. 
get this ending. Wait, what? Oh, I guess we do this one first? Oh, because we only have one consumable. <laughs> Alright. We'll be using the... So, yeah, okay. I see. I see how this wants us... How it wants us to do that. That's smart. Because we only have the one consumable, so we need to use the bandage. What ending is the mistake in? 61. All of that, the stuff with sands, that should just be moved to ending, uh... Just take that entire bit and just move it all to ending 90... 91. Would be where to put it. Like, where it says save in Judgment Hall, just do the, uh... Do it then, right? Yeah, it would be better, it would be more optimal to do it then, so you don't mess up with any of the other routing, right? I thought that the key was- so, okay, what I got confused with is that the amount of times you've talked to Sans is in Undertale I and I, but the key is a save file flag. I think that was where my confusion came in. I, th I thought you just got the key and then it was just there. So we got a couple of things on the guy that need to be fixed up. I, hmm. Yeah, do you have any idea who ha oh, who owns the guy that I'm using right now? <laughs> Because it's the updated one, it has MDS stuff in it, it has like, recalculated money totals, and all that. I saw all those and thought this was the right version, because it's updated. Not in the community anymore, okay. Yeah, true fixer. Oh, Karlamov owns it? Yeah, I thought that was correct. Did, did they get banned for some reason? Oh, 79, nice. I thought they were still around. Okay, uh... Okay, let's see here. Um, so this is going to be Alfie's bandage. Okay, next ending, we equip Timmy Armor, save. So this should be Alfie's bandage. Yep. Uh, equip Timmy Armor, save. Yeah, that's interesting. Well, it's, again, it's not a big deal or anything. It's kind of like last time where we had that fucking scare with uh, the key <laughs> in genocide. <laughs> Remember that from last time? Goodness, what a... Im imagine having a panic that late into the run. That was, that was scary. But it all worked out. Yeah, I invalidated Poke's run in real time. Whoops! What happened? I, um... Every other true hundo run got invalidated because none of them actually used the mystery key on the door and unlocked it. And I thought it was fucked because I I, uh, I, di I didn't realize you could backtrack in Geno. So 
So I'm sitting there like like scrambling, like, oh no, I, I'm not gonna be able to do this. I'm not gonna have money to buy the key in Pacifist. But then it was like, no, you can just backtrack. I was like, okay. So I backtracked in Geno to go open the door. So it worked out, but it was terrifying. <laughs> so that's gonna be the same thing. We're gonna have to get Sansa's key a second time here. And we'll have to make this the the, the pilgrimage out to Snowden. <laughs> Completely out of the way, but it's fine. It wasn't just Pokes run, it was every true Hundo run. Like, all the not legit ones, all of them... I mean, they were already not legit, but like, all of them would have been... If any of them were, they would have all been hit by that as well. Ocean, I agree with that. I think it should be in the in the super mods hands. You're still the super mod for the category extensions, right? I gave you that. You still have it. And can we move Papyrus ending back to the first slot, please? Goodness. All right, family ending without consumables. Cool. All right. Uh, what? Use the bandage. Get this ending. All right. This is. We're almost over, chat. Only two more. Only four more neutral endings. And now one of them. One of them has to go get Sans's key, but that's fine. You know, it's better that than, than the run not being alive. Probably after you get some rest. It'll be fresh on my mind, though. Yeah, no, the route as it is right now is completely fine. Just switch, switch back those two endings, because, like, Papyrus ending should be first. It's the hardest of the no-save endings, so it should come first. Not be, It shouldn't come sixth, because it saves one frame or whatever. Like, get out of here. <laughs> Yeah, it was interesting. I was a mod for CE. I was a super mod for CE. And then I gave it up because I just wasn't invested in CE anymore. And then flash forward like two years, they were like, hey, you want to be a mod again? I was like, okay. Hey, SpongeBob. Hey, Patrick. Want to know a number 20 funnier than 24? 25! <laughs> hey Quinn, how are you doing lovely? Take care of yourself, thank you. I'm relaxed now, we had a little bit of a, a, a fright regarding Sansa's key, but I can get it in a later ending. I can get it in a uh, Betrayed Undyne with Date. Or it's Betrayed Undone with Challenge, I think, is the last neutral ending. Okay. This should be Alfie's ending, or Family Ending with Alfie's and Snowman Piece. Yep. And this is it. Use the Snowman Piece. Get this ending. Alright. Here we go. Family Ending with Alfie's. It's almost time to do True Pacifist. 80 endings in. 
How are the cat ears? Good. <laughs> oh boy. We have... After this, we have two more neutral endings. Only two more Asgores. This is our third to last Asgore. Twenty six. Woo! I'm a fucking monster, dude. Back to back. Oh, yeah. Capping it off. Let's go, dude. All right, let me read. What are we doing next? Reload, go to True Lab. Get bad memory, get I guess potato chips is in uh is in Solus. For some reason, might as well just get it now. I have I have so much money. <sighs> Alright. Let's go. Appreciate it, Zillicon. Thank you. That loses time. Don't do that. <laughs> it's time to finally do true pacifist chat. Let's go. All right. Uh, we need to grab bad memory. Our first non-neutral ending, we finally made it! <laughs> it only took me 21 hours, but I'm finally gonna beat the game, guys. <laughs> Alright. Well, let's go! Alright, nothing else I need to grab before I go in, right? Let me just make sure... Do item act to get a bad memory. Get Endogany's cr Yeah, don't forget about that. <laughs> uh, get Endogany's credit. Do the dream act on Asriel to get dream. Alright, so we just gotta get... I can grab potato chips, too. Why not? I'll just do it now so I don't forget about it later. I only have, like, a more billion dollars right now. Or Popato Chisps, excuse me. Alright, save. Popato Chisps. Get that shit out of my inventory. <laughs> I don't need that. I have the Temi armor. Okay, I save because I wanted to make sure I get this. So I need to get bad memory. This is very important. This is super easy to forget this item exists, so. Item. Okay, we... Let me verify that it's there. I can just tank it. Dude, I'm so chunky. Alright, there's bad memory. Cool. Uh, so, join. 
Dude, I'm so chonky! <laughs> Dude, Tebby Arbor's so broken. <laughs> so good. I love it. Oh, bathroom break's coming soon, but I want to try to get to, like, the credits so I, you know, don't lose any time. Alright, no skipping. We don't have the stick. Oh, I have to do this the, the fucking long way. Fuck. We have to we have to do this the hard way. Alright, based. Alright, chat. When's the last time you've seen some of these attacks? Because I haven't seen some of them in God knows how long. No, we don't get Hush Puppy. We get that in uh the next ending. Or the next time we're here. Uh Beckon. Pets. Wait, we don't have the stick. We sold it. And we don't have the hush up, the get the hush puppy in this ending either. Uh... Oh, wait, did I? Oops, I need a pet. Whoops. I already played with them once. Based. Guess who didn't soft lock? This guy. Why hasn't the hush puppy gotten on this run? Honestly, I've got no, no idea. That doesn't make sense to me. I think it should be on this one. Because, you know, you won't, this is the one you need to use it. <laughs> this is like the one, the one time. <laughs> no. No, you want it. You want it. You want it. Watch this menuing. Hush puppy is included. No, we get it in a uh, in this run. We get it in a uh, in Solus. It's routed in to get in the Solus branch. What I'm confused about is why it's routed to be there when it would be useful in this ending when we have sold the stick and like you know have to get in Dogany's yellow credit. We don't have to do that in Solus. So like. Why would it not be here? That doesn't make sense to me. It should be here. We have plenty of slots in our inventory for it. Or we just need one hot dog. Maybe money? I'm rich. I'm actually... Look, I have 665 gold. I am a rich man. No, no, no. What you can do, though... Okay, okay. Chat. You can use a stick item, and then it stops Endogony from moving entirely. And then you can do all of the acts and it skips all of its turns. Yeah. Do you have stick in Solus? You should? I can't think of a reason you wouldn't have it. Not like you drop it for anything. Smell. You could get, no, all the other credits need to be at the same time though.
You skipped Lemon Bread? No, I didn't. I skipped Reaper Bird. Its credit is yellow by default. I skipped the hell out of Casper. Not sure that's a requirement. Somebody said it was. Somebody said it was in the rules. And I just went off that. Yeah, I think that's in the category rules, right? Because, like... You wouldn't be able to verify it, because if you said if it could be done at any point throughout the run, it'd be a verification nightmare, because you could just do them through all of the neutral endings. It's always been routed to do it all at once, as if it was required all at once. But it would be really weird if, say, like, you know, in ending 8, you get Froggit's yellow credit, and ending 1, you get Whimsons and, like, all that. It would be like, wait, that's weird. And it wouldn't even count because they only matter in pacifist, so it, it doesn't make sense for it to be outside of pacifist. And it's not like, you know, verification takes time with it or anything like that. Like, it, verification's done in the run, so... Because you have to get to no-hit credits at least once. That's how I feel about it. But there's a couple of other ruling-related things. Besides redoing the guide, I think we should also re-examine the ruling for uh, breaks. I think that every 12 hours played should get you 12 hours in break. Like, beyond just a one break you're allowed. Because, like, what if a runner takes, like, 40 hours to play this category? Like, that would be unfair to expect them to do it in two... 20 hour sessions like that's really unhealthy and then willie suggested maybe also in addition to having a 12 minute break or a 12 hour break also a 30 minute break as well for like you know food a uh, dream all right we got all the items it's the end Oh, yeah! <laughs> no! <laughs> Doesn't matter, we have 10 VR, man. Holy cow, I can't believe we're 21 hours in and we're finally fighting Asriel. Bye. 
thought you were supposed to be the Undertale Goat. How come it took you 21 hours to get here? Uh, Asgore got in my way. Like, like 79 times. It was really annoying. <laughs> Who would win? <laughs> One speedrunner or 79 Asgores? I love Temi armor. God, I love being able to turn my brain off while I play this. Just, Temi armor is so nice for this category because you could you don't even have to play well in order to dodge things. It's just like, oh hey, everything does three damage. Nice. It makes you do about a more billion damage. Okay. Oh, oh, I'm better. I'm I'm skilled. I'm the best. I, I'm so good. I'm so good at Undertale, dude. <laughs> He's just constructed differently. I don't, that was like the hardest hypergoner I've ever seen. What in the world? Behold my true power. Oh, it does nothing. No damage. Ha! Is that all you've got? Pathetic. Pathetic! Oh, he got- he cheated. He cheap shot at me and hit me in the menu. Real honorable there. I have no idea what the non-Pi optimal menuing for Toriel and Asgore are. Honestly, I have absolutely no idea. <laughs> I think it's probably act twice on Tori, act twice on Asgore, and the last one's hug. Good thing there's only this one attack can do it. Smile. <laughs> yeah, imagine being able to hit you in the menu. What a great game mechanic. <laughs> nah, I'm rooting for you, kid. Forbidden attacks, cursed attacks, never before seen attacks. Cursed, evil, bad footage, delete. Viewing of this tape is prohibited, discarded immediately.
That was faster than the one we normally do. Are you sure this is well tested? <laughs> that was less dialogue <laughs> than the hug Asgore. Because it didn't have a thing, it didn't have like a, you know, seeing how sweet you are, the other soul's memories, blah blah blah. I'm pretty sure anyway. Can't touch this. Do 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 can't touch this. Do 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 Because I care about you. Why? I really like the detail of how the fire is coming right from his hands. It's also kind of like tears. My feels, man. I see, Pleb. Okay, thank you for pointing that out. I see, I get it. Why? Why I? Why I oughta? Why would I ever hug the goat? Are you kidding me? That, that sounds like a terrible idea. Mug the goat! 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 Wait, 10 subs if I do? If I hug? Wait, 10 subs if I hug the goat. Am I reading that right? Yeah? Oh, fucking hell, okay. Bro, <laughs> you think I'm not taking that? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Bro, 20, I am 4, 50 minutes ahead right now. Also, I used to split at the barrier cracking, ignore that. I am 50 minutes ahead right now. <laughs> Yo, Ab, I thought you were the 10 gift subs. Okay. <laughs> oh, I really gotta go pee, chat. But it's okay, the credits are coming, so I have my chance soon. Woo! It'll probably be my last bathroom break of the run, too. Oh, wait, I didn't preload. Oh, that's okay. I'm gonna do the most forbidden strategy of all time. Are you ready? Oh, yeah. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> that used to be what they did back in the day before the preload was found out. <laughs> All right.
Uh, okay, we're doing this one first, I guess. <laughs> sure. Who cares? You can do it in either order. Okay, I'll be right back. Bathroom. Alright, sheesh. <laughs> Before my chat tries to prank me and tell me that I missed, like, Muffet's yellow credit. <laughs> I think he's split in the wrong place. Oh, I do it for no hit credits, you're right. Required to watch the credits, we need to know hit the credits. And also verify the. <laughs> we also need to verify uh, if we got all AYC. Yo! Yo, 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 yo. Hold on, let me get the name on that real quick. Because Brian wasn't being drowned out by the music. Uh, da, 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 da. Yo. Oh, Okta, thank you for the $15. I appreciate you. Thanks for the good luck on finishing it out. We don't got too much left. Everything else is pretty straightforward, other than I have to remind, I have to scream at myself to go, uh, I have to scream at myself to go fucking, uh, <laughs> to get Sans's key in 91. credits yeah you can tell this guide was updated fairly recently because it, in 91 it mentions you can use the pie on asgore since it's not considered a consumable but it's strongly recommended to change to check the sans phone call to make sure it has the challenge introduction like it even mentions that so this had to have been updated very recently because that wasn't even discovered until like pretty recently I love gay people. Yo, gay people are rad. All right. Here we go. No hits, credits. <sighs> it's not, I'm plenty good at this. Let's not make any stupid mistakes. I don't really want to watch the credits again and lose like 40 minutes. It's not that much. It's like five, but it's still a lot of time lost. <sighs> okay. 
Dude, it's like this is the easiest thing in the world for me, but it's hard because the pressure's on. Hi, me. Relax. Nicholas? Nicholas? And where's fucking Jeremy? <laughs> cool. All right. I think I can lose the game now. Uh... Yeah, I think we're good to go. Okay, cool. All right. Jeez. Uh, all right. I need to do without Toriel now. Because I did with Toriel first by accident because I forgot. Oh, jeez. Dude, no hit credits is not difficult, but it's so, like, stressful. No, I'm still running this game, Octa. Like, no, I've, I've, I'm really good at the credits. It's just really hard when the pressure like that is on, because, like, it suddenly you have the threat of the fact that you'll lose five minutes if you mess it up. Here we go, chat. It's genocide time, baby! Woo! Da 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 Follow genocide route up to core. All right. Take every item from the Snowden shop. Use the bicycle. Dump everything in a box before waterfall. Buy every item from Burger Pants shop. Cool. All right. So we get we get the uh, we get the Snowden shop and we get the uh, the Burger Pants shop in this route. And then I think Solus is when we get the other two shops. We get Gerson and. Uh, we get Gerson and uh, Braddy and Caddy in. Yes, that's correct. Hey, it even mentions to unlock the house. And there's even a save reload strat for it. All right, good night, Willie. Take care of yourself. Hope you guys like genocide because we're about to do it twice.
Oh man. Ba -da -da -da. Don't forget Sans key. Yeah, I'll get it. I also want to take a uh, a copy of my save files before I erase in this ending because I want to see the just the fucking boisterously large Undertale that I and I after this is all over. I beat my PB. Yo, congratulations! Isn't a boarding Geno at Muffet faster? No, you don't have to wait through the cutscene either way. It's faster in a, in a in a sealed environment, but when you're doing both endings like this at once, it's fastest to do it this way. Because this way gets you the high. It gets, this way gets you love 17 for Asgore. Which saved the turn. Also, we don't get the spider donut in this one. There isn't a convenient save point to a like it's it, when you're when you're doing them both like this it's it's faster to kill Muffet. Show me the whimsen. That's not a whimsen. Surely not. Surely I won't be getting a single at eighteen. That'd be preposterous. Surely single mold won't be my first encounter in here, right? Surely not. You always get a good RNG? True. See you, Westina. Okay. Oh no, it's gonna be 18. <laughs> no, no, it couldn't, it can't be. It can't happen. It can't happen. Please, I've been playing this game. I've been playing this game for 21 hours. Don't do it to me, please. Please. No, 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 no. If it's a single mold, I swear to God, dude. <laughs> I swear to God. Please just give me a frog at Whimson just this once, please. Can I just have a good ruins? <laughs> Come on, it's 21 hours in. What's the worst that could happen? Oh! Oh my god, pigs are flying! <laughs> pigs are flying! Jesus is back! The Detroit Lions went to the Super Bowl? Oh my god! It's a fucking miracle! This would be a sub 10? No. Well, yes, but that's because there was no flowy cutscene at the beginning. Do I get ice cream? Ice cream? Get some ice cream if you want to. Not even God can get Detroit a Super Bowl. That's true. That's true. That's true. That's true. I That is so true. I agree with that. That's true. Oh. 
<sighs> Listen, when a Jaguars fan can laugh at you, that's how you know it's bad. Did he get 7 for 7? We don't, uh, MDS is later. I'm 6 for 6 at the moment. Okay, let me just make sure I'm not missing any items here. Uh, it's just the Snowden shop and the Burger Pants shop and nothing else. Okay. At least you had 2017 and 1999. Where we went to the AFC Championship game and lost to the Titans. And then they went and lost the Super Bowl. And still haven't won one yet. The Jacksonville Jaguars were 15-0 against the league. And 0-3 against the Titans that year. Miserable, dude. <laughs> Probably the best team that year. Literally... 15-0 and 0 against the rest of the league and 0-3 and against the Titans, losing in their two matches in the regular season and in the AFC title game. Miserable. After we shit all over Dan Marino's legacy by going 63-7 and or whatever against him in that playoff game. Do you have to talk about sports? What? You don't like sports, Charm? What's wrong with sports? We are over 50 minutes ahead. Go to Yo, Baconator got a GD with the five months and also coffee beans with the prime as well. Thank you so much. Just check hashtag sports in the Discord. Uh... Oh, 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 the fucking leaves. Sorry about that. Only 51 minutes ahead? Well, we're gonna take about a- we're gonna sack about three and a half minutes getting the fucking key again, but... Not that big a deal. Wait, who's this guy? Sands?! It's ice to meet Shut up. Do you watch John Boy's videos? Of course. I love John Boy's. Super well edited. Behold. Prepare to die, Ice Cap. Watch this. 
Damn. Hey, Flutter. Hope you're doing well, friend. We're, we're on from the hard part. Now we're on to the part where I turn my brain off and play Genocide and do a couple of other things. This is literally... This is just genocide ending, but you also raid two shops on the way. It's genocide of the snow area. It's basically snow grave! <laughs> Have fun, rabid. Or, er, rabid. Uh, Redbird, I think. Have fun. I wonder how, I wonder why. And anybody loves the big blue sky. Twenty-two hours. Only four more to go. The pain is almost over, chat. I don't have to do these. I... Yeah. Yo, Ice Puzzle Skip! Woo! God, I can't believe I ran this category twice. <laughs> I'm just thinking about how foolish it is of me to run this category a second time. Speaking of foolish. Nope! Oh, it's even worse! Ah! 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 He has one HP. Why would you do it again? Because it keeps me awake, I'm not gonna lie. Also, it's the only- ch Oh no, wait, I have water, hold on, wait. Mm. What was he drinking? Flaming hot Mountain Dew, and it is fucking terrible. I wonder how, wonder why. Yeah, it's a bad man. He said it wasn't bad. It started off not bad. It has gotten progressively, insidiously worse. Ah. Eh. Ow. We hit Jenna. We hate Jenna. We hate Jenna. We hate Jenna. We hate Jenna. How much to run Hundo a third time? What was it? It was a thousand sub points last time, right? I gotta up the ante. 1500 and I'll do it again. Yeah, fucking Coke Gaming drops in and drops off fucking 10,000 subs.
God, this is so fucking enthralling. I can't wait to do it a second time. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> we love Solus. We love Solus. We love Solus. Wonder how, I wonder why. It's about a lot about a blue blue sky. Your VCs are very comfy. That's good. I'm glad. Pope Francis SMO. Did that person drop like a thousand subs to Ganon or something like that? You heard it here first. I will run back True Hundo a third time if I get to 1500 subscriber points. Give me another fucking do. I, I don't even want to think about the flaming hot one. Give me an ice cold do, baby. Get this shit into the trash can. Wait, does my my trash can doesn't even have room? I'll just keep it on the desk. Yo, duckable, thank you for the good luck. Oh fuck, I'm not tapped in. There we go. Ice Cap and Chill Drake confront you, sighing, Jerry. Also, why do I get a triple at 13 in true hundo? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> That's impossible. Never before seen. All right, here we go. A one. Now let's only count the nines. Oh. No one. Is it really only going to be one? Am I going to be one off? Fuck you, dude. Just let me have the satisfaction of getting the quick kill. One time. All right, raid the store. Hey. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, give me not that, 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 and that. And then use the bicycle to get the unicycle. Get rid of all this fucking garbage. Let's be on our way. I don't think I forgot anything. I meant to do the funny thing, but I didn't do it. Yes. It feels so good. Welcome to the underground. How are your balls? Uh, if you want to look around, give us your balls. How much time am I saving here? Hello? Guys, it's a 22 Snowden. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, no, I'm, I'm way too fucking exhausted for that. Jesus fucking hell. Yeah, has it's a 22 Snowden. It's wrong kind of, wrong 22, but it'll work. <laughs> fucking hell. Twenty-two Snowden. I didn't specify twenty-two minutes. <laughs> oh, twenty-two hours. My bad. <laughs> Surely Aster has to show up on this one, right? We're not gonna get Clam Girl a seventh time, right? Clam Girl can't even show up on Geno. I don't think. Pretty sure if the fun, the, the, just nothing happens. <laughs> Some 30 inter laugh. <laughs> Bee piss. Here we go. Who's ready for Gaster? Woo! Damn it. <laughs> you won't show up. Where is he? I moved my menu bag right. Okay, cool. Get you a guy that can cock, cook. Get you a cock that can cook, cook, cock. Get you a cock? No. Get you a guy that can cock? No. It's you a cook that can cock. Fuck. Ballot shoes. Are you okay? This is the worst part of the run. This is just... This is sa sadness and agony. All rolled into one. But hey, at least I got double mold. This is just a genocide run. 22 hours in. I don't get the thrill of being on world record pace or anything like that. I had to play this category. And I mean, I don't hate this category, but it's not as fun as the Lich Cats, I don't think. Get this fucking dog shit out of my inventory, bro. Ho -wa -ho -wa. So if you're Joomfy and Ash is Ash Oomfy, and does that make me Shoomfy? 
The Moomfy. The not magic oomfy. It's the Moomfy. The Moomfy. The Moomfy. What is that? The fucking sequel to the Mummy. What am I? Adorable. I mean, uh, you'd be uh, Pi Poomfy. Shut up. No, make me. Koomfy. No, you wouldn't be Koomfy, you'd be Coochie. Wait. Coochie! Stop! I got called that enough in high school. Wait, your actual name is Coocher? I thought that was just your username. Is that actually your name? Huh. That's a dope name if it is. It's cute. Kind of like you. Ah. Ooh. Ooh, I felt that one. Oh. Oh. Yes, sir. Woo! Oh, yeah. That was a lot of tension. Just gone. Evaporated. My banderuck may call me the cooch. The cooch man. I see. Look, guys. I did Mad Dummy Skip. Me. Dead. Oh, something interesting is about to happen. We're about to fight on dying. Oh god, something interesting. It's a miracle. Yeah, that's right, I grind here. I'm stupid. I'm not used to actually having got good RNG. That's crazy. The fucking novel concept. You're gonna go to bed, Enzo? I'm gonna go dunk my fucking head in ice water during the break, bro. Twenty two, twenty two, twenty two. Nice. Third break? No, I'm only allowed one. We're almost done anyway. 
I only got about three and a half hours left. Don't bonk and don't bonk. What? And zoom fee. Undertale sixty four. Yahoo! <laughs> I mean, Deltarune has bonks. This game, not so much. Holy fuck, something interesting. Oh, something interesting! Huh, it's nothing. Hey, Undyne, remember all those times I killed you? You want to see me do it again? Ugh. You're going to have to try a little harder than that. Got it. I'll try hard, all right. Prepare to fucking die. No, Geno doesn't have a no-save version. Only neutral endings do. This is our first undying, actually. Our first out of two total. We fight her one more time after this. We fight Sans twice as well. Skill fish you. Easy. Later, fishy.
Okay. Every once in a while, you just get time save. <gasps> chat, chat, guys, it's time for RNG skip. The first RNG skip of the run. It's time for RNG skip, chat. Let's go. All right, that one was for the bit. <laughs> that one was for the bit. <laughs> I did that one on purpose. That one was on the bit. Easy clap. Who needs a healing item? Who needs one of those anyway? If only you had GPC. Stop! Cease! No talkie. <laughs> I'm taking away the talking stick privileges. Vulcan go, Wah! Wah! Huh? Mm -hmm. Vulcan makes cute sounds. That, the sound that Vulcan makes is like the uh, the sound my heart makes whenever I see my Twitch chat. Mm -hmm. Love you guys. Sound like you're about to nya nya. <laughs> The plane turning tiny is totally intended feature. Please stop emailing Toby at the time. At the time, he... <laughs> please stop emailing me. I was about to ready for Ocean Bagel to accidentally drop that he was Toby the whole time and be like, "Please stop emailing me about the plane." Shit. <laughs> Forgot I still have the cat ears on. It could be any one of us. It could be me. It could be you. It could even be... John Cena! Can I have a compliment? You're cute. I have a functioning backspace key! <laughs> oh, man. Decimated. Can I have an insult? You're never gonna be a real boy. Is it true? I always love when confused transphobes, like, <laughs> end up accidentally validating a trans person. You'll never be a real boy. Yeah, yeah that's correct. <laughs> I love whenever I see that. I'm like, damn. This coming from the uh, we can always tell crowd. How did I save 12 seconds? What are you talking about? All right. It's time to go. It's time for the panty raid. As Spongebob would call it. That episode got banned! That episode got fucking banned, dude. That's so sad. Uh, last year, apparently. Can I have validation, please? You're valid and lovely and wonderful. I always love having you around. You're awesome. That's not the fucking burnt pan. That's not the burnt pan at all. I almost killed him too. That's incredible. Eh. Wait, really? Yeah. The uh, what? What is that? Uh. 
What's the midlife crustacean? I think is the name of the episode. Yeah, that got banned. No more panty raid. No more night of debauchery. Can you have a virtual hug? Of course. Oh, I'm glad, Scout. Listen, debauchery is an amazing word, but every time I hear it, I think of Five Nights at Fuckboys now. Is that a good thing? I think that's a good thing. You shit fuckers, I was just trying to have a night of debauchery. <laughs> Why did you invite me to your night of debauchery? Why? <laughs> What are y'all's favorite words? Nimina Ultra Microscopic Silico Volcanoconiosis. Wait, I'm not at 10 kills. What? I marked that one twice. That's nine. Anti disestablishmentarianism. I work the I like the word tritone. Yeah, that's a good word. Tritone. BRB, I'm blacklisting you from every church in 1930s England. Bro, I love Mississippi M I S S I S S P I P P I. I love M I S S I S S P P I. I can't fucking do that anymore. I used to be able to do that flawlessly. Hold on. M I S S I S S I P P I. There we go. M I S S I S S P P I. M I S S I S S I P P I. Got it. There. Mississippi. That's three plus two. Yeah, okay, that's correct. Alright, I'm making a call out post on Twitter. Night Night is a bitch ass motherfucker. She pissed on my fucking time. How about, uh, what other good words are there? Pariah is a good one. My dad used that on me one time and I had to go look it up what it meant. He's like, Peter, you gotta stop being a pariah. I'm like, what the fuck? Is that some sort of fruit? I mean, I am a little fruity, but like, <laughs> it's not a fruit. <laughs> so yeah, they <laughs> no, that's a piranha. <laughs> that's a piranha. Toby Fox's favorite fish. He can't spell it correctly. <laughs> But then again, to his defense, who spells piranha correctly? Bamboozle, that's a good one. Now this word isn't actually real, but I love Schmeckeldorft. Schmeckeldorft is great, I love Schmeckeldorft. I go until I get no I can go now all right 22 all right I guess I shouldn't split yeah oh go back I shouldn't split yet wait hold on what is this why do I have a core split and then a metaton split what kind of dumbass made these split oh wait You know what my, let's see, what other words do I really like? Ubiquitously is a good word. 
ubiquitously. Ubiquitous. How about, uh... Exceptionally. Big fan of balls? Yeah, I know. Internaliza- Internationalization. I love balls, yo, based. Man, Bob is. Remember back in the day in TGH's chat? They never did mod you, did they? For shame. I'm going to single handedly restart the mod Bob campaign. Mod Bob, bring it back! <laughs> if I if I end up raiding Jay again, I should jokingly make that my raid message. See if it see if he remembers. <laughs> see if he remembers it. God, that was such a long time ago. It was a product of its time. Does it embarrass you? Because if it does, then. I won't say anything about it. Because trust me, I, uh... I didn't like myself in 2017 very much, so... Bro, imagine glitchless. Wait, what's... What dialogue am I about to get from Sans? I'm gonna get the fucking... Like, the super judgment text where he's like... Bitch, what? <laughs> It's like, dog, what in the world are you you doing? No, 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 Fifem's correct. Fifem's correct. Inflammable uh, means it's flammable. Yes, that is, that is right. That is actually correct. It's one of the weirdest things in English. If something's inflammable, that means it is actually you keep it away from fire. Meaning is use. Piper, if you see a package with inflammable on it, I assure you it is not telling you to light it on fire. You will probably kill somebody. <laughs> Gas is inflammable, for instance. Yeah, that is one of the weirdest things. Unflammable would be the uh, term. Uh, typically, things that are resistant to being lit on fire are, uh, you know, not called unflammable because it's so similar to inflammable. Instead, you would say fire retardant uh, would be the correct terminology. Not that kind of, not that very si close sounding word to a different word. <laughs> Comes from the same root word, but it is not the slur. Slash vulgar word. I'm, I'm, I'm not exactly sure if it's considered a slur. It's offensive either way. But no, it, it comes from the same root word as that, but no, fi like a, a, something that, something retardant is not the other word. It's very similar word, though. Hi, hey, Xander. Oh, Asgore's about to make me act up. Yeah. Retardando in music, yep. It's all from the same root word, uh, to slow down. It's just that 
one of them was decided to be applied to the human brain, even though that's not really accurate. It's, it's not even... It's weird, the word isn't even like... It doesn't even... It's not even relevant to the people it's used against. It's a total misunderstanding of what those conditions even do to the brain. Nonplussed. Yeah, nonplussed is fucking crazy. I saw that word written once and I was like, what is this? Oh wow, 256 on a whiff. People are ignorant. Ignorant is a good word. Ign I like ignoramus. Ignoramus. Oh yeah, 509. Mmm. It's so much damage. Yeah, nonplussed is a fucking... I saw that word written once. I was like, what does this even mean? Hey Ocean, if you're still here, I have a quick question. I'm not sure if he's here or not, but I do have a question. Nah, I think Ocean would be the only one able to answer it. No, that wasn't a task score. Alfie's ending. Finish the grind, baby. Hey, what's up, Connor? How you doing, lovely? Wait, 20? How the fuck did I have 22 written? Why did I have 22 written in my fucking splits? What dipshit wrote 22? It's 24! <laughs> Why did I write 22 in my fucking splits? What am I doing, dude? Woof. I'm not at all like Final Froggit. You know, regular Froggit will meow, and I, I relate to that. But Final Frog at Wolf, so I can't relate to that. What was I gonna do again? I, I wanted to tab out to, like, look at something. Oh, right, the fucking route document. Anything here? Gotta lock it in real life, save before Kara. Says 22 in the guide. Well, they're fools, then. It should be 24. Shay wearing cat ears talking about how he relates to a monster that meows. Yeah, and? What is the problem here? Connor, do you have any issue with any of the words I have said? Care to complain? Of course not. Yeah, that's what I thought. Go see a curb ticker.
I think Shay's a cat boy. I am for the next however long the stream lasts. Listen, I told chat that if they got to 550 sub points, I'd become the cat boy, e-boy of their dreams. And here I am. They're cute. But nobody came. It's time, boys. It's time for Sans Undertale. Woo! They are tied to step count, and they're always the same, Zag. So, like, when you enter a room, it will always be on step, like, 40-whatever, for instance. They always pop up at the same time. Gotcha, gotcha. <sighs> right. I didn't split. Good luck on Sans. Thank you. Stand back, everybody. I'm going to no-hit this bitch. Let's see. Can a 23... Can a, can a battle-torn Shea Undertale no-hit Sans? Probably not, but... I don't know. Listen, I, I mean, I totally can, but I am also like 20 hours into a, like 20 plus hours into a run here, so probably not going to happen. Give me these fucking things. Locket knife. Cool. Got both of those. I'm supposed to go left first, but my brain was like, get the items, fool. So because of the way Soulless Ending Branch works, I'm pretty certain that, uh... So this is 15 text boxes per sec. Here's a fun little fact for you. Normally, this text is mashable at 30 text boxes per second, but if the Monster Tail New Game Plus flag is in your save data that tells the game that the Monster Tail text can be mashed, this is capped at 15, like most other text boxes. But in Solus, it won't be because that flag is going to get deleted. So we get to notice the difference. I mean, you'll notice the difference from how fast the text goes. It, I, I mashed marginally faster. When text is uncapped in the, like when when it goes up to thirty in this game, I I my mashing is pristine. Well, no, it doesn't lose time. It still gets no flowery, so it's better. It's just a funny little weird thing. Here we go. Can you mash 30? No, nobody can. Hmm. Sans! Oh my god! No way.
Oh, right, fucking, uh, this is going on YouTube, isn't it? Or it might be. Well, I gotta make sure I talk over this, otherwise Materia Collective will have my fucking ass on a wall. On a plaque of other fireplace, of other content creators they keep taking money from. I gotta make sure they don't steal me money. Ahoy, Spongeboy me bob. I tried to upload a video to YouTube, but I got copyrighted claimed by Materia Collective. Arr, arr, arr. Arr, Materia Collective is a Seattle-based record company who specializes in music publishing and stealing your money. Arr, 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 arr. SpongeBob, me, Bob. I've just taken damage. Now me chat's gonna make fun of me. It didn't matter. The no-hit judges wouldn't have verified as a no-hit anyway. I'm attacking too quickly. I'm pretty sure Dunn's asleep. <laughs> I feel. <laughs> Guys, I uh, I avoided, I, I held down all four arrow keys, uh, and, uh, you know, Sansfucker69 on Discord, one of the moderators, uh, decided that was cringe and not allowed, so, uh, my no-hit is no longer a no-hit, sorry. My objective no-hit where I took no damage is no longer a no-hit. How many inputs am I up to, by the way? I gotta be over 500,000 by now, right? Five, seven thousand fucking inputs, Christ. That's so many, dude. Shit, that was a good stretch. Uh, make sure to stretch, chat. Uh. How many more runs? It's almost over. Uh, we're gonna get two endings here, quickly. And then, the 10 minute wait. And then all we have left is hard mode and solos. Hard mode is like 20 minutes, so really all we have left is the Solus branch. Uh, which is a genocide and then one more pacifist to cap it out. And then you'll finally quit. I know your type. You're uh, very determined, aren't you?
Xander, your cat is adorable. I saw the picture you sent me. Adorable boy and adorable cat. <sighs> Can we save? I, uh, yeah, I'll do that while Sans is falling asleep. Uh, save files. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to make a new file here. We're going to copy these. Now, I'm not allowed to actually look at them, but I am allowed to copy them. We did, we talked about this last time. All right, there we go. All right, cool. We can look at it later. Let me just make sure this is taken out and put like here. Ah, fucker. <laughs> Can we look during the geno void? That should be fine, but I don't want to risk anything. Three hours. I showered already today, so. Whew. Damn. Almost got the sub 23 geno. Yo, what's up, Dr. Fizz? All right, we save. And we select do not. Oh, actually, we should do it here, because it'll have the updated position, and it'll be at level 22. Yo, Yoshi Zonic with a gift sub to Monado. Thank you so much. What's the highest you've ever achieved? Well, 15 is the cap that the game reads, so... Uh, okay, let me actually delete these, make sure I'm in the fucking new folder. Yeah, okay. There we go. Okay. I backed him up now. Greetings. I am why. Well, we did it. <laughs> I love this fucking music mod. Oh god, it's so good. Okay, I gotta have the preload ready, so. No preload for the next one, though, because we gotta let the game close on its own. <laughs> Great overlapping music here. Ha! Huh? Oh, they're like just off key from each other. Oh, well, that's painful. <laughs> this is painful. All right, come on, Kara, let's go. All right. Now 
Now, now, there's no need to fight. Why not settle this over a nice cup of tea? Fuck you, bitch! Woo! Smoked! Nine more to go, chat. The pain is almost over. Greet it. Wait a minute. Didn't I just see you like two fucking seconds ago? Why? Why are you back? When's the summoning salt Undertale video? No, I like. He, I know he only does old games. In ten years, when summoning salt makes a video on Undertale, you bet your ass your boy will be in it. Yes, oh, we're about to get to the ten-minute wait. It's literally right after this. We have to sell our soul. Did I join at the end? Nope. We still got more. We got the whole entire soulless branch and hard mode. Why? And one more neutral ending too. We got betrayed on Dinewood Challenge. And additionally, I need to burn a little bit of time to get the key for Sansa's workshop because I did not do that properly. Because the guide is doo doo fart. Right. You are a great partner. We'll be together forever, won't we? <sighs> Unless we open the game. Woo, okay. We made it this far, boys. We don't got much left to go. Only about two and a half hours. A little bit more than that. About three hours. We have the hard mode stuff, and then one genocide run, one pacifist run, and we are done. Uh, oh, I gotta stretch. <sighs> Alright, chat. Stretch. It's a stretch break. Make sure to stretch. Oh, goodness. Nice tummy, thank you. Ah. I think I showered during this last time, but I already showered today, so. Oh. Hmm. Piano? Do you guys really want me to play piano during this? It'd be, be kind of funny, I guess. I can't kill the game audio, so you're going to have this wailing over it the whole time. All right, I got about nine minutes, so sure, why not? You're gonna have the wailing audio, I can't get rid of that. I have to have game audio playing, so. I will mute my mic this time, though.
Figured the 10 minute break is a good time to prime.
Holy shit, what timing. <laughs> Whew! Oh, I'm absolutely above consequences. Huh, there we go. Split? No, I split, uh... Uh, I, I think I just split just to, like, let my chat know that that's there. Yep, I will give you my soul. And it is done. Alright, cool. Alright, let's go. Alright, let's see. What's the route here? Kill first, frog it. Oh, I have this in splits. Dude, that was perfect timing on the end there. I thought I had like another minute and I looked over, I see the text starting to scroll, I'm like, oh god! I hope you guys enjoy the piano. Forgive me for it not being the most up to par, I was, you know... Been playing Undertale for a few hours. Oh, right, I forgot there's extra dialogue. It's great, thank you guys. Murder, 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 kill, 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 murder. Oh yeah, baby. Jammers! Damn it. Jammers! Any jammers? Hi, Quinn. Welcome back. Hope you're doing wonderful, lovely kitty. Patootie. What about a dum? Bum 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 bum. Damn, I'm not seeing any doubles yet. You can get doubles here in hard mode. Jammers! Why isn't this in the no save? Because it doesn't have saving version. It doesn't have the ending variations. 
18, so we'll just get one in every room for me here. Dude, strong monsters is so good. Damn it, I forgot to answer Butterscotch. Fuck. Triple mold? Fucking hell, I just realized what this was. This is literally triple mold. <laughs> God, Moldessa existed. Holy shit. So good. Yeah, there's Moldessa, and then there's also Parsnik. And, uh, Me Gospel are two enemies that you, like, forget exist entirely. Oh, I can't insta-kill you. I thought I could. Fuck. Muscle memory. Oh, but I can kill Frog in one now. Nice. All right, we're hoping for just a single frog here. How tired are you? Pretty tired. Hey, what's up, Funky Queer? How you doing, Abby? Hope you're doing well. I think killing 19 is fine, actually. 19 is safe, I'm pretty certain, because 20 is the number, so. I think. Yeah, that should be good. Yeah, okay, it, it wouldn't be good if Absolute was here. Hell on, Absolute. Even Absolute has hard mode versions of his attacks. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought. I was- that's what I thought for a second issue. I was curious. I was like, wait, if I get to 19, does killing Toriel affect the ending? But no, it doesn't. That was the thing I was curious about.
First frog, it does not count. Marks is a special thing that I know about that I was concerned about because it's possible to make Toriel your 20th kill and it'll actually activate genocide. It's really bizarre. Oh, right. I'm not playing. Toriel can count as the... Oh, get Toy Knife. Right, right, right. You're smart. I can do that once I talk to Toriel. That's fine. Okay, we save here. Er... Yeah, let me go get the toy knife first, <laughs> and then we'll save. Yay! Yeah, it's a weird exception. Normally, normally the bosses don't work like that, but Toriel specifically can be the 20th in uh, Genocide. Yeah, you have to na you have to neutral killer though. So hey, what's up, Evans? Fight. All right. Hope well. I guess it doesn't matter what we get here. I could get a single and be fine because I killed an extra. Yo, Parsnik and me gospel! Yo! Alright, well, we've succeeded at fucking see every enemy percent. <laughs> Fuck it, we'll kill him too. We're inclusive. Yeah. Wait, I did... I'm doing this out of order. Okay, fuck it. We're doing hard mode genocide first, I guess. I had my brain thinking I needed to finish. It doesn't matter what order you do them in. So. <laughs> this is. Did you get the pie? Uh, when is the time on this? It, it. When's the time on this ending? I already got it, right? Yeah, I already got it, right? Yeah, I think I did. Cool. Okay, so we're we're switching, we're switching these. Okay, so this one will be the normal kill. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna have to run back hard mode. <laughs> I'm gonna have to run through it again to grab snail pie because I forgot to pick it up. Whoops. I'm pretty sure the pie won't spawn if I sleep in the bed right now. I'm pretty sure you can't get the pie anymore once you tell Toriel to go downstairs. I think that's how that works. Yeah, man, I'll go look real quick. Unless it's different for... Hard mode. I don't think it is, though. Okay. There we go. Uh, 
skip these. Yeah, okay. Now we get Betray Kill. We're back on track now. So that was hard mode about Toriel. We already did Betray Kill. Or now we need to do Betray Kill. Let me just check real quick. I don't think I'll get the buy though. Yeah, I didn't think so. Okay. We'll just have to run through hard mode. That doesn't take very long, thankfully. It, it's like four minutes. I just I totally forgot to get it. Also, there is no pacifist uh, hard mode ending. There's hard mode genocide, hard mode kill, hard mode betray kill, hard mode spare. Uh, yeah, betray kill. I've been in GDQ before. We can just get to the house as quick as possible. That literally does not take, like, any time at all in hard mode. Jesus, how many turns is this? I know I got, like, no hands, but, like, good lord, girl. Come on. Run hard mode again. Let's run through it again. <laughs> Gotta get the fucking pie. God, that's irritating. I need. Why didn't I put that in my splits? All right, gonna skill it. Thank you for the compliment, also. Yeah, I forgot the snail pie was an item. Like my brain doesn't think like, oh, I need to get the snail pie. Like, even though it's a thing in all items. <laughs> all right, so we just need to blast through this as fast as possible. This shouldn't take very long. This will take six minutes, two of which are in tutorial, and that's part of the run already, so. Oh, right. You're supposed to kill first frog it. <laughs> Forgot. I haven't run hard mode in a bit. Surprised I haven't seen the, the time tracker start ticking down yet. There it is. Oh, that's like four minutes, man. Ugh, that sucks. I already fucking lost three minutes to the sans key thing. Ah, that's just a, it's like almost 10 minutes. Just because of a mental mistake. To be fair, the sand's key thing isn't my fault, but this is definitely my squarely my fault. Alright. No encounters, please.
Ah, oh, fuck. Ah, oh, we're fine. <laughs> Everything's okay. It's frog. It. This is the one encounter you can get that's faster. Neat. You're gonna have fruit kick. Okay. No encounters. Please. Jeez. So the thing about hard mode that makes it really fucking annoying is that you can't flee from monsters on the first turn. Um, even with the bandage. So suddenly encounters become significantly more annoying. So you'll see me menu buffering a lot because I don't want to get any. Don't forget the fucking pie this time, idiot. Cool. There we go. Alright, now I gotta get the ending. Your own speaker, don't say anything weird. Wait, nobody's hone. Wuffledy likes cock. Big, throbbing cock. Three hands? This boss fucking sucks. Got the pie, yep. Wait, you're right, I have the pie! Now I'm using my noggin! <laughs> oh, I'm so behind. Okay. Wait, that's where the ending is? Okay. Nice. Alright, remember how we ran genocide? What if we did that again? to do genocide again. Woo! Yes, sir! Alright, we don't do it. We get spider donut and spider cider. 
And then nothing special until Gerson's shot. Nothing special for the rest of the run, except that I gotta get just a few remaining items. So we raid all of the shops in Soulless Genocide. We unlock Metaton's door. Um, the only special thing that I have left to do is get the Hush Puppy next ending, and then get the uh, also get Sansa's key. And then we are fucking good to go, baby. We are at the tail end, boys. It's almost over. <laughs> Only five more endings. Damn, I'm gonna lose like fucking 10 minutes to mistakes. That sucks. We could have been, I could have beaten it by over an hour, but as long as I get a 26, I'm honestly okay. Unless there was some like fucking catastrophe in the soulless ending last time that I wasn't aware of that lets me save five minutes back. Thanks for cheering me up. Yeah, I got you. Can I post an out of context clip in chat? Yeah, sure, go for it. Self-deprecation is bad humor. Oh boy. Lord help me, Lord help me find the strength to get through this. It's almost over, I can taste victory. Lord help me find the strength. Taste these nuts. Shut the fuck up. You think I want to? You fucking play Smash Bros, bro. Yoshi man? Yeah, you've probably never seen a bar of soap in your fucking life. <laughs> I'm back from taking a shower. Hello. God, I wish that were me right now. I already took a shower today, though, and I look fucking hot. had never washed their body because they assume the shampoo running will clean enough. You know how surprisingly common that is for people to think that? That shampoo running down your body is enough to clean you? I, oh. oh. The reason I'm not yanked, you ranked, yanked! Oh, I ranked Yoshi players because I have good hygiene. Yeah, Connor, that's true as well. 
I don't know how people live like that, honestly. I'm not sure if this is TMI, but I don't, fellas out there, I don't know how in the world you get around not washing your fucking ass. I, I don't get it. You're telling me you, you don't get uncomfortable thinking of all the fucking shit in there? Bro. I don't know how people live like that. Wash your fucking asshole, like seriously. You not get swamp ass? For real. <laughs> my fellow men out there, my kings, my boys, my men out there, my guys. Please use soap. I promise. I didn't attack the flims in first. Yeah, bro, if I get another fucking single mold, I'm gonna bark, bro. Seriously, though, clean yourself and use deodorant. For real. Fellas, guys, I want you all to look as good as possible for when you try to go out there and hook up with some girl or guy or other. If you try to hook up with someone, I don't want y'all giving me a bad name. Go fucking wash up, clean yourself, smell good. Your girlfriend will appreciate it one day. Use conditioner? Yes. It's a Vastra. Give... Wait, I'm at 18, aren't I? No, 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 no! Okay. Everything's fine. <laughs> Yeah, don't use three in one. Use separate conditioner and shampoo, too. People ask, Shay, how does your hair look so fucking hot and sexy and lovely and beautiful? Uh, that's because I, I use good product. Wait. Don't forget. Give me that. I fucking torqued that shit down. Bath and body works. Yeah, we get my mom shit from there. I think I got some shampoo there one time too. They got good stuff. And it's not unmanly to go into a store to buy good smelling shit, okay? That ain't unmanly. If anybody tells you that, they are very insecure about themselves. How come we didn't use that to skip Muffet for the Alfie's ending? Uh, because we save after. <laughs> Me and the boys out here, uh, popping the fucking Axe body spray. A formula scientifically designed to make vaginas in the area as physically dry as possible upon sniffing. Just fucking... Just Sahara fucking desert in your girlfriend. <laughs> use actual products and don't use shit that smells like a fucking gymnasium locker room, please. Please, I beg of you. What am I listening to? I'm talking about how men's products, which which are just the cheap products, but they're marketed towards men because they're sexist. Um, those are uh, not as good.
Dr. Squatch sounds good. Yeah, Old Spice is good, too. I use Old Spice myself. It's because the system hates us. They hate men, so they're holding us back from smelling good. <laughs> That's what it is. men get pockets true <laughs> true <laughs> i will never ever sacrifice my fucking pocket utility for for fashion nope never i will never compromise on that i i absolutely fucking need my pockets Men's stick deodorant. Again, it depends on what scent it is, really. There's plenty of good men's deodorant out there. Like, again, Old Spice is good. I use Old Spice. True Troy. <laughs> Steel Lust. Dragon Guard. <laughs> Dragon Guard. That's, that actually sounds like it could be a fucking men's deodorant. Dragon Guard. Where the fuck am I going? <laughs> but yeah, anyway, make yourself smell good. Clean yourselves. That applies to all of y'all. Trust me, it'll help you. And it'll make you feel better about yourself, too. And brush your teeth. Trust me, you don't want to be on a date with, like, your first girlfriend or first partner or first, like, you know, first person you're into. First date and get to the part where you kiss and you your breath smells like fucking, like, you haven't brushed your teeth in a week. You don't want that to happen to you. It was a whole entire regular show episode about that. He finally, Mordecai finally, I guess, is to kiss Margaret and, and fucking his breath smells like shit. And it ruins the moment. Freezer, I'm, uh, I'm preaching to the choir on it, or whatever. Uh, <laughs> I'm not great about it myself. That's why I'm telling y'all to be better than me about it. <laughs> How are y'all getting dates? I asked a girl out. You walk up to a person and ask them if you want to go on a date. It's really that easy. Walk up to a person and make sure they don't have a partner. I'm simplifying things here. How many girls have you asked out? 
Ah. Uh, more than one. <laughs> Been asked asked out five times. Wait, really five? I know you got asked out by that one dude. Yeah, well, freezer. Listen, it. You are pr a pretty good looking person. It's probably a result of that. It is kind of annoying, though. I can understand that being kind of irritating because you're just trying to work, right? It's a crow. Is it a joke? Yeah, jokes are supposed to be funny. That was not fucking funny at all. Not even a little bit. Asteroid, listen, I I get it's annoying, but, you know, if it were me, I'd try to look on the positive side, right? Like, damn, I look good enough that people uh, desire me, right? He ripped it in a tick jar and pulled out the 20. What the fuck? That's so messed up. <laughs> what the hell? What a dick. <laughs> Bro, you tip, you tip. Like. You don't take the no take backsies on tips. Twenty four hours. Goodness, I have reached the bottom of the fucking barrel of conversation topics. I, oh, I, I gotta be real with you guys. Thank you for carrying this because I have, I got fucking nothing, man. <laughs> this sucks. <laughs> this just stinks. <laughs> this is the worst part of the run by a long shot. It, it's just Fucking genocide again. We just did genocide. <laughs> I don't want to do it again, dude. Yo, funky queer with the gifts up. Thank you so much. I enjoy talking with the Shea Undertale. Yeah, hey, better. It's almost over. The bad parts are almost over. The, the category gets good when we get to Undying at least. At least it becomes more interesting. Yo, Yoshi Sonic, where they give some to Isabel. I don't know who that is, but thank you. Yo, Syndex with the 24 as well. How do you feel? It's been 24 hours? Yeah. Yeah, I understand that, Astra. Yeah, I'll admit, I, uh, that's not much, like, I don't have that concern myself, because, like, I'm a six foot four tall guy. Like, you'd be fucking out of your mind to jump me. <laughs> people don't usually go after people who are taller than them. That's just like, 
kind of a normal how it works. But yeah, that shit sucks. I'm sorry. I'm sorry it's like that. Height isn't everything in a fight. No, it has absolutely nothing to do with the fight. It has everything to do with a psychology thing where if you're looking up to somebody, you feel intimidated. It has nothing to do with the fight itself. It's entirely about the, the lead up to it. Yo, Exit, thank you for the gift sub to Sword Guy. I appreciate it. I'm always looking down on Shay. <laughs> you wish. Yo, Issue, thank you for the 24 gift subs. That was fucking- I was supposed to kill that asshole. God damn it, now I have to grind at 15. Fuck me. I'm hyped to experience misogyny. Oh, let's cope. Maddie, I'm really happy for you, though. Congratulations on getting uh, HRT, finally. That's sick. Yo, issue also with a gift sub to Augurd as well. Thank you so much. Chat, if you didn't get a gift sub and you're still unsubbed, you are legally required to type dodged in the chat. That was faster than usual. Okay, cool. That was actually surprisingly fast. Okay, uh, da -ba -da -ba -da -da, don't buy anything here. We get Gerson's shop and Caddy and Braddy's in this ending, and we do the fucking thing. Yo, Charm, thank you for the 100 bits as well. Please do not intimidate me. I mean, I can't help it. Yo, Marsupial Guts 2 with the Prime. I appreciate it. No bad, don't. Well, I mean, it's not something I can, I can control. I'll, I'll intimidate the fuck out of you, and then I'll give you a good hug, big ol' hug. Seagrass skip! Yay! Yeah, yay! I put cat ears on stream for the first time. Yo! Pog, 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 pog. That's pog. Bye bye, Undyne. Hello, Mississippi. Tell me that jokers are the cutest thing I got some recently. Eh. I'm actually, per this is a personal opinion of mine. You're free to do what you want, or I know a lot of people find them cute. I've never really think, I I've never thought they looked very good. That's just my own opinion, though. I know plenty of people like it. You do you. You are still valid either way. 
Yo, what's up, Iris? And I'm sure you rock it. Quinn, I also hope you have a lovely and amazing day. train success here we go gastrocopium where am I going <laughs> not not yet that's next ending <laughs> Not that way, dumbass. <laughs> oh man, I'm in pain. <laughs> Yo, T Wolf, that's sick. Quinn's awesome. She's always like super positive and shit in my chat. I like it. She'd always pop in and be like really positive and shit. And you know, we all love a person like that. So thanks, Quinn. Sure hope I didn't need that stick. I don't think I did. See ya, honey beep up. Come on. Get me through it. Get me through waterfall, man. Just Oh my god, just get me to the sands fight, dude. <laughs> Please, Lord, just get me to the sands fight. <laughs> Make it go faster. <laughs> this is miserable. Toby fucking Fox had to make there be soulless genocide dialogue because of course he did. <sighs> Today we see what happens when a game has too much content. <laughs> Me and the boys trying to complete Elden Ring. That's it. Get me mallet. One more.
Undertale's trending on Twitter? Yeah. Tell him to come watch my stream. Oh, fucking hell. Okay. Is that a review for a Krispy Kreme on fucking Yelp? Get them out of here. All right. Gersten, I've come to take everything you own. Give it to me. Now. I don't need the quality classes, though. I already got those. And put that shit in the box. I never want to see it ever again for as long as I live. <laughs> Wait. I should be... That's not... Seven's not right. I should be eight. I did Aaron Washua... The molds, yeah, okay, yeah, that should be eight. I didn't mark Shiren. Did some runs, they were bleh. Yeah, it do be like that sometimes. I'm almost done, Fixie. It's almost over. Also, I got 25 Tazgors. <laughs> the uh, speedrunner to Catboy E Boy pipeline. Truly. Man, I'm at 16 walking through the last room. Man, it sure would be a shame. It sure would be a shame, chat. deserve this <sighs> it's just I, I can't get good genocide RNG it's impossible okay at least I got the then wait this happened last time I did genocide <laughs> oh no oh, not again oh the misery We're done. We're past waterfall. We are on to the good part. We have arrived. We have arrived at the good part. Fixie is cool, Quinn. I agree. If I'm ever if I ever do a cosplay, I'll fucking cosplay as Chris. Let's go. Bring it. I can do it with my hair. Alright, take care of Yoshi Sonic. I'm looking forward to seeing you too, man.
undying, the undying. Let's go. Woo! Wait, you have red hair? Sheesh. Probably looking good as hell. Red hair is honestly fucking hot. Like, I'll be completely honest. Freezer, I have told you this before. I like red hair. Looks fucking good. I'm not even looking at the game. <sighs> I only took that hit because I was reading chat while dodging. <laughs> Ever done blindfolded undying? No, I don't think so. I don't exactly like super have memorized the order of the attacks. What is this one? This one? Yeah. Alright, watch this shit. Wow, I actually managed to dodge that while I had my hands over my eyes. <laughs> I'm impressed. Good night, Flutter. Bestie, you look great with red hair. I'd keep it like that. How? Actually fucking how? <laughs> okay, sure. Sure. Uh, yeah, SGS is one thing, but like, goodness me. Yoink! Alright. Okay, we raid Braddy and Caddy's shop, then save, then go on lock Metaton's room, and then reload. To do a massive save warp that is literally going to save me three fucking minutes over my PB because I didn't do it in my PB. <laughs> Now you're thinking. I remember last time, like, thinking to myself, like, wait, why didn't I do this?
on the fucking van, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> I thought it was on the bed, so I looked in red chat, and I'm like, why, why haven't I moved? And I look back, oh, hey, I was in the fucking corner. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you're talking to the greatest Undertale speedrunner of all time right here. That's my fucking goat right there, baby. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> the fucking greatest, the, the goat himself just walked into a wall. <laughs> no, I'm good, Quinn. This is just the boring part of the run. I'm gonna muster so much will to not just fucking quit right now. It's almost over, though. Almost done with this. Ending branch, or this ending. We don't got too much left in this one, and then... We get to fight Sands, which is fun, and then I actually get to play the game again. Are you homophobic or not? What? No, of course not. Gay people are awesome. My chat is like half LGBT, so if I said otherwise, they'd fucking maim me at the stake. Oh, nice fucking split, dumbass. Okay, raid the shop. Get the key. Hey, give me all your shit. Hey, look, a cowboy hat. Eh, fuck it, might as well. Uh, alright, go save here. All right, let's go. Let's go put this key to the key to use, shall we? Just a pay. Hello. No! <laughs> Fuck! Fucking boat into Snowden, dude. There it is. It only took 24 hours, but I did it. <laughs> I think I made that exact same mistake last time. I think I did the exact same thing. Oh, all right. Good lord. Go unlock the fucking house. Right. Okay. You have to use it. I fucking forgot about it. All right. Unlocked. House unlocked. I did it. Cool. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> How do you idea like the idea of glitchless true hundo? We're gonna raise the fucking incentive if you want me to do that shit. $10,000 and I'll do it. <laughs> I will literally wear a fucking maid dress on stream before I run glitchless true hundo. That just sounds so bad. That's like 60 hours of Undertale, dude. I had to like fucking advocate for a divide and how many fucking <laughs> how many breaks there are because I can't do that with just one. I would fucking pass out. Glitchless Hundo. Glitchless Hundo would absolutely need the 12 hours gives you 12 hour breaks rule. Like, it absolutely needs that. 
one brick alone does not suffice for that fucking category. I mean, it would be like 60 hours long, maybe longer. Because the routing totally changes. All of like those endings that we abuse the fact that we can use the punch card to get like multiple endings in the same branch. Cannot fucking do that in Glitchless. Every single ending would have to be separated for the most part. Granted, for y'all, that would be like a week of content, but like, shh. I had to divide that over up an entire week, dude. <laughs> Bestie, what the fuck? Also check art in the Discord. Hold on, I can do it before you leave. I could just tank this, hold on. Uh we'll do it while I grind. Aww Wait! Oh, this is so good! Oh, dude, you're gonna make me fucking tear up. I love this. Connor. That's so good. Thank you. I love it. Really. I love your art. It's great. You have a great style. Appreciate you, big boy. Nice choice of words. Appreciate you too, man. Thank you. 15? Yeah, okay, I did miscount. I, I had a feeling I, like, forgot to count certain enemies. <laughs> that make me fucking cry like a baby on stream, Jesus. Glad you like it. Yeah. Less than two hours to go, chat. Less than two hours to go. We already did so sorry, Zinc. I killed that bitch. If I bought you a maid dress, would you wear it? It's gonna cost some funds from the chat. They're gonna need to shell out good fucking money. I'm not- I- uh, I'll listen, if there's a bill I need to pay, I'll let you know. Also, Freezer, what do you mean by a- you don't have money. Chat, I'm not doing it. Not yet.
I don't want to. And uh, to be completely straight with y'all, I don't know how the fuck I'd explain that one to my parents. <laughs> like, oh yeah, it's for stream, and they'd be like. Bitch. I, I get the last laugh. Right, I have the cowboy hat. I was like, how the fuck did I just do so much damage? I was right, right, I forgot I equipped that. Cowboy hat ups your attack. Yep, that's correct. It's over. No more genocide. Monster genocide! This my Undertale! <laughs> I fell through a game of Mount Bond. Good <laughs> talking flower in a pot explains the plot. <laughs> Whoa! Should I be a pacifist? Or should I use my fists? Feeling evil, think I'll kill them all. I'm homicidal and I've got a taste. One wound to wipe out the monster race. Whoa, 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 I got no patience, I got no resolve. So screw the dot, uh. I will slaughter, screw the dialogue. I had to think about that one for a moment. <laughs> It's been a bit since I've heard that song. Whoa, 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 story of Undertale. <laughs> this, this is how you know I've reached my limit. Please, I, I don't want to look at genocide for the next, like, two months. <laughs> I really do not want to look at the, the fucking genocide category for, like, a month after this. <laughs> I, oh, my God. Okay. I don't need to get real knife over to got it. Oh yeah, we get the uh, we get the 30 text boxes per second for Flowey here though. So one cool thing I guess. How many endings are left? Five. Including the two we're about to get. Two genocide endings, one neutral ending, two pacifist endings, and that is it. Call them the Soulless Five. It'll be the sequel to the Jackson Five. I don't think their music will be as good, though. Don't forget, Key. You scared the shit out of me there because I thought this was on this route for a minute, and I was like, wait a minute, I can't do that. This, I'm about to kill Sans. Fuck. <laughs> you can't tell how much enjoyment I'm getting out of occasionally just seeing Flowey say fuck. Fucking literal child. <laughs> Holy shit. I'm sorry, I just lost it at fucking Flowey just saying, fuck. <laughs> That's how I feel right now, Flowey. I'm with you on that. 
<laughs> oh my god. <laughs> nice no hit, Bozo. It's okay, I have healing items. I've got the junk food. <laughs> Let's go, baby, junk food. Woo! <laughs> I've got the junk food and the glam burger. Oh my god. No, wait, I don't even have a glam burger. They don't sell the glam burger, they sell the gun and the cowboy hat. I literally only have the fucking junk food, dude. <laughs> Santa's no match for the power of fucking McDonald's. Let's go. This is just the chat, you are all, listen, this is just the true hundo experience. If you aren't molding off of the face of the planet during Soulless Genocide, then you are not playing this category right. This is just the worst part of this run. It's like, hey, you just did genocide. <laughs> you wanna see me do it again? <laughs> At least we get to fight Sans. I give this money man money every month. This is the man you simp for on twitter.com. <laughs> Not that I mind that, of course. Please keep doing that. Makes me feel good about myself. Twitch Prime? Let's fucking go. I love Twitch Prime. Yo, do you guys know about Twitch Prime? It's a, it's a service. If you have an Amazon Prime account, you can connect it to your Twitch account. I can't believe I'm about to do this. Oh, I got the bandage too. Hold on. Yo, wait. Full HP? Let's go. No hit? No hit? Guys, forget that I heal. This is a no hit. Okay. Listen, if you have Amazon Prime, uh, you can hook it up with your Twitch account. Uh, you get a free subscription every 30 days to your favorite streamer. Did you know that, guys? That's kind of wild. You get emotes and badge and notoriety of being subscribed. And all the cute frog emotes in the world. And yeah. You should do that. It'd be rad. I'd, I'd appreciate you marginally for it. You're fucking losing it. This is gonna be like the time I tried to fucking no-hit Supreme Calamitous while drunk. This is like the time I got the neutral glitchless world record while three beers in. Listen, I hear people who subscribe to Shay on Twitch become more attractive. See? Eric has the right idea. Yo, Eric with a prime for two months. Thank you so much. Enjoy your frogs, and I appreciate you choosing to support me. Yeah, see, Freezer can confirm. Freezer subscribed to me on Twitch, and then they were gifted the utmost gender from the heavens. Or something. I, I don't know. Wow, we're on last attack already? It works. It's a uh, cure-all. I think he just did up slam seven. Yeah, I think it was seven, I think. <laughs> Me when I hit a one in four seven times in a row. Me and the boys. No chat, what if?
I know it hasn't gotten any better. It didn't get any better, guys. It's still bad. What drink is that? <laughs> Flaming Hot Mountain Dew. Please stop drinking it. It's a bit at this point. I just I gotta keep checking in to make sure see if it, it's a acquired taste. You know, a beer like the first time you have beer, it sucks, right? You're like, ugh, but you keep drinking it, and you're like, mm, you know, actually. Like the first time I had a margarita, it was a lot of tequilos from a Mexican restaurant. I was like, oh, by the end of it. But nowadays I'm like, damn, it's pretty good. I used to not like beer and then I started drinking it more and I was like, oh, actually I kind of like this. Although I'm not big on like the standard beer. I like like, uh, Weed ale beers, like I like Blue Moon is my my go-to for like the standard types of beers. I don't like Budweiser very much, and my introduction to beers was Snowy Y One Hundred One uh, giving me a fucking Coors Light, a Coors fucking Light. Uh, dude, that guy has fucking garbage taste in alcohol. I don't know why he bought a thirty-two pack of Coors fucking Light. Like of all the beers he could have drink, could have had a fucking Coors Light. I'm calling out Snowy. I miss Snowy. I wish he would. I haven't talked to him in forever. I need to check out to see if he's doing okay. I used to think anime was stupid. You used to, you used to think anime was stupid, and now you are literally an anime cat girl IRL. Yeah, that's totally valid, honestly. I know a lot of people don't drink because, like, they don't... They've had bad experiences with other people drinking. That is completely valid. I'm very good about my limits. I'll just let you know that. I'm, I'm very responsible with that, kind of with that kind of stuff, but I know a lot of people aren't. Yo, I got the thing. Thought margaritas were slushies. Ooh, oh yeah, that that would have been a rude awakening. I tried my I tried some of my mom's red wine when I was little. It wasn't good. Still isn't good. Fucking red wine. Ugh. The oh, excuse me. Oh, well, we're fifty minutes ahead again. Could have been an hour ahead if I didn't make that hard mode mistake. But <laughs> God, it never gets old. <laughs> Yo, go off, Quinn. You do you. You're so pretty. Wait, really? Oh, thank you. Thanks, Restax. Oh, thanks, Casper. I'm gonna do the little hair twirl thing for you. I want to be woman, you already are. Alright. Yeah, we get the happy music while Flowey fucking dies! Good ending. It's almost over. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> 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 
It doesn't matter where. Time after time, I will appear. And with your help, we will eradicate the enemy and become strong. But, but, guys, Kara isn't a bad person. But. <laughs> Good lord, bro! Can this fucking non biny bastard just talk faster?! <laughs> oh my god, you talk for an eternity! Dude, the menu music looped! Holy shit! Why do you talk for so long? Christ. Yeah, I get it. What shampoo and conditioner do you use? Please tell me the VC whores must know. You're a VC whore now? Okay. Um, I use OGX uh, conditioner and shampoo. Coconut, coconut milk. Uh, scented. The white one. I like coconut. Like you. I hope you like the fucking menu music, by the way. For some reason, Toriel is on my main menu, even though I fucking murdered her. I think it's because of the- I think it's because of the hard mode file. <laughs> so fucking Toriel's on the menu, even though I fucking killed that bitch. <laughs> I love how the menu works in Undertale, because it just stores the flags. So, like, you do pacifist and then reset and do genocide, and at the very end of genocide, you have all the happy people standing there you've just killed. Hi, paper. Greetings! I am fuck. <laughs> fuck. Oh boy, we get to hear this fucking speech again. Yes, I have a game preloaded behind this one, and the moment I make the choice and the ending is registered, I close the game and immediately start the new one. Who made the executive decision? Me. I did. Holy shit. Please. If this fucker shows up in Deltarune and talks this goddamn slow, I am going to Toby Fox's house. <laughs> Please, Lord, speak faster. <laughs> Why do you talk so slow? <laughs> I feel obligated to suggest, <laughs> should you choose to create the world again? <laughs> maybe, maybe do something else. <laughs> Don't play genocide again. It's bad. <laughs> play pacifist. It's fun. Kara's just a speedrunner. Okay, ending 91, Betrayed Undyne with Challenge. Do not use any consumables and equip any armor. Follow the tra 
Jesus Christ, I forgot Flowey gives you that dialogue after genocide. Ah, oh, that's spooky. Anyway. Follow the traditional true pacifist route. Buy a hot cat and or a hot dog and hot cat. Drop the hot cat in the hotel. Go to the room and get the hush puppy. Save in judgment hall and also get the key. You can use the pie on Asgore because it's not considered a consumable, but it's strongly recommended that you check the Sans phone call after the ending to see if it has the challenge intro. Cool. <sighs> no more genocide chat. One more run! One more run! Who is Brad? Who, who is Brad and why am I calling him a wiener face? Brad, I've been instructed to call you a wiener face. Did you ever run Celeste? No, I've never speed ran it. I just played it. One more. One more. We are almost done, Chad. This is the last time we're going to see this purple fucking hell. Yes, I called it purple. You win. Congratulations. Purple Gang won. Person I'm in VC with? Okay. Hey Brad, you're a, uh, uh, what, what was I supposed to call it? Wiener face, was it? Small wiener, tiny dong, poopy face, idiot butthead. <laughs> it was something along those lines. Legendary fart master! <laughs> Can you say, Ma Maya, you are smelly? Okay. All right, all we have to worry about getting in this ending is the Hush Puppy is the only item in the game we haven't gotten yet. We should have everything else, so. I've gotten everything else at least once. I did get the ribbon at some point, right? Yeah, I got it in fucking 61. I've gotten the ribbon, I've gotten the, yeah, I've gotten everything. I've gotten every item at some point. It's just Hush Puppy. And I gotta get the Sans key as well, but that's not an item, but I gotta unlock the room. Why is this challenge show eight in the run? This is the Soulless Pacifist uh, ending. We have to do neutral once in order to get to Pacifist, so we just do the the e the single easiest pacifist or uh, the single easiest neutral ending in the entire run, which is betrayed undying, because that's literally what we just normally get. That <laughs> this is literally just like a normal TPE run, with the exception of grabbing the hush puppy, the hot dog, and the hot cat. We even get the pie. Can't use it though. Well, I can use it actually. It doesn't count as a consumable. But we'll be saving that for Asriel. And potato. Uh, I got pa potato chips in uh, previous already. I figured I might as well get it out of the way because there wasn't an inventory space issue. Please don't eat the nice cream. Yeah, I won't. I don't eat the. Uh, you don't eat the that in pacifist. You don't do vor strats. You put them in the box. How's the run? Going well. I made a small little mistake in uh, hard mode and uh, forgot to get the snail pie, so I had to do a 
quick second run of hard mode, but thankfully that takes like four minutes, so it wasn't terrible. Everything else has gone well. Ocean, there was a question I wanted to ask you, and I can't remember what it was. It's like something only you would know. And I couldn't remember what it was. Yep, I got it, Shinx. Ah, uh, what was it? Do polio walking? I forgot how to even do that. What do I hold out of this battle again? I have to hold a direction, right? Okay, hold right. 25 hours. It's what? Hold right, tab out, hold alt left, tab back in, right? Nah. Damn. I didn't know how to do it. I forgot how to do it. Oh, oh, issue. It's beautiful. That's oh, a nice split, dumbass. It's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Issue just sent me a clip of uh, of Kara modded to have mashable text. Okay. Literally nothing crazy in this. We literally just do a true passive a speed run. Don't eat anything though. And then when we get to Judgment Hall, we just uh we just save, we get the key and then save after getting the fucking key. And then we can uh we can boat to Snowden on during dates. Yeah, I know what I just said. All right, let's go. Have to use it. Yep, I have to get it and then go use it to get the other key, which I have to unlock the room with. I only have to unlock the room and then I can save warp, I guess. I mean, if I do it during the dates, I wouldn't have to do that. Okay. Goodbye, Snowdrake. By the way, Ocean, the mod has been working just fine. I haven't seen any other issues than the ones I already have. Uh, ooh, excuse me, brought up. There might have been a typo or something, but that didn't. It wasn't nothing major, like like a misspelling, but everything else seems fine. I didn't note anything, and everything worked right. And the endings popped up properly, even in pacifist and in genocide, and in hard mode.
I promised Willie I'd do one. I wanted to see if I got the nightmare or not. How are you so good at that? Well, I'm pretty good at handling balls, what can I say? I've gotten red ball a couple of times. I'm not very good at it. Willie's the one who knows all like the strats. <laughs> 1 a.m. I don't have the brain power. It's only 1 a.m. Not too much left now. We're almost in the last hour. Assuming I don't fucking softlock. But I'm gonna be saving it like every fucking opportunity in case I do. Hey, unparalleled dev. Hope you're doing well. Dog. One more IPS, 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 Icebreaker. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh fuck yes. Mmm. Crisp. Aw, you too, Quinn. Dude, bufferless IPS just hits different. <laughs> oh, we had to fight Flowey! Dude, I forgot about that! We had to fight Flowey again! I think that's the most excited you will ever hear me sound to fight Flowey! <laughs> We got one final left right. <laughs> right gang started us off and right gang will end it. With a little bit of punch, punch, Wonder how many people recognize that. It's just a drum beat, guys. It's just a drum fill, guys. Don't worry about it. <laughs> it's just a drum fill, guys. Don't worry about it. Chat, I one time fucking played that as an actual fill in a in a in a piece and band one time, and nobody noticed. I didn't even notice it at first, and so, like my friend pointed it out to me. I was like, oh, oh fuck me. <laughs>
Hey, guess who just went live? TGH? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Give it up for our day 25. Woo, hour 25. We're almost done. It's almost over. Wait, this is it. This is this is the, the culmination of everything we've been working towards. One run of true pacifist with like two items that I have to get. Hush Puppy will be our last item. And... Yeah, Hush Puppy's gonna be our last item. And Sans unlocking the workshop will be the last thing I have to worry about. But first, we have to skip the spaghetti one final time. I just realized I've been local recording this entire time. I local recorded in case the, uh, in case there was an issue with the, uh, so starry thing. So I wouldn't lose any footage. The file size on this is going to be fucking enormous. <laughs> oh no. Hmm. Yeah, for real, Wuffle. No, we're not doing that. Oh, 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 Ocean, are you still here? Ocean, Ocean Bagel, are you still here? You are? That's what I wanted to ask you. Is it against the rules to change a music mod through a run? That's what I wanted to ask you. That's a question only you would know because you're, you're the rules guru. Am I allowed to change a music mod mid- It's fine? Alright. Because it is currently Sunday. You know what that means, chat. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do it during Spears too. Nice. I I missed SGS one time in this run. That's genuinely really impressive, considering I had to do it 30 fucking times. Like, that's really good. And we have one final MDS, yep. No astronaut food strats, though. True Hundo does not like astronaut food strats. What are astronaut food strats? You use it to heal and core instead of uh, saving. It's a thing that like a couple of uh, Hotland runners do, but can't do it in here because consumable.
<laughs> Look at all the copium in chat. Imagine he shows up. He waited all the way into the end. He's waited all the way into the end, chat, obviously. I'm crying. He's never coming back. I'm going to leave the fucking ice cream. <laughs> I don't even want to look at that. <laughs> there will be no accidental ice cream incident of the fucking May 15th, 2022. Bro, imagine if I can fucking clam girl one more time, I'll fuck, I will, I will shit myself. Piper? Aw, Abby, I hope you feel better. Yeah, this is a challenge ending. We can't eat any consumables or put on any armor. This is just yield true passives. Now, I can use the pie, uh, so I will be using the pie in Asgore. I can do that. That's, that's, uh, that's allowed, because the pie does not count as a consumable healing item, even though it is. Um, because it doesn't restore HP, it sets HP. And the game only checks for items that restore HP. Yeah, you can do it. You can stay up with me and watch your favorite e-boy finish his run. I believe in you. And then you can get a nice long sleep afterwards that you deserve. I just wanted to confirm that this is the branch. Oh, no, I wasn't talking to you. Sorry, if you thought I was, like, telling you that, no, I was, I was just saying, I was just telling chat. No, you're the one who found it, of course. Issue. Yeah, I've, I'm with you on that, but... That's not really in our control. The ending has already been labeled as Betrayed Undyne. I think Betrayed Undyne should just refer to Betrayed Undyne with date. Because only in those endings are you actually betraying her, right? Like, you, you dated her, and then you went and killed a monster like a jackass. I don't know. I'd call these, I'd call these endings, like, uh, Vengeful Undyne, I think would be better. Called all of these endings Vengeful Undyne, also. Okay. Small little thing I had to do there. Yeah, I like a vengeful undone. Because she's vengeful. <sighs> Here we go.
Wait. Wait for it. Let's go! Seven for seven! I didn't miss a single one! Let's go! Holy shit, that's incredible! Yo, Drunk Shakes with the 10 gift subs. And Wolfo with the 10 gift subs. Holy fuck, dude, that's incredible! 7 for 7 on MDS, what the shit? That is insane, dude. I did not expect to go 7 for 7. I didn't drop it a single time, and I only dropped SGS once! Like, honestly, this run, outside of the beginning, being weird with missing Opera Skip and then missing uh, the Muffet thing. Like, this was so solid. I didn't drop, like, anything major. Other, I also had to die to Metaton once. But this was really solid. Jeez. A couple of mental mistakes. Maybe 15, 20 more minutes, but... What are sub points? 621. And forgetting the pot. Yeah, that's what I was including that. The sans key thing. Are definite uh, mental mistakes. Other than that, I've been pretty on it for most of it. If I learned the category, like knew the route by heart, then I could probably uh, save like another like five minutes off of just not standing still as much over the course of the run. Yeah, the sans key thing isn't really my fault. That's a that's a that's a routing mistake, not really me. Later. Sayonara. I missed one dine once in this run, by the way. Literally one time and it was on a run where <laughs> Yeah, I had a, a dual cycle here. Like, okay. Yeah, this is the last full run. We're getting a neutral ending and then the two last pacifist endings. So it's almost over. I'm not doing Beowulf, by the way. I totally could, but I don't want to. I'm going to be saving a bunch to make sure I don't soft lock or some shit. What's Beowulf? It's a strat in Hotland that requires you to hit 1 HP in the laser rooms. Nobody has run 101%. There are no runs. If you want a world record in Undertale, don't worry. You can run true 101%, the Switch exclusive version, and deal with 1.0 fucking 5 inputs. Yeah, have fun. <laughs> Also, with current rules, you'd only be allowed one 12 hour break, so. Alright, we got hot dog, hot cat, and drop the hot cat. Should have gotten the apron. Oh well. Fuck it. <laughs> nice. Haven't missed it yet. <laughs> Might as well fucking send that shit. Alright, good night, T Wolf. Good luck for the last few hours. It's uh, less than an hour now. Less than an hour left.
What is Brad again? Uh, what was it? Uh, Wiener face was it that you requested me call them? Thank you, Sans. Very cool. I'm proud of you. Hell yeah. You may leave your simping in the mail. Hot cat, didn't know you were in the game. Ooh. Good shit. That's, ooh. That's a clever little, that's a clever little pickup line. Yeah. <laughs> Let's get a full five buffer to end it out. Nice. All right, let's get the Hush Puppy and the only thing I have to left to worry about. Hush Puppy should be my last item. I've gotten everything else from what I could think of. Like, I can't think of any other items that I haven't gotten. I got all of the various equipment at some point in the run. Ten missed north-souths. Total. Ten missed north-south attempts out of, like, the fucking 80 or so I did. Neato. I'm still over the, well, tw what, 26 Tazgors, right? 26, did I get 26 or 25, chat? Was it 26 or 25? I think it was 26, right? Yeah, 26 Tazgors, 7 for 7 on MBS. This guy all the way to the right, right? Yeah. There it is. There's the hush puppy. Hold on, we can still make it 27. It's not over yet. There's no way I'm Taz Goring on this last one. Save and haul, and then we get the sand stuff. Oh, oh, I need to make sure it's uh, skippable text first. That, I gotta do that first. I should set that up first before I, uh, before I start doing the key stuff. I gotta make sure it's skippable. Because I haven't actually touched sand's text on this file. Nice cat ears. Thanks, Flowey. How are you, cutie?
Something suspicious is going on. Nah. I just infected you. It's obviously the vaccine. This is what Joe Brandon wants to do to your children. Don't let your kids play Undertale. It was the goat. Hold on, wait. Just in case. You can never be too safe. Seems like you can't skip Metaton. Shay is the goat. The goat made me gay. Wait, I made you gay? Damn. Was it my attractiveness that did you in? Hey, so remember that cool thing about how uh, Monster Tales text has been skippable, like, the entire run? time ago, a human fell into the ruins. Injured by its fall, the human crawled out for help. Oh! Oh. oh, he's nasty with it. Asriel, the king's son, heard the human's call. He brought the human back to the castle. Then, one day, the human became very ill. The sick human had only one request, to see the flowers from their village. But there was nothing we could do. Azriel, racked with grief, absorbed the human soul. He transformed into a being with incredible power. I'm finally reading the plot, guys. I'm finally reading the text. Are you happy with me? With the human soul, Azrael crossed through the barrier. He carried the human's body into the sunset. Back to the village of the humans. Azrael reached the center of the village. There, he found a bed of golden flowers. He carried the human onto it. Suddenly, screams rang out. The villagers saw Azriel holding the human's body. They thought that he had killed the child. One. The humans attacked him with everything they had. He was struck with blow after blow. Azriel had the power to destroy them all. But... Azriel did not fight back, clutching the human. Azriel smiled and walked away. Wounded, Azriel stumbled home. He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust spread across the garden. The kingdom fell into despair. The king and queen lowercase had lost one had lost two children in one night. The humans had once again taken everything from us. The king, lowercase, decided it was time to end our suffering. Every human who falls down here must die. 
with enough souls, lowercase, we can shatter the barrier forever. It's not long now. King Asgore will do three things. <laughs> you should be smiling too. Aren't you hap excited? Aren't you happy? You're going to be free. Okay, we get the key here. Save, 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 save. Okay, client open. No skip. Okay, first we make this skippable. All right, so we gotta do this now because it, it was a snafu earlier, so we gotta get it now. So, wait for the dialogue, go. Open another client. And remember to save after getting the key. We're gonna take a little bit of time loss here, but we need to get this now because we can't get it. We haven't gotten it yet, and it's the only other place we can get it. Okay. Secret password one. This should just be here in this ending anyway. We should just take this part out of 61 and put it into this ending. Because this, it makes the most sense to do it now. Because otherwise you'll mess up the file flags. Okay. This should be it. So I'm going to skip this one so I can walk backwards and save. Did you just say I'm the legendary fart master? Okay. Keychain. Cool. Have it. Awesome. Save. Now we go. <laughs> I love that's one of my favorite lines of text in the game. I had to read it. <laughs> okay. Now we have the keychain. We're all good. Okay, not too much time loss, honestly. Only uh, less than three minutes. So, cool. Two and a half minutes to do that. And I can use the pie here to lower his defense because it's not a consumable. All right, let's finish this up. Kanye West he likes in his ass. Kanye West he likes the things in his ass. Happy Sunday, chat. He likes big fingers in his Kanye West. He likes fingers in his ass. 
Kanye West, he likes fingers in his ass. He likes big fingers in his... Kanye West, he likes fingers in his ass. Fingers, 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 fingers in his hole. Hey, ho. Hey, ho. Hey. Flowey! Holy shit, fucking Flowey, dude! I forgot! I was like, wow, I'm surprised I'm not losing time yet. And then I looked, I was like, wait, why is the split so late? Oh, right! <laughs> Who the fuck is that guy? <laughs> Hold on, wait, let me get my scene set up properly here. Yes, it was I all along! Fuck! <laughs> Plan with the gift sub to Flowey. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> Hashtag let Flowey say fuck. Right, gang. Time for me to disappear until the next time Asgore appears. That that's going to be a bit. <laughs> and by that I mean he that was the last Asgore of the run. There's no more Asgores. All right, the final Asgore total is 26 Tazgores. 26 out of 81, that's a pretty good ratio. That is over a fourth of my Asgores were Tazgores. I have to do 55 push-ups and Willie has to do 130. Kanye likes it in the booty, he likes it in the booty ass bitch. Hi, Flowey. I didn't miss you. Not at all. Not even a little bit.
Your snap ruined for- oh. <sighs> I mean, I couldn't have known! I couldn't have known! I don't- Turn off notifications, I guess. I mean, I feel bad, but like, you know, it... turn off notifications. I literally just sent that to everybody who had sent me a snap recently, Lance. Holy shit, look how many points are in on this. 300,000 versus fucking 218k. This is it, chat. This is the last house. This is this is the last flowy fight. This is the last neutral ending, the last flowy fight. We've only got true lab. Well, we've got dates and true lab to go. Well, it might not be. Who knows? If I accident, if it's not the fucking challenge ending, it might actually not be my last fucking. <laughs> Imagine if I got the wrong ending and I had to fight Asgore again. I wouldn't have to fight Flowey at least. So there's that. Like the pie counted as a consumable or some shit. Here we go. Right, gang. No. Uh, 50-50. It... Perfectly balanced. Perfectly balanced, as all things should be, of course. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a believer in equality. Right gang gets one, left gang gets one. You know, it's perfectly balanced, like all things should be. The, I mean, uh, excuse me, sorry. The radical left gang, they stole this election by a lot. It was, it was a steal. They stole it. It was the biggest fraud. It was a fraud. It was a fraud. A fraud. They stole it. The radical left gang stole. It was cheating and stealing. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No! I, who were you aiming at? Bro, aim my boy, my my man stanced up aiming about six feet over my fucking head like a fucking silver one counter-strike player learning how the gun works. <laughs> what are you aiming at? <laughs> Alright, chat. This is it. Let me hear the most. Let me see the most roar of an owl spam. I, I want to see. I, I don't even want to be able to read my fucking chat. Let it all go. Every single one of you. O W. Ow. Just spam it to your heart's content. No holds barred. I don't even want to be able to read my Twitch chat, bro. Better make Twitch lag. Come on, is this all you've got? This is all you can do? Weak. Weak!
Faster, chat. Spam harder! Alright, good job. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. That was a pretty good spam. That was that was a no mod spam, and you guys were going pretty fast, so. My mods were big time sleeping. Um, because Fractalette's comparing to my, my PB, not to the current run. The split you're seeing above it is from this run. The run, the next split is from my PB, because I haven't split for it yet. Let me see it. Betrayed Undyne with Challenge. Show it to me. Show me the words. Show me the words. Betrayed Undyne with Challenge. Let me see it. Yes! Yes! All right, let's go. Boat to Snowden first, get the workshop stuff out of the way. That's every neutral ending. We got every single one. All of them are correct, too. And I, could, I can equip armor now if I want to. Yay. All right, first things first, let's go to Snowden before we do any of the dates. Well, Chad, here we go. Mandatory boat to Snowden. <sighs> yeah, best time to do this is now since we have to boat anyway. Unlock the door, and get pranked across time and space. Oh, whew, okay. I thought that was the fucking lock text again. I was about to shit myself. Oh, right, I forgot it puts you here. There we go. I wanted to check to see if I had the don't forget fun value. Waterfall. Ye no, yeah. Date on done, right? I think that only appears if you get Clam Girl, though. You know, the character who mentions... Yeah, that... <laughs> I... <laughs> I remember everybody was thinking, like, speculating what it was, but now that Deltarune's out, it seems 
pretty obvious what it's supposed to be. You know, the, it only shows up when you talk to the character who mentions Susie. Please do the funny. Fine. Ah, oh, I didn't get it. I don't know why that didn't work. I tried for it, though. Hey, hey, Maddie, listen, I tried. And that's what's important. No, no, uh, Illcat, um, you only, you get special text there if you talk to Glam Girl. I didn't get the special text. If you've talked to Clam Girl on that same file and interact with that drawer, it'll say, uh, It'll say, uh, there's a picture with three smiling people saying, don't forget. Wait, is that, the, is that your name? It's Ash? What the, why didn't you tell me? <laughs> I feel like I asked you like three times. That's awesome, that's a great name. How much longer? This is it. We've reached the last part. This is it, this is the last run. And 93 is just like a one minute variation. It's the final countdown. Ba -da -da -dum. Ba -da 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 -dum. Ba -da 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 -dum. Ba -da -da -dum. Ba -da -da -ba -ba -da. Date no, don't don't split. Don't split. I haven't dated Alfie's yet. <laughs> you got me tripping, bro. Okay, gonna lose a lot of time to this split because I had to do the thing with uh Sans. But we get to do this now. Watch this shit. Ready? Filled with determination. <laughs> Alright, time to go maximum power on this date. Twenty six hours. <laughs> Jug boy. I can't be too loud. Jug boy. 
Anime is real. Just in case, like, I forgot to, like, yeah, I was, like, I was pretty sure I'm good. I just wanted to be sure in case I, like, somehow the room was still persistent. <laughs> just needed to be, just double take on that one. It's the end. Jock pussy. This is it. This is it. It's the end. Oh, right. I, there's no wrong over here. One more true lab and one more boss fight. Over. Nah, issue. I think I'm just gonna let it. I like. I like. Uh... Also, I thought. I think you meant. I think you mean respite, not reprise. I'm assuming. Uh, okay, nice wrong word. Let's go. Yes, that's how respite is pronounced. Want to join the VC? Nah, I think I'll just go it alone. I already got potato chips, and I already got bad memory, so. I think we're good in that department. Fuck it, we'll get another one. Just to be sure. What time is it? It's currently 2.30 in the morning. I already know hit credits, yep. Now normally I would skip endogony, but hear me out here. Hear me out, chat. Normally I'd skip this boss and softlock somehow. But I really need to do this. You have no idea how satisfying that was. <laughs> that was very important. <laughs> I had to use the hush puppy. Since this is the one time I don't need to get AYC. I'd never get triple chomp twice in a row, right? That'd be preposterous. Oh. Am I gonna get the double laser eyes? This is so based. Perfectly balanced as all things should be.
Final skip of the run. Success! Underbed. Smell. No way I'm saving time on True Lab, right? Nice. Thank you for being with me through this chat. I love you guys. <laughs> uh, this is all possible because of y'all, just saying. You know, last time I ran True Hundo was not a good point for me, so... To do this again later, far ahead of where I was then, it's an honor. Thanks for getting me to where I am now. Fuck it, faster. More power. good and hey almost an hour faster than last time pretty poggers oh thanks bane i see that i saw that Thanks, Pleb. Oh, God. You guys are gonna make me cry. Uh, I gotta get through Azrael first. Come on, now. Can't hit me with the heavy stuff until I get through... Until I get through Azrael. I need to dodge. I don't have any armor on. <laughs> okay. What I'm about to do is very important. You, you all have to understand the, the grave importance about a, of what I am about to do. Didn't you put on 10 armor? No, we didn't get it in this ending. Aw, you too, Freezer. Square up! 
No. No. I have to do this. No, fuck! <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to do it. Come on! No! <laughs> I have to quad him! This is important. Yes! Okay. We're good. <laughs> Everything's good in the world now. Oh, oh my god, I wasn't on fucking spare, dude. <laughs> I'm not used to that. Alright, let's not fucking waste too much time here. Alright, let's hope. Because I do have no armor. I don't know if I can hit there, wow. I is in slot three. I did not drop a stick. I kind of want to try dodging this to see if I can get sniped in the menu. I couldn't. There wasn't a hole. <laughs> I expected there to be a hole there. There was not. That's okay.
Oh, that was so fucking good. Wow. Jeez. I'm not crying, you're crying. Alright, chat. This is it. <sighs> yes! <laughs> Thank you for doing this with me, chat. Thanks for being here through all of it. I had a great time. Thank you, everybody, for all the kind donations and gift subs and bits and all that stuff. That has been uh, more than a success than I thought it would be. So thank you, really. Keeps me afloat, keeps me going. Love you guys so much. Thank you. Try not to fucking tear up. There's no way I'm not losing 10 years for this Azrael. What? What, did I die to him or something? Chat, convince me to hug the goat. Ah, oh, thank you, captions. Even though I haven't been in this community for as long as Thank you, Wuffle. Thank you, man. Love having you.
one more after this. We do without, and then we end it with. Drunk Shinks donated fifty dollars. This community has been so welcoming and wholesome every time I've been here. I am so happy to have found this place. Without which I would be a different person. From the bottom of my heart, thank you for everything you do. Love you, Shake and Chat. That's so sweet. Thank you, Trunk Shinks. God, guys. Fucking hell. I love you, motherfuckers, so much. Thank you. Here we go. This is it. Hey, you did. Thank you for the 400. Oh, Red Bird with the 500 bits, too. And... Time! <sighs> oh, we did it. Yamanis, you donated $200. I found you while depressed at college and you are one of the few things that kept me going that year. Never stop being you. Pixelon donated $30. Shay FG in chat. Shay LFG in chat. <sighs> Issue, thank you for the $200. Holy shit. Dude, I love having you here, man. Thank you for everything you've done and helping me with the mods and stuff, too. Like, those, the, the dream mod helped my channel an unbelievable amount. The, the popularity spike from that video was crazy. Thank you. I love having you around, man. You're always super awesome. KJ, thank you for the gift sub. And Shammy Wolf, thank you for the five gift subs. And Drunk Shinks, thank you again for the $50. Oh Kuchur, thank you for the 3,031 bits. And also, let me just make sure I get the name right. I'm pretty sure I know who it is, but I want to make sure I'm saying it right. 3A, thank you for the $92. Thank you, guys. We did it. We did it. <sighs> Yo, existing OO, thanks for the 100 bits. <laughs> Great job, now do it blindfolded. Also, I did say thank you for this, but uh, Fixie with the $30 say, says Shay LFG in chat. This will be the, uh, I'm thinking of the pose I should do. I want to get the, the end screen in my screen crop. Yo, Mumu Zane with the one gift sub. <sighs> God, it's gonna a fucking sob. Yo, four cards straight flush. Thank you for the prime gaming. Oh. Redbird with the gift sub, Sarah with the 69 bits. Nice. Wow.
Wow. That wasn't too bad, actually, you know? Other than the Soulless branch where I wanted... Like, honestly, other than Soulless Geno, I had a lot of fun. I really would not have been able to do that part without you guys. I would have lost my sanity. Quinn, that's so sweet. Thank you so much. I don't... I wish I could say as much back, but, like, Jesus. I don't have the words, but thank you. I always appreciate y'all. Thank you, Bob. I appreciate that. Pleb donated five dollars. So when's the next true hunger run chain? <laughs> when's the next one? <laughs> Did you really think it was over? I have to do the special thanks again. Hey, so now that time is called, I can take the soulless file out of my game, right? <laughs> Am I allowed to do that? Yeah. Okay. Cool. I wanna, I wanna have the uh, the regular ending screen. I'll just rename it to, or I'll just take, put it here. Okay. Cool. I've had a blast. Trust me, I've had I've had a great time doing this. And this has been a wonderful experience. I'm glad I decided to do it again. So since we're doing special thanks, first of all, shoutouts big time to all of my fucking mods who have helped so much in keeping everything organized. I I am absolutely fucking nothing without my mods. Like the the shit they do and keeping everything organized for me. I'm terrible at organization, so I appreciate all of them an immense amount. Uh, the people who have always cheered me on, the long time people who have been here ever since like I was like a 10 viewer streamer or whatnot. Thank you for sticking around and believing in me. And the people who have taught me so many things. Each and every single one of you for watching this, thank you. Wouldn't it be possible without y'all? Sir Caticus donated forty-five dollars. A small gift to thank you for everything. Your streams have gotten me through some really tough moments, and I can never thank you enough for that. Sir Caticus, thank you for the five hundred five hundred, yeah, I wish. Uh forty-five dollars. <laughs> thank you. Really. I'm glad, I'm glad the amount of people who have told me, like, my streams get them through hard times and stuff, that makes it all worth it. Everything I've ever put up with, it's all worth it just to hear that, really. So thank you guys for letting me do this as a, as a job. I love you MF so much, I swear I wouldn't be happy with myself or my life without any of your dumbasses. <laughs> Fuck you, platonically Shay love P. Yo, Bane, thanks for the five. <sighs> yeah, that'll be the, uh, that'll be the, the picture, that'll be the, the pose for the Twitter crop. I just want to get the Undertale VN screen. Oh, wait. Hold on. I don't want my fucking hand in the... Maybe I'll do it with my left hand. <sighs> there we go. <sighs> Thank you, guys. <laughs>